Hey everybody, it's me David. Today we're starting a new series. If you guys remember, a couple months ago we did a playthrough of Chrono Cross, um, my favorite JRPG of all time. So I thought I would do that again with another one of my favorite childhood games. So we're going to be starting Legea 2 Dual Saga. So quick backstory before we start the game. This was exactly a like Chrono Cross. I got it as a kid, played it, put in over 100 hours. This is, I could say very safely, my second favorite JRPG of all time, slash probably top five that I've ever played games ever. So it's a pretty good game to me. Um, yeah, just today I got the PS2 emulator, downloaded the ISO, and got it working, got my PS4 controller. Um, so yeah, I know there's a little cutscene. Okay, so here's the little cutscene. I did this with Chrono Cross 2. Um, the cutscenes are kind of a great way to kind of feel out the game. So I do want to watch the cutscene. I know probably a lot of you really like don't care. But I think it's good. Especially for the RPGs. RP like during this time period, RPGs have kind of like a famous little intro going on. So this one is not as good as Chrono Cross's intro. Chrono Cross's intro is actually legendary. But you guys can kind of see that's our main character right there. Music is pretty nice, not as epic. Uh that's uh, probably my favorite character out of the entire game. She's kind of cool. Uh, this guy is very cool too. There's a lot of cool characters in this game, kind of like Chrono Cross. She's also very cool. There, there's a lot of cool characters. Uh, I don't really like him personally, but still cool. Very nice. Got some music going on. That's gonna be our enemy. But no spoilers. I'll let you guys see it for yourself. Alright guys, so that was the opening. Let's actually get started with the game. And just like Chrono Cross, I'm gonna try to keep talking to a minimal. Obviously I'm gonna talk, um, but like right now, there's nothing going on. There's no reason for me to speak, so expect me to be kinda quiet. I'll basically talk when I can or want to. So, just like with every RPG, this is the starting town. It's, of course, just a standard town built out of wood, has a lake, has some form of crystal inside the lake, has some chickens, you know how it is. It's a very nice town, though. And, I'm just gonna let you guys know this another comparison with Chrono Cross. I played Chrono Cross like every year, so I've played it about 70 times. This game I've only played once, and that was in my childhood, so I have not replayed this game. So this is gonna be a first for me, too. You have work today, and your stolen bread practice is starting any minute now. And I'm not doing voices, I'm sorry. I know a lot of people like it when you do voices, but I'm sorry, I can't do that. Alright, so should we stay in bed? Leap out of bed? Wake up. I'm gonna leap out of bed. Gasp. Huh? What? What's happening? Have you forgotten that today is your first day on the job? You're impossible. Apparently we have. Everyone's waiting for you. 
Oops. Alright, so this is our little guy. Um, now, usually I would rush it, but let's make sure we find everything. Most of the rooms... Oh, that's cool, so that's the little village. Nice little feature. That's Hawk. I think that's like the village leader. But anyway, let's head outside. Oh, hello, everybody's outside practicing. Alrighty, let's figure out what they're practicing. Seems like they're doing a little bit of sword fighting. So, I, I like her so far. I do like her. And he's up. That's Galvin. Good, stop. That's enough for today. So I think he's kind of like the military leader of this town. We have a new member starting today. Hey, introduce yourself. So, how do we introduce yourself? Act cool. Introductions are lame. Introductions are lame. Sorry, man. I just don't feel like dealing with that kind of stuff today. Ow. <laughs> you will be respectful. Don't waste your time with childish games. Now introduce yourself. Um, alright, we get to pick our name, let's delete that, I think we're just gonna go with the standard Aqua, how about that? Guys, we did it! We're geniuses. Very nice. I'm Aqua, come on, can we get this over with? Ow. <laughs> you listen to me, with anything you do, how you begin is very important, you remember that. Ow. Is your brain still in sleepy land, you little punk? <laughs> I like them. Moving along. Aston and... You wait here in town. I don't know his name. That is a weird name. So, so, so either Eduardo? Edward? Marcus and Dean, you do the usual patrol hunter's woods. Which is the starting woods area of every RPG. Back to your quarters and get ready. And you, Aqua, you come to see me when you're ready. Got that? Now that's it. Now let's go. Alright, so he's going to be waiting inside of the building for us. Uh, oh, let's help her out. Sure, I'll help you. Okay, whatever. I tried to help. Um, you can't at least, you're right. I tried my best, blah, blah, blah. You may be... Good luck. Okay, so they're nice to me. Uh, apologize. Okay, I got a nickname, Sword Holder. Let's quickly kind of survey the town. Actually, you know what we can do? Let's go talk to him and then we'll survey the town. So he's gonna be in here with the village leader. Aqua, late from day one, what are you thinking? Ow. <laughs> you pull something like that tomorrow and there will be no supper for you. Never thought I'd see the day that I'd be working with you. That little snat nose kid is now a little musketeer wannabe. You're all grown up. Nancy, on the other hand, has grown up rude and brusque. Probably from living with all these fellas. She should act a little more ladylike. Anyway, never mind that. Aqua, come here. There's the old man. You're an adult now and a vigilance corpse member. Once you have a job, it means that you must be a responsible member of society. <sighs> Basic old man stuff. All life in this town depends on the bounty provided by the lake. The lake is always pure and fresh because that stone keeps it so. The aqualith, that miracle, that miraculous rock, sustains the life of this town. We must never forget our gratitude, not for the lake, but for the hunter's woods, the sky, everything. That's right, Dad. Oh, that's his dad. So work hard and don't forget to be grateful. That's the point. Never forget that, Aqua. Today we're patrolling Hunter's Wood. They're coming with us, so get all your stuff ready. Once you're ready, come to the town's gates. Dean and Marcus are already there, so, I should... so I'll look for them. What are you waiting for? Alright. 
Yes, I understand. Let us meet him at the town gates. So, before we go, let's kind of see what's in the town and stuff. Doesn't look like there's much in here but some pigs. Uh, okay. <laughs> they make noises. Man, you gotta love these games. They didn't have much processing power back in the day, but they still had just enough to make those animals. You're one of Galvin's young ones. Your job is very important to know. Bless your child, good luck. Even though these games are so old, they still had little fun features like making animals and noises. I like it. So obviously I'm not going to read every single conversation because um, then I would never finish the game. One town would be an entire episode, so I'm just going to check all the essentials. I'm probably not going to even check the rest of these. Basically what's really important is the two houses down below, which are the shops. So this is the item slash healing shop. Can yoink that we just like basically stole but I guess they don't notice uh, starting this is the best item shop in town I right, come to buy what do we need so we have 500 money right now large rice ball I don't think the game is gonna let us buy anything Phenomenal. okay okay cool. and then I know next door is the weapons and in here we could buy some stuff. What do we have? I wonder what we have now. Right now. Because I don't think we'll need it. Since it's the first area. Oh, and might as well show you guys. This is the main menu. See, this is where the items are going to be. My equipment, which is the stuff that I have on right now. Skills. Config. Or the config is the settings. My skills. Don't have any just yet. Aqua. Gosh, hurry up. You're the new kid, and you act like you own the place. It's your first day. Did you get everything you need? Yes, I am ready. Yeah, I'm ready to go. Are you sure? I bet you don't have medicines and stuff on you. Well, I tried to buy them, but the shop wouldn't let me. So, be grateful. I'll be nice. Hey, thanks for everything. Uh, what's gotten into you? I'm just making sure you don't cause problems for anybody else. I wasn't expecting a thank you. Everyone here? Good. Here we go. Alright, let's get it. We're gonna go into the woods and fight. Now, quick thing. Oh, Aqua. Don't ex overexert yourself. If you get hurt, come back and rest a bit, okay? Now get going. Good luck, Aqua. Um, I did encounter some bugs earlier. Hopefully, they don't happen again. Hoping they don't. You know what? I might even turn off the lights, honestly. Eh, it's always gonna get up. You've never been here before, have you, Aqua? This is Hunter's Wood. The people of Knoll depend on this forest and this living creatures for sustenance. Look at all the wonderful greenery. Breathe in that fresh air. It's beautiful, isn't it? Oh, you've got to be careful. It may look peaceful. There are monsters in this forest. And that's where we come in. But relax. Monsters here aren't much of a threat. No need to get worked up about it. Oh, I don't know about that. He has trouble killing weeds. A rookie like him might get eaten right away. Yeah, I can see that happening. I'm gonna reply modestly. Uh, sure, I don't, uh, I don't want to die yet. I guess I'd better watch myself. What? You must be scared out of your mind. That doesn't sound like you at all. Leave him alone, Dean. Remember your first time? You were shaking in your boots. Me? No way, Captain. Come on, I wasn't scared. Yeah, well, if you say so. He was scared. Everybody knows he was scared. Look, Captain, we're gonna go right up ahead. Come on, Marcus, let's make this quick trip in and out. Good luck, my dudes. 
Sai. What a guy. Well, follow me, Aqua. Alright, I'll give you something, something, something. Okay, we're finally gonna actually start battling. So, y'all are in the party. This is the map. Now, hopefully, this glitch won't happen that I'm thinking about, but I'm not gonna mention it unless it happens. So, our first fight. Claw Ant 1 and Claw Ant 2. Galvin, don't panic now. This is the perfect chance to teach you how to fight. Alright, Aqua. Let's start with the basics. I already know how to fight. So there's tactics run auto battle. Try to the battle. So we choose this to actually battle. So we can use items, defend, or attack. Just like basically every other game. The thing that makes this game different from other games is that you don't just click attack and your person attacks, you actually like do special moves like that. But yeah, so let's do left right. Claw ant one. And choose a target. And he'll do stuff on his own for the tutorial. So yeah, and as you level up and grow bigger, you get more attack slots, and with that you get bigger and better moves. That's kinda how the game works. And that'll be shown off in a little bit once we get our first couple arts. Did you get hit? Here, have some medicine. Alright, so now he's showing us how to heal, go to battle. Yeah, I really wish this would go a little bit faster. Go to items. So the healing powder is what we're going to be using. Alright, leave the rest up to him. Alright, now we're going to begin. Miss Claw is going to attack me, but we're going to use a healing item. See that? Hey. Good thing these enemies weren't much of a threat. Didn't you do badly for your first time? Of course, the music. Heart blocks increased by three, so now we have a third. Alright, so we're just gonna follow the path until we get to our first save point, and then I will fix the glitch. These monsters look tougher than the last ones. Now is the time to teach you some arts. Do just to tell you, and you'll be fine. Okay, good. Next, choose the attack. Choose the attack. I'm trying. All right. So now, depending on like the order of our moves, we like do special moves, right? So now it's telling us right down, right down, which is Blue Moon Buster. Okay, cool. All right, right down, right down. Yeah, I think that's it, right? All right. Now it's his turn. And he's gonna do the same. Alright, so this is a more powerful art. Right, left, right. Sandstorm. Alright. Well, and this one uses AP. Alright, let's do this one. Alright, let's begin. <laughs> Why that guy's taking so much? Watch closely. Sandstorm. No problem. No problem. Well done. There are lots of other parts. Try lots of combos and find them on your own. Alright, cool. So, we're gonna... Alright, that didn't happen last time. It cleared back up. Cool. Ooh. Cool. Alright, well, hopefully it stays that way. 
That would be pretty cool of the game to do that for us. Well, let's start on all these claw crawling around. So now we just gotta do a little bit of grinding. Ow. Hey. <laughs> See that? Hey. So funny how they talk. The first checkpoint should be up ahead, but I guess let's take care of this little horde of bugs first. I think that was last fight here. Why don't we try someplace else? So, let's keep going. And there's our first save point. So, let's go ahead and go to memory card one. And we're get this is my other file. I'm just going to go ahead and overwrite it. Since I don't really need the other one. Oh, yeah, good. Here I go! Ooh, that's a new enemy. Slide trap. I think this this one's probably one of the one of the tougher ones. Let's get back out of that. We definitely want to sand yeah. the ball. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. As that? Yeah. We're not gonna even kill it on one. Yeah. Looks like we take our most of it. Let's run the others over there and head home. All right, so we're gonna catch up with our friends here. Question mark, exclamation mark. Marcus is on the floor. That's not good. Captain, he's in there, grown. That thing, never seen anything like it. Shh, don't talk now. He's in bad shape, Aqua. I'm going to bring Marcus back to town. We've got to get some help right away or else he isn't going to make it. Dane's still somewhere in the forest. You look for him. Where you find him, bring him back to town. I want you both back safe. You hear me? Now get out there and find him. Bro, you're telling me there's a monster that just killed this dude. And he wants me to take care of the dude by myself? Uh, I don't know if that's it, Chief. I'm just gonna be honest. But, hey. Let's... We'll trust the guy, huh? Question mark, exclamation mark. Hey, there's Dean. Here comes your good for nothing kid. Hey, where are the others? Marcus is really her bad. Galvin to come back to town. So that's it, huh? Went off and left me. Did they fake your cough? Dean, here, lean on me. Come on, I'll get back, help you get back to town. Leave me alone. I don't need your help. Cough, grown. Dean. Come on, brother. You're about to die. Ooh, that's something in the bush. Something in the bush. Ah, 
Exclamation mark. Eck. Here comes a big one. And hurt the way I am, I can't even run. Looks like I'm holding you in back. Save yourself, Akko. Get away while you still can. Nah, brother. I'm leaving. I ain't going nowhere. Hey, what are you? What do you think you're doing? Cut it out. I right, square up. That's a big one. Oh, jeez. So this is the thing making all those stupid ants. Alright. Let's go, dude. Let's do a sandstorm right away. Let's go. This music. Oh, I didn't heal, did I? Ouch. Alright, we still have some AP. Let's go. Keep it going. By the pressure. As that. Ouch. Ouch. Shoot. Okay, we can probably attack one more time before we have to heal. We still have plenty of AP. As that. Now. Oh, no, we're not done. Well, that's just a little phase of it, huh? Ouch. That was nothing. No, 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 don't, don't run. Hey, no, 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 don't do that either. Battle, items, heal powder. There we go. Like, I didn't want to do something bad and then die by accident. 200? Okay. Get attacked for about 30. Shoot. But he only has one arm now, which is good. No, no, no. I wanted to do the sandstorm. There we go. As that. Ooh, good thing I healed right there. That would have killed me, probably. I think that's the other arm taken off. Ah! Ah! <sighs> Did I do it? Definitely gonna have to use a healing powder because we're a little close to dying again. Yeah. That all you got? He doesn't do that much damage anyway, honestly. Although we are gonna have to heal again. For sure. Definitely gonna have to heal. Okay, only 13 minutes, not that bad. Do another sandstorm. No, I didn't want to do it on. I didn't want to do it on this. Floor. That's unfortunate. Oh, that one. All right, 
right, it's fine. We can we can attack again and survive probably another another. Yeah, yeah. Try this. No. Or am I just die? Take that too. Yeah. That one hurt. Yeah, that one did hurt quite a bit. But the other two quite quite nice too. Level up, very nice. I like it. Hey kid, give me a hand, will ya? But, let's get this straight, Aqua. You listening, cough. <laughs> Grown. Don't go thinking I owe you or nothing. I could have taken Monster if I wanted to. Easy, cough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the all say. That uh, scene? Hello? First Marcus, and then even Dean. Hey Aqua, that big monster you were talking about, did you, did you really take it down yourself? It was a challenge, but I got through it somehow. Good work. I would have liked to see that, which means we can all sleep easy tonight. Aqua, you must be tired. Go back to your room and rest. That is, that is the nice thing, though. It's like, yeah, we did get attacked. Everyone got really hurt. But in the end, it is dead now, and everybody can- Aqua, I heard you quite the hero today. You saved Dean, right? It's true you took down some huge monster. Yeah, it was hard, but I managed to survive. I didn't switch to proper response from you, Aqua. If only you were always like that. Now go to bed. If you oversleep again, I'm, going to, I'm not going to help you. The thing is dead now. So that's all that matters, right? But! Sadly, I think we're going to leave it off for today. We're about an hour in. Not the video, but me playing... So guys, I think we're going to leave it off there. This was the first episode, the first boss. Hopefully you guys kind of like the game, how it works, how it looks, how it sounds, how it feels. I know I do, so I'm going to keep playing it. Uh, hopefully we'll finish it, just like we did with the Chrono Cross. I'm planning on it, unless like something happens to the game, finally gets deleted, and then I'll probably cry. But guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like the comment, and subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye. Hey everybody, it's David. Today we're going to be continuing Legea 2. So let's get started. Go to bed and take a nap. Let's do it. So this is when the game gets pretty good, in my opinion. So I would pay attention to this cutscene. not allow the ones with the marks to live. Kill the mystics. They're monsters. You mystic. You cursed creature. Foul monster. Everybody, there must be some still left somewhere. Find them. Where are they? Find those mystics. It's all because you were here. Look at what you've done. Done to my town. Hey, look at the mark on his chest. He's one of them. He's a mystic too.
Ah, uh, get him. Kill him. Some foreshadowing, maybe? Aqua. Aqua, are you okay? What happened? You were thrashing around. It's nothing. I'm just a little tired, really. I'm fine. Well, well, scared of nightmares? You're such a child. See? Now go to bed. You have to be on time tomorrow, otherwise you'll be in trouble. So, we finally get that the mark on his chest means something. It's not just there as like a cool tattoo. It means something. And the guy on screen, well, we'll find later. But that scene of the dream, where was that? I've never seen that town before. But that all of all, everything you just saw does mean something. Something about Mystic. What was that about? And even that like character with the blue hair is pretty. He's pretty important. Paco, you, you're up early today. Nancy isn't done making breakfast yet. Have a seat. Captain, it's an emergency. I wonder who showed up to town, huh? Oh, no one showed up to town. The guy's just dead. My husband. Will my husband be alright? This is very severe. I'll need to get dad on this. What happened? Moaned. A strange man in Hunter's Wood out of nowhere, Birdo. No, that was... It was not a man. It was a demon. Nancy. Nancy Aston, you take care of the rest. Eduard. Here we go. Go where? Where do you think? Hunter's Wood. Aqua, you... Let's wait for his instructions. You stand by in town. I won't have the time or energy to look after you today. Obviously, we're still gonna go. Hey, Aqua, what are you doing just standing there? Come on, hold that. Oh god. Don't worry about Mr. Buerto. He may not look like it, but Grandpa Hawk was an excellent doctor once. Aqua, you killed that monster yesterday in Hunter's Wood, right? I don't know why how this could have happened. Good grief. Are you or n are you or are you not an official member of the Vigilance Corps? It's your job to protect the town from monsters and other dangers. You're in no position to stay, you know. Or in say you don't know. Come on, Nancy. Aqua just started yesterday. You shouldn't be so hard on him. I know that, but still. Sorry, it's been ages since my last operation. Mr. Hawk, my husband, is my husband? Question mark. He'll be fine. He'll live. He should stay in bed for a while, but he should be okay. Sorry, Mr. Hawk. Thank you so much. What a cool guy. A wound that, that seriously may not have been caused by usual monsters in the area. I see Galvin has gone out there. Hope that he is safe. Now let's go to Hunter's Wood. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to Hunter's Wood to check it out. Aqua, weren't you told to wait in town? Of course, I'm worried about Father and everyone else, but I won't let you act selfishly. I think it's time to go now. Fine, Aqua. I'll take care of the things at this end. You'll go, you go and help out the leader of the re and the rest of them. Ask them. Let's get it. Yeah, I said to wait for his instructions this time, 
but he's not here to give us instructions this time. So, wait, Aqua. If you're going, if you're going, make sure you're well prepared, okay? About father, we're counting on you. Alrighty. Let's get it. So, we're just going to stop by the shops. Uh, see if we can upgrade any of our stuff. So first, let's go to the weapon shop. See what's good here. Oh, forgot that I open the doors and then I go inside. So what do I have now? This is what I have now. Okay. Let's go see what we can buy. Why? Why? This is a man. This is a man's time to shine. Isn't that right, Aqua? Let's come and buy. Okay, so I figured out how to buy. You actually have to press left so you can get one of those. So let's buy one of those. Let's buy some short boots. And that is base... You know what? No, no, no. Let's not buy short boots. Yeah, so let's buy all that. I do want to save some money for items. Keep keep our town safe. I do want to... Uh, yeah, get some items. So Increase that. Increase that. Increase that. Alright. Oh, man. Could use an accessory. But I'm thinking we shouldn't just blow all of our money just yet. Because we need to buy some of this stuff. So we got seven at the moment. Um, probably buy... Um, let's buy four. Let's buy four of these. And... Yeah, we'll be, we'll be fine with that. Yeah. Alright, cool. Alright, let us get going. And I know I could sell my items and... Hmm, we'll be fine. It's, it's not going to matter way, way too much. Uh, that increase in step by one could help quite a bit. But it's not like super duper, super, super, super important. So... Let's see what type of monsters are in here now. Uh oh! Oh, that sucks. We got ambushed by a fly trap. Edward. Ed I don't know how to say his name, man. It's too late. Wait, what do you mean it's too late? It's not too late to save, though. Galvin. Oh, that's not good. Hey, it's the guy from our dreams. Look at that. Aqua, why didn't you... Oof. Run. Looks like we're gonna try to fight him. Yeah, I'm getting the feeling he's not gonna really let us too much. I what know the? I hit him. I know I hit him. Demon. 
not a demon. It is the pure embodiment of power, origin. Are of the same breed. You should know what that mark on your chest means. The same race, you and me. It's a guy from our dreams. That's right. The same race. That's why you have that mark too. It's proof you're one of us. The chosen ones. The mystic. And now I ask you, have you seen a stone that looks like this? Hey, okay, that stone. It's a stone that's in our lake. The lake everlasting, pure as crystal. We have the aqua to thank for that. We can't let him know where the crystal is. The lake in town is it? That's quite near. Oh, he just read our mind. What a madman. Hey, wait, where do you think you're going? To the town in your thoughts. There's a sacred stone there that I've been looking for. When I get the final sacred stone, the old race will perish and it will be the it will be the dawn of the new era at last. You're not getting past me. Not after what you did to my friends and to Galvin. I'm not going to let you get away with it. Not going to let me get away with it. Your friends, what in the world are you talking about? Can you stand there and tell me you've honestly believed that they're your friends? Our destinies are bound together by the mark on your chest, and yet you still dare to go against me. I don't want to hear it. I'm not anything like a monster, like you. A monster, you call me? A monster? Mercilessly, just because we have power. Say the thing, same things those humans did. Exactly the same. Why? You killed him. He's one of our own race. This man, he's the one that holds the power of Galay. Galay? If you let him live, he'll only get in your way. You think this man could get in my way? Nothing could be a threat to my power. Impossible. I'm not letting you get away. I don't think that's how I don't, I don't I don't think that's how it works. Hey, wake up, you.
Oh, is it? Looks like he got his stone. That sucks. Soon, it shall begin. Looks like he got a stone, which... That's not good. That's not good at all. Dude, the music is really happy, but... I'm pretty sure this town source of life literally just got ripped from them, so... Aqua. Aqua, you're awake. have to get following. What happened? I thought that monster. A chest. Not a scratch on me. What, what was was I dreaming? Aqua. If you had died, I don't know what I would have done. I'm so glad. Galvin, I... Aston. Got to Hunter's Woods just in time. But too late for Edward, unfortunately. Can't believe you've been asleep for five days. You couldn't find any wounds, but you wouldn't wake up at all. You don't know how worried we were. You must be starving, right? Of course you are sleeping all this time. I'll go and make you something right away. Hey, it's too soon for you to be walking, boy. You don't you don't look injured, but that doesn't mean there's nothing wrong with you. Take it easy and rest up. Alright, let's go talk to some people. Aqua, you sure you shouldn't be lying down? I can't believe it, Marcus. Dean and now Edward. Dean, pfft. Aqua, you still alive? I was sure you were a goner. Yeah, I managed to make it, but they tell me I've been sleeping for five days straight. Some luck you've got. That's what happens when you always show off. You should stick to killing bugs. Boy. I see what she's doing. Well, what are you wandering around for? You obviously had to take it easy. You were asleep all this time. Are you hungry? I'll whip up something nutritious for you. Aqua, you regain consciousness. I am relieved indeed. Cool. Real quickly, I know we this isn't like... I'm guessing if we go and look at the town now, the stone will be missing. How much you wanna bet? Will it not let us see the town? Oh. But I did see something in the corner of my eye. A nice little grave. Which sucks. Aqua, you're up already. The inscription on the gravestone reads, Here lies Edward, in eternal rest. And that sucks. Alright, let's run over to the lake. I wanted to break the news to you later, if you, but I guess you've seen it already. While uh, you weren't unconscious, the man from Hunters would showed up and stole the Aqualith from the lake. Our life here depended on the Aqualith. Without it, we are through.
The corpse is in shambles. The aquilith's gone. What are we supposed to do now? The future shirt isn't looking too bright. Man, how could they steal the aqualith? It has aqua in it, man. Literally my name. My stone. <laughs> My name on it is my stone. What can I do? What can I possibly hope to achieve? Bro, we're gonna get back my stone. But if I could only get the stone, I might be able to save the town. But do I have any chance of winning against the man with such powers? Against that monster. Just, just sitting here isn't going to accomplish anything. I'm going. I don't know if I can get it back. But I'm going after the Aqualith. It's locked. Boy, why y'all have your doors locked? I thought you were trying to make me dinner. Bro, why are all these doors locked? Bro, all these doors are locked. Well, I guess we're just gonna get going without saying Biden. This is locked. Locked. Aqua. Where do you think you're off to all by yourself and so early in the morning? I'm just gonna be honest, I'm going to get it back. I'm going to track down that man and bring back the Aqualift. Finally, you wake up, and now you're really a piece of work, boy. Nothing I will, s nothing I say will stop you, will it, Aqua? Go do it, you must. Father, wait. And you? He wasn't human. He was a monster. How can you possibly hope to win? Nancy, it's not a matter of win or lose. There are times when a man just can't back down. You must try and understand that. But. Aqua, take the sword with you. Can't acquire the hammer blade. It's old, but the blade still packs a punch. It's not much of a partial parting gift for such an undertaking, but I hope it proves useful. You should also take this with you. The wind's talisman. I heard from Aston that the man went towards Gale Canyon. You'll need this to pass through here. Wind's talisman. Now, don't you worry about the town you hear. I might be in trouble, but leave it to me to hold down the fort while you're gone. Father. Sigh. Men. Go do what you have to, but you'd better promise you'll be back. If you don't, if you don't come back, I'll never forgive you. I'll be waiting for you, boy. Godspeed. Alright, let's go get that stone back, my dudes. It's our stone. It's my stone. Nobody's gonna take that. Alright, so we can go to Willers Town. So we can go to Gale Canyon or Hunter's Wood. Obviously, we're gonna go to Gale's Canyon. Real quick, though. Pop a quick save. You feel? If something happens to the gameplay, I really don't wanna... Don't wanna do all that dialogue again. Alright, let's head over to Gale Canyon. And also, actually no, we're good. We'll, we'll switch our items once we get into the Gale Canyon. Because I'm pretty sure we got to equip the talisman. Alright. Pickpocket charm? Yeah, so this is when we equip it, I think, since the winds are so strong. Yeah, so we use the wind's talisman. And it basically just gets rid of the wind for us. So I don't know if it actually gets rid- the winds have stopped. Okay, I was wondering, did, does it stop the wind or does it just make us immune to the wind? I wonder if it has anything to do with the wind talisman. It sure does, my guy. It sure does. Alright, so we found the pickpocket charm. I'm pretty sure we can equip that bad boy. Oh, I love these characters. Like, if you guys remember Chrono Cross, like the, the divas, this is basically the divas of this game. 
like Noah's, uh, Zoa, and um, other girl. But we got your boy Bubba. Are we really going through Elliot? We got Bubba, Elliot. Yes, that's the only place we haven't searched yet. What's the matter, Bubba? Don't tell me you're. And the Marine. Those are the things. Don't tell me you're scared for a big brawly guy. You sure are worse sometimes. It's not his fault, Marine. After all, he's not a mystic like us. He 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 he. You're right, of course, my brother. He may be big, but he's just a regular human. Hey, that's nasty little pet of yours. What do you call it? Alpha? Elfin? Pet? Alpha's not just a pet, and now you cross the line. You're gonna get it, you little pig. I'll make sure you pay someday. Hmm. If you had something you wanted to say, Bubba, I don't think so. Well, go on. Start searching. My sister and I are tired. If you find a mystic, come back here and get us, okay? Oh, just you wait. You think you can push me around? I'm gonna get you two. One of these days. Didn't you hear my brother? I certainly hope you haven't forgotten who saved you from the life in the dungeons, hmm? Then again, maybe you want to go back to that smelly hole. Come on, Elfin. Gale Canyon. Alrighty. Quickly, let's go ahead and equip the pickpocket charm. There you go. I'm gonna end off the episode here, guys. Guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as well as the channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye. Hey, everybody, it's David. Today we're gonna be continuing Legaya 2. So let's get started. There seems to be a chest over here. Poison Pure. Alright, our first enemy. Uh -oh. oh, I got an ambush. Backy one and backy two. These are like little cavemen. Why did they get to attack first? That's not fair. Why did I get ambush? So these things are weak, but they hit me multiple times, which kind of sucks. But it's okay. We'll use Blue Moon Blaster. Man, these things are fast. It's okay though. It should be pretty weak, yeah. Alright! It just kinda sucks that we got ambushed too. Yeah, see they can they can try to block, but if we're talking about like offensive wise, we just got the hammer sword. That boy doesn't have as much agility or speed, but that thing sure does. Just like, just like, a vulture, okay. That is a new... Hopefully it doesn't one-shot me. Let's go ahead and use Sandstorm just in case. Although it might be... Claw bites. Ooh, ooh. Okay, that does quite a bit of damage. Hopefully the thing isn't immune to Sandstorm. No, it's not. Okay, good. I think if it attacks again, we could live. No, let's not do it. Let's do Blue Moon Bus. There we go. Yeah, we, we'll live through the attack, though. Especially since we defended one of the attacks. There we go. Dead birdie. That one hurt. Alright, lots of XP. Got a new level and got some almond iron ore. Truly is a shame. Let's see, what do I put? Rock Golem, that is a new monster. And, fun fact probably my favorite enemy in the entire game. I just, it looks so cool, man. Look at it. That is so cool. Let's fight it. Alright, we do quite a bit of damage to it, but it's also quite strong. Dude, look how cool that is, man. And it also does quite a bit of damage. Alright, so we did less than half of its HP. So let's go ahead and do Sandstorm, and hopefully 
Ah, uh, no, Samson's not gonna kill it. That is really close to killing it, but not there yet. But yeah, this, this boy does quite a bit of damage. Let's just use... Oh, no, 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 no. Let's not do that. Let's use Blue Moon Buster. There we go. Although, we can just attack normally and do it. I'm just... I do want to set up the Blue Moon Buster for like, the next fight, because it's probably not going to be a big win, you know? Points received. Poison cure, very nice. What is this? What are we? I don't think that's a point. Okay, so, I mean... Trip. Okay, now we're gonna fight it. A lips. What does this thing do? A skate master? Boy, why are you about to run from me like that? Wasted my time. Swear. Let's go ahead and save. And I know saving heals you, so it was a little bit of a waste of uh, healing, but I'm not too worried about it. It's a Yeti! Elfin. I was gonna have to fight Elfin. Ouch, ouch, ouch. That thing's big. I still ha have it. Hopefully he doesn't. Oh. I killed us, are you kidding me, man? Through this. How could this happen? Alright guys, I think what we're gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to uh grind a little bit. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stay around this area and just grind monsters. Try to get another level up. So let's go ahead and I guess try the battle one more time. Because I think he can do more than 300. <laughs> That is way too much damage, man. Like, I really, I don't know how to survive this. Okay, guys, so here's the plan. We got killed again. We survived a very long time that time, but we did get killed again. And I'm kind of Googling things, and it's basically telling me that I need to make it to at least level 10. I'm level 8. Meaning we're going to have to grind this place but another thing that i didn't think of at all is that i got taught two arts but i don't know why i didn't think if there are other arts <laughs> like i don't know why i haven't been trying them or finding out new ones so what we're gonna do i'm gonna do a bit of grinding and we're gonna get some new oh, arts no. here baki okay that these are really good to have new arts against so let's battle attack so we're gonna do the hawk stroke, which is left down down. Let's try this. Oh, he's gonna gimme gimme. Heal powder stolen. I'm gonna get that bag, boy. Ow, 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 ow. Alright, so this should be hawk stroke. New art. Alright, that is a new art right there. Let's attack. Let's get another new art. So it's down. Left, left. This should be a blade damage. It's over. Hey. Oh. Okay, well, that's fine because it gives us another chance to figure out another one. So let's do uh, up, right, up. 
That'll give us Mountain Crush, I think. That one actually did quite a bit of damage. All right. All right. Well, there are three new arts. We got Hawk Stroke, Blade Dance, and Mountain Crush, which is nice. Here I go! Here I go! Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Here I go! Here I go! Here I go! Here I go! All right, guys, we hit level nine, meaning our we got another block uh, that we could use now, which is really, really cool. So we're going to be learning a few more arts here. I think we've got we've got three more to learn. Here I go. All right, so we've got a rock golem here. Let's see how strong these really are. So battle, attack. So now we got four. Let's try the first one. Up, up, right, right. See how strong this one is. A new art. Ooh, that is a lot stronger than the other ones before. That is for sure. I didn't realize it was a second hit. That, that boy did quite a bit of damage. All right, let's try another one. So let's go ahead and do up, down, down, up. True Moon Slash. Let's see how much this does. 400. Ugh. Boy. That does quite a bit of damage, actually. I'm pretty sure that will be able to uh, one-shot uh, basically everything except the golem. I know it'll one-shot the bird. Hopefully we get a bird, because we have one more to learn, and I want to one-shot it, possibly. Do it! Oh! It looks like we actually got more to learn, actually, because I just see... Okay, well, let's do this one for now. Down, up, up, left. So this should be pretty cool. That is pretty cool, actually. All right, everybody. So hopefully that will give us enough power. So we're level 9. Uh... Yeah, we got the new arts, which should do quite a bit more damage. We leveled up once, hopefully that'll give us a little bit more. Uh, actually, we should probably heal real quick. Got a bit more defense. I think I think we got this this time. I think, I think we can beat him this time. I think we could actually beat him this time. We just gotta play smart. He won't one-shot us anymore, I don't think. Let's battle, attack. Um, let's go ahead and use Red Whirlwind. This should do quite a bit of damage. That is a lot more damage. Yeah. Okay, okay, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Now we're doing... Ooch, ooch, ouch, ooch. Now we're doing some damage. Alright, but looks like we can't really... Do anything too big, so now we're gonna do Mountain Crusher. And then do that. Man, we're doing we're doing quite a bit of damage now. Okay, let's go ahead and we're not gonna play too aggressive. We're gonna go ahead and heal. We don't want to do anything dumb. We don't want to get ourselves killed. Like I said, I want to win this battle. Now that we're leveled up enough, I want to win this battle. All right, I think we can attack. We have 20. All right, we're going to have to do another Mountain Crush because we need to get some more AP going. Oh, that did quite a bit of damage right there. 240. I'll take it. Okay, he's going to challenge. It's basically just going to take our AP away. That's completely fine. It basically just gives us another turn to attack the crap out of us. That's sad that that didn't do any damage, actually. That's pretty sad. We're definitely gonna have to heal after that one. Don't. He still hasn't pulled any of his like special abilities, so that's the thing I'm trying to avoid. If he does death hug, this is exactly what I was trying to avoid. I know. 
that does quite a bit of damage. So we're gonna go ahead and heal again. We're probably gonna use quite a number of healing powders here. He's gonna probably attack again, yep. And what we're gonna do is gonna healing powder one more time, get ourselves back up. There we go. And hopefully... What is he gonna do? Okay, he's gonna attack normally. Alright, that's pretty good. Let's go ahead and attack. I need all my hits to hit. Okay, that's really, really good. Every Ooh, 300. Everything hit. Okay, is he gonna challenge? Alright, that's perfect. That's exactly what I needed him to do. Although it does suck that we can't use any of our new abilities, it basically just gives us minimum like 200 free damage. Okay, that hurt quite a bit. I think now it's time to use, because I think we're like the final stretch hopefully. We can use the leaf, get ourselves to full, and try to get some big burst damage down. Okay, that wasn't too much. That wasn't too much. Better an attack, do that same thing again. Don't block! Okay, good, he didn't block that one. He did block one of the shots. Ouch, 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 ouch. Man, I really wanna... I really wanna do a special move, but I think I need to heal. If he does death hug, we're dead. If he does dynamic hip, we're probably dead. Death hug, oh, okay. Okay, I, th I think I'm able to attack and use Red Whirlwind. No, we'll do True Moon Slash this time. I think this should do quite a bit of damage. 400, yeah, that is. Alright, he's gonna take... He's gonna take our MP or AP away, but we literally just used all of it. So it does not matter. Come on, did I do mountain crusher right? Up, left, up. Yeah. There you go. He, he blocked a couple of our hits. That sucks. Ow. Daddy. He hits so much, it's incredible. Alright, we're gonna leaf again, I think. Like, if he doesn't die sometime soon, I'd be very surprised. High power trigger. Okay. Then, that does mean we guard. There we go. And this shouldn't do as much damage as it did before. Never mind, I'm lying. That still does crap ton of damage. Not as much as before. Before we would probably die from that, but it still does, I think, more than half of our HP. Got it. Okay. Heal one more time. We, we basically, I want to stay 300 and above because dynamic hip can kill me. He does this again, man. Guard. Zero, zero. Okay, that's really, really good. We blocked two of his hits. That's really, really good. Alright, we can get another attack in. And most of these shots are hitting. Alright, that's really, really good. Every single shot hit. Perfect. Yes! I gotta keep going. Got him. God. I don't know why they made level 10. Let's get it. I don't know why they made the first, like, b this is basically the second boss, why they made him so hard. Like, that was a fairly hard boss, like, not lying, that was fairly hard. What? Ah. Uh, <laughs> my beautiful, my dearest, Elfin, it just attacked me, it's not my fault. Elfin. Why you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, alright boy, step up. Kill you for this, Elfin. Don't you dare. That boy there, he has the mark. Ooh, I never expected to find a mystic way out here. How fortunate we are, Marine. So true, my brother, so very true. What's the matter, Bubba? 
What happened to your little beastie? Haha, uh, don't tell me it's dead. That's why you're crying? Bubba, you're such a wuss. I can't take anymore, you little pig. I ought to. Hmm. What's this now? I don't think I like your attitude. I don't think you understand your position. You don't ever, ever talk to me like that. My apologies, dear sister. My underling seems to have forgotten his place. He be but enough of him, that mark on your chest, you're a mystic, aren't you, young man? You're just like Marine and I, surely you can see that we're nothing like that lowly human cowering over there, can't you? We're looking for people like us, people worthy of living in the paradise we're gonna turn this dirty world into. What do you say? You're welcome to join us if you want. You're very lucky we found you. That's right, we cheat our sl I mean, subordinates very well. Politely decline. I've got something I have to find. I don't mean to be rude, but no thanks. What? You're turning us down. Could you be any more stupid? Just who the hell do you think you are? You've got no right to decline. You have no idea what you've gotten yourself into. I think it's time for us to teach this young man a lesson. Ready, Marine. Ready, Elliot. You better be ready too, little man. To witness our special sibling bonds. That's gonna be a yikes for me. Now, I don't know if we're able to defeat these two. I have doubts. Alright, let's go ahead and red. Ooh, no, it's True Moon Slash. Um. Elliot. It's True Moon Slash Elliot. Although, I don't think it's gonna let us live. That, that must, must be. be. Just like that man. <laughs> He's cowering at the power of our origins. Don't forget, Marianne. It's only just begun. Now, let us engage you in our dance of death. How unbecoming. Okay, we're actually doing quite a bit of damage. Is that all you got? What the fuck? What is that gonna do? Oh, she increased her strength. Okay, let's go ahead and use a leaf. No! I need I need to use the leaf. I need to use the leaf. Okay, good. I was like, that's actually kinda good though. Because I used the leaf after she attacked. Zero. Hyper art. That literally did almost nothing. That did almost nothing. Alright, and we can do... Oh, no, no, no. We can do another... Yeah, we can do another hyper attack. Okay, two of those did zero, which kind of sucks. God, that sucks. A two, a two of those did zero. So we got good luck, but then... Probably got some pretty bad luck. Okay. Alright, we have to do another Mountain Crusher. Hopefully more of these land. Of course I didn't land. Alright. Please. Oh, okay. Dark Smash. I don't know about this one. I think we might be dead. Beautiful. How much damage does that do? Is that all you got? This is a 
good time to try our new move on the slab rat. Wouldn't you agree, Elliot? Excellent idea. I will begin. Ready, Marianne? Ready, Elliot. Here comes our marvelous move! Oh, oh, it. Oh, 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 oh. Here I go! Very elegant, Marianne. Thank you, I got that from you. That sucks. <laughs> Are you sure he was a mystic? He was certainly no match for us. I think I think he's still alive. Whoa! He's mine. Let me finish him off. Let me avenge Elvin's death. Elfin's death. Oh, shut up. There's nothing left for you to do, Bubba. Just be quiet and behave. Why don't you bury your ugly little pet? I can't stand the sight of it. Why? One of these days I'm gonna slow rest you over a... Take a look at the mark on his chest. It's really something. A lot of good a lot of good it did him. He probably had it tattooed on. It's meaningless. It means nothing. It means absolutely nothing. It means absolutely Alright, stop jumping on me, jeez. Ah. Well, well, load him and get him ready for travel. We're taking him back to the castle. We're gonna break his spirit and turn him into a loyal subordinate. Absolutely, we'll turn him into our loyal subordinate. Well, that doesn't sound very nice. Did we actually kill his pet? I didn't realize we killed the thing. Where are they taking me? Alright, we're in the castle now. So guys, I think this is gonna be a good time to end off for today. So guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like and a comment as this person on the channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye. Hey everybody, it's David. Welcome to another episode of Legea 2. Uh, so last episode, we fought some weird gorilla thing and then got beat up by two sisters. Now we're in jail. So let's see what's going on. We just saved. Get a move on. There, ugly little witch. Now, now, Marion. She's a mystic too, after all. Grr. You're too soft hearted, Elliot. Ugly little witch. I'm going to give that one a solid yikes. What? What's going on? What the? It's you. <laughs> we killed his little... It, actually, that's the dude that owned the gorilla, and we killed his gorilla. You know, you could have just opened the door, right? What a shabby little prison. I got permission, you know. Permission to get revenge. Revenge on you for killing my poor elfin. You'll taste my wrath. If I only had my sword. What a mess. Well, it looks like we won't be able to use this prison cell anymore. Yeah, because this stupid guy... ...kicked the door down for some apparent reason. Ow. Girl, take that and that. Ah. 
That's just enough, Bubba. He's unconscious already. We're gonna make him our slave. Uh, I mean, servant. So we don't want you to kill him. Are you so really uh, so upset for losing your pet? If you want, I could buy you a new one. Elfin wasn't just a pet. Elfin and I were tied by the bonds of true love. Elfin, my poor Elfin. Sabop, you can never understand how we felt about each other. Who this? But even so, Bubba, killing him won't bring you what you lost. Bishop Goblin. I understand how you feel, but that man is a mystic, and you know I've told you time and again. That mystics are messengers of the gods, being sent by the gods to bring eternal paradise to this world. A mystic's life is far more important than yours, let alone an animal's life. Learn your place. Oh my, what a, what a sorry shape you're in. You poor thing, what have they done to you? Well, are you awake now? Here, I'll have your chains undone. Where am I? You're in the town I rule. Darakin. This is my castle, Doplin Castle. I'll have to keep you prisoner for a while. Huh? Prisoner? You're not too swift, are you? I'll explain it to you real nice, so even a monkey could understand. You lost and were brought here. We're not going to train you to be our faithful, I mean, servant. I won't be your servant. Absolutely no way. I'll never be your servant. That's what they always say. That's what always. That's what they always say. Do you know what happens to those that resist like that? They all end up saying. Forgive me, I'll do anything you say. Well, there are a few who resist to the end, and wind up dead. It certainly is a fine mark he's got there. I bet he holds quite an amazing origin. That's the thing, Bishop Doplin. He won't show us his origin. Maybe we should have gone a little easier on him. Grr. Elliot, you're too soft-hearted for your own good. He's just trying to make fools of us. If I really got serious, I could make him do anything I wanted. Now, now, I get it. I can see both of you are serious. Now, leave him be for a bit. If he gets damaged before we show him to Avalon, he'll be mad at me. Can't have that. Avalon? Yeah, the greatest mystic of all, chosen by the Supreme Origin. He is our leader. He'll turn this chaos, impure world into a true utopia. You'll understand when you meet him. You'll see his absolute power for yourself. Undo his chains and let him rest in the prison. He'll be one of us in the future. Treat him well, dear. I heard you found a new mystic bishop. Oh, Velna. Yeah, I imagine Avalon will be pleased. Yes, I'm sure. I've made preparations for a celebration in the central building. Oh, a celebration, you say? How delightful. And you lot, come along. That's quite a wonderful feat, finding a mystic like that. Great job, Mr. Bubba, and to think you're one you were once a prisoner under a life sentence. I'm sorry, that was rude of me. Please forgive me. How exciting. This land will be s will soon see the arrival of a new era. A new era. Mystics. The heck with all that. Damn him. He killed my elfin, my poor elfin. I can't imagine a future without my elfin. Kill you. Kill you. Stop, please, Mr. Bubba. If you kill him, we'll be blamed. Can't stand this. Can't take it anymore. You guys take care of him. Grrr. Come on, brother. Don't break all the walls. Whew, Bubba sure is a bet is in a bad mood today. Yeah, what's wrong with the bishop? What, what possible use could he have for a brat like this? 
Are mystics really worth all this fuss? Well, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Let's put him in the room over there. Oh, sick! It's like my favorite character in the game! I'm actually pretty excited about this one. Gasp. Who, who are you? Alright, so her default name is Maya, and I know I renamed Lang or Yang or whatever to Aqua, but I actually, I really like the name Maya for her, so I'm actually going to keep it as Maya. Yeah, I think that's a really fitting name for her. Maya. My name's Aqua. You can't talk. Hey, that power, the power you just showed me. What exactly was that? That's her origin. Whoa! What the? What's that thing? Do not be frightened. I am Rebus, the life origin that lives inside Maya. You too are a mystic, are you not? Yeah, yeah, they said so too. That I was a mystic. Could I really be a mystic? You're not aware of it yet, but that mark on your chest. Yeah, what is that thing? That thing is a sign of another you that lives inside you. It stands for your origin. My origin. Are you telling me there's a monster like you living inside me? I don't believe you. No way there's any monster inside me. This mark is just a plain old birthmark. It's not what you say it is. I'm not a mystic. Stop saying that. I'm not a mystic, I tell you. I do understand what you are feeling now, but all the same, you are a mystic. Nobody can change the simple truth. Please accept. Shut up. No way. Just disappear, why don't you? I am. Could I really be like them? Just because I have some birthmark on my chest, does that mean I'm not, does that mean I'm like them? No way, I'm not like any of them. I'm not a mystic. <sighs> sure are, buddy. Sure are. Can't just hang around here forever. I've got to find some way to get out of here. But it looks like they took away all my weapons and items. What am I going to do? Oh, that's right. He punched a hole in the wall. Alright, let's see what Maya's up to. Really seems to be sleeping. Say, this door's pretty wobbly. Hey, maybe I can break it. I think I'll give it another try. Yeah! Come on, let's break this boy down. Let's get it. Ouch. Maybe a little more. One more time. And... Boom. Funny thing is... The crack in the wall is nowhere near the hinges or the lock on the door. It made a whole lot of noise, but it doesn't look like anybody noticed. So, like, that crack really shouldn't affect the door, because it didn't break the hinges or the lock. But, hey. Hey, now, what do I do about her? It's not my problem. She's mystic just like they are. Anyway, I've got to get out of here fast. But still. I'm bring her along, dude. I bet they treat her pretty badly, just like they treated me. No, I can't just leave her here. Um, why don't you come with me? We'll get out of here together. Hmm. 
Come on, I'm not gonna leave you here. My yes, all right, we got Maya. Cool. So right now, okay, we both we don't have our items, but we have full HP. And Maya's gonna be definitely a character I'm gonna keep in my party throughout the game. So expect her to be here. Okay, this was the one we were originally in. Uh, let's save real quick. Seems to be quite a little monster. A little spooky, a little spooky. Alright, I'm sure. There's gotta be. Ooh, there are monsters in there. Okay, let's take all this. Alright, so we got all that restored. Take it. This is a fit. HP decreased. Dang it, man. Let's take it. Okay, cool. Okay, we're back. We're back in it, baby. Hey! Oh, hey, we got everything back. Alright, we got all of our items back. Look at that. Alright, so, Origin. We don't know, we don't know our origin, but we know Reva. Equipment. Um, we can get another sharp hit rate up. Okay, let's equip that. We don't have room for another. Okay, and this is what she has. Alright, cool. And actually, let's check the skills real quick. Does she have... Okay, she doesn't have any skills. We have Item Thief, but... Alright, cool. So we got our items back. I think now we can actually... Alright, I guess let's head back upstairs. What? Ah, there's a guard. You, how did you manage to get out? Well, sucks for you, because I got my sword now, boy. Let's get it. Battle, attack. Alright, let's do Mountain Crusher. Yeah, Dolphin 1. Okay, so, Origin, Life Blessing. Alright, let's just guard with her, because there's really no reason for her to attack. Aw, oh, man, he's so close to being dead. Oh, actually, he is dead. I forgot that we have one more attack afterwards. Okay. She was guarding, so that's... What is she doing? Oh, she's... Okay. That was a really slow guard. Yeah, she probably would have taken even less damage if she would have guarded earlier. Dude, are you serious? This guy just took no damage from two of our hits. That's a little bit annoying. Guard. Slash. No problem. No problem. Nice. Right, let's keep going. I'm pretty sure there's nothing in here, so I'm just gonna keep yoinking it this way. Alright, and there is random battles in here, I'm guessing just guards. It's open now, so. Guard, sure. She sure is a stubborn one. It's been quite a while since we brought her here. But she still refuses to speak a word. That mystic we found in the forest maze. Yeah, sh she sure has some willpower. Capturing her was one thing, but will she ever really join our side? How about that guy Elia Marine brought in? Hey, it's me right there, huh? Are you talking to me? Hey, hey, you. How long have you been there? Let's kick some butt. I saw in the over screen there was two chests behind them. Soon. Yep, so now we can grab this item behind her. Behind J Jab Charm. Okay, let's go to equipment. What does this do? Oh, it gives us something. Alright, how about this? Let's go over here. Uh, 
Hit rate increased, but damage given reduced by 20. Okay, that's good. She doesn't attack anyway, so that's good. Darken Rug. What is that? Oh, a Magni. New developments within our kingdom. Lord Elia has been appointed leader of the special unit. Established the weed to so-called messengers of God. The unit has successfully invited two mystics here. Bravo to Lord Elliot. Lady Marie is also pleased with her brother. Oh, what a rosy future for our great kingdom. Fun. Okay. This item's going. Did we check in here? Blocked. Okay. Guess we'll just keep going. The prisoners escaped. Escape prisoners. Where did they go? Not here. I doubt they made it to the central building yet. Find them. We're about to make it a central building, family. Oh, okay. Ooh. Alright, we got past that guy. Alright, um... Yeah, that guy's about to turn around. Alright, I think we can go. Yes, we made it. There we go. Now we're in a castle. There's a lever here. Door done in extremely poor taste. Let's pull the lever. Bum bum bum. Door is falling. Door is falling. It won't open. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, okay. Stop right there. Oh, yeah. That's a big boy. Grah. Ah. Blue Armored Hulk. Yay, you heathen you. <laughs> ha, I knew I'd find you here. You thought you could get away, did ya? Closing that door right back up. Well, we need to make it through that door. You, men, leave this to me. Look, I swear by Saint Jobrian. Jobrian. I am Vulcan, third son of the Messiah clan, and the leader of the Blue Knights. They call me the mighty Vulcan, the strongest. If you consider yourself a real man, you, you'll take me on. One on one. Ignore. No, I want to fight with both. What's this? You let a girl into a man's battle? Huh. I've got it. When you die, you die together. Is that it, admirable fellow? I see. You are a gentleman after all. And now, now we'll have to have the pleasure of beating a noble such as yourself with my trusted mace. What a joy it will be. Yep, I'm not going into a battle without Maya. That'd be dumb of me. I need her healing, like, pretty badly. Alright, battle, attack. Let's give him that true moon slash. You feel me? And then with her, let's go ahead and guard. That is a good bit of damage. Oof, that is... That is a strong hit. <laughs> Not bad. However, I keep slipping away. Uh, hurry, hurry, I said. Alright, we're definitely gonna have to heal. Let's go ahead and heal Leaf ourselves and guard with her. God, that hits so hard. Bro, I need to heal. Uh. 
<laughs> Would you like to see? The doors of destiny are closing right behind me as we speak. Huh? What? Trembling, are you? <laughs> now we're having fun. Alright, boy. Get that true moon slash. Let's guard it. Nice bit of damage. Ooh, what is he gonna do? Rage wave. Ouch. That hurts. I will never forget that spring. Sixteen years ago, when I joined the Knights. Ever since I was born to the Messi clan as one of three boys. An aristocrat by birth. Are you listening to me? Huh? Alright, we're gonna heal up. Let's go ahead and heal up a bit. I wonder, since now we're really low health, I want to see like the true power of how much healing this actually does. Because before when we healed, we didn't, we still had quite a bit of health. Okay, so that's not way too much, but that'll be enough to keep him alive. That's really all that matters. Drawbridge will be up. Have not the young nobles understood? You draw closer to your fated end. I shall speak of this battle, this encounter with the young nobles, for years to come. And now, at the crest of St. Joprian is my witness. Chivalry thrives within this body. I, who have been called Mighty Vulcan, I, the Mighty Vulcan. It is not yet over. I, I cannot lose. Boy, you thought. <laughs> I cannot lose. Well, he actually might. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Perfect! He fell on the door! He fell on the stupid door. Pretty good. Vulcan. Don't let them get away. Raise the drawbridge. We've been ordered to seize them. I can't believe a Vulcan defeated. Maya, let's go! They're gonna have to make a nice little jump. Deep, deep. They escaped. Bishop, your majesty, terrible news. What is it? What an awful lot of noise. Do you have an idea what time it is? Yes, Highness, apologies, your majesty, but the mystics locked up in the annex escaped. I thought you'd want to know. What? What did you say, you fools? What happened to the Balkan, the mighty Balkan? He dead! Oh, he's not dead, but we beat him up. What is it, Elliot? Why are you staring outside like that? Look like looks like somebody escaped, Marine. Maybe it's that young man we captured today. A feeble body like that escape? The guards or the knights would have just catch him and put him right back in the prison. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm sure you're right, Mar Marine. Moran? Marine? I don't know. Well, looks like they didn't. Let's go ahead and we might see a checkpoint up here. But I'm just gonna heal just in case. Okay. okay, so we can go over here. Go 
over here. Oh, do some parkour. We can't let them get away. I'm getting away. All right, we jumped into town. I'm going to get caught. I'll go through here. No choice. Got to use this window. All right, so we're just going to jump in a random person's house. This is a great idea. Okay. Oh, this this is a hotel, not a house. There we go. <laughs> Nils, what's the matter? Oh, there's a prison. Hey, you two, what are you up to? They should be around here somewhere. Search all of these houses well. A young man and a woman. We've got to get them. We're the castle police. Open up immediately. Open up, I say. Hey, you too. Stay right here. Or we can run downstairs. I'm guessing we just run downstairs. Aren't you listening to me? I told you there isn't any any young man or woman here. And I say they're here. We're searching the place. Hey, stop. You want to scare off all my customers? You're interfering with my business. Now get out of here. Now. Oh, all right. But you haven't heard the end of us. Nothing but a bunch of cowards. But they think they can lord it over people anyway. You don't seem to be from around here. Oops, excuse me. Okay, those stupid men are gone. Do you want something to eat? Yeah, she's, she's actually really, really nice. Honey, make us some of your specialty, would ya? Here. Here it is. Our special stew. Eat it while it's hot. Come on now, eat up. There isn't any poison in it. Okay, let me try it, so... Wow, this is great. <laughs> Don't need to wolf it down. There's plenty more that came from. Eat as much as you want. Gee... You were nice enough to hide us, and now you're even feeding us. My name is Aqua. She's Maya. Well, you see... That's okay, I know you escaped from the castle, right? The only time those men come around like that is when that Doplin has given some stupid order or another. What in the world are you doing in the castle, I wonder? Those idiots. Not too long ago, a whole bunch of young people were cons conscripted to the castle. It makes me so mad. Can anybody do anything about him, I wonder? That idiot Doplin guy. Yeah, you said it. That's right, ever since that Doplinger came to be bishop, the whole town has gone all to pieces. That guy took away my job, my house, he even took my Sandy away from me. Everybody here hates the jerks up at the castle. I don't know if they're royalty or nobles or what, but they think they can do whatever they please. There's no excuse for it. I knew as soon as I saw you two, you weren't like those people up in the castle. Now then, I'm sure they were rough on you. Why don't you stay here tonight? It's not much, but you can feel at home. Can't use the room in the back. The door is broken. You'll have to share a room. But you two look like you can get along okay. We'll stay. Thank you, Sabrina. We'd like to stay. That's the spirit, young man. Why hesitate? Seize the opportunity and have a good rest. Your room is the first one up on the stairs. Make yourselves at home.
So I don't know what would happen if we refuse the offer. Um, oh, hey you. Hey, that mark on your chest. Don't tell me you're a mystic. Now, now, don't look so scared. I'm not going to give you away to those men outside. My name is Joe. I'm a kind of information source in this town. If you ever need to know anything, just ask me. Please tell me, what exactly is a mystic? Well, I'd usually get paid for this kind of service, but tell you what, I'll try... I'll let you try out for free this once. A mystic is a person that can use the power of an origin. Origin. I'm not really sure what an origin is either, but I've heard it kind of looks like a ghost or spirit of some kind. And they say that mystics are born with a special mark, kind of birthmark. When I saw that mark on your chest, I thought you might be a mystic, aren't you? I don't think there's any need to hide it. About the only ones that know mystics have marks on them are the big shots up at the castle. I doubt anybody else knows. That's all about I know. Alright. Let's see, what do you want to hear? Okay, that's all the information we can get out of him. Let's see. How was my stew? Nels, scared. Maybe he thinks I'm a burglar because he came from the roof. Let's see, anything we say, yoinkaroo? Zork Sandy. Poor guy. Let's go ahead and do a little nappy nap. There's a bed here. Sleep! Let's let us sleep. There's a bed here. Alright, let's do another nice little save. If something happens, I don't want to go through that dialogue again. So, go ahead and save right there. Let's head back down. Finally awake, are you? I thought you'd never get up. Things have finally calmed down quite a bit outside. So, what do you plan on doing now? I don't really know. I have to find that guy, the one the one that stole the aqua from my town, but I haven't gotten clues. What kind of man was he? The guy you're looking for. He's no human man, that's for sure. He had gold eyes. What's the matter, girl? My face is ashen. What is what is it? Looks like she's trying to point to Mount Gable. It's used for it's it used to be famous for its beautiful scenery, but now monsters run rampant there. It's no place for people to go anywhere near. So Maybe, maybe Maya's trying to tell us that a mountain has something to do with the fellow you're looking for. Hey, wait just a minute. Don't tell me you're planning on going there. I'm going to Mount Gable, yeah. I don't know if there's any connection, but I'll find out when I get there. I'm going. Aqua, it looks like Maya wants to go with you. You're not going to just leave her here, are you? It's not like going on a picnic, you know. It's dangerous, I tell you. Aqua, if you're going to Mount Gable, at least take these with you. They aren't much, but they come in handy. Heal Leaf and Venom Cure. Thank you, Sabrina. Let's just say thank you. Thank you, Sabrina. Think of it. Think. Just make sure you look out for that sweet girl lover boy. <laughs> hey! We aren't like that. Watch out for the venomous monsters. Your HP won't recover if you're poisoned. Alright. So... That means we'll have to use some poison cures. Very nice. Darokin Citadel. Alright, so we got another little town to explore. What's our health at? Full? Good. So, the castle is over here. Okay, we'll check this out in a little bit. I think first, we should probably... There's a lot of useless things on the ground. Let's check out the rest of the town before we get into something. You tell me you a little secret. They say the items here are mostly stolen goods, but they're cheap. So I still buy them. There's a poorly made gold play statue. It's engraved with his number 12. Remember the 12th king? It's okay. You're in luck. You couldn't find a more honest shop, and all of my goods are the highest quality. Stolen? Alright, rusted blade. 
That's terrible. Tattered vest, wet gloves. These things are terrible. These things are probably overpriced. These things are crap. What is this? I see, you're interested in accessories. Well, do you know about skills? Um, well. Let's see what she sells. Welcome. Let's buy... Oh, man. Those are expensive. Let's go ahead and buy one of these. One of these. No, let's just buy one of each. They're quite expensive, but we could combine them. Okay. Yes. Okay, well, I won't change. Okay, we can equip that. Combine some that I probably shouldn't have. Welcome to our shop. Okay, so I'm guessing this is. Yeah. Um, flag of retreat. Let's get two of these. Two of these. Two of these. So let's get five of these. Ten of these. One of these. Two, and let's get five of these. I need to learn more about the combining of accessories because I'm really scared I waste like 2,000. On the road again? I don't know what that is. Okay, this is the weapons shop. Oh man, I should have came here first. Welcome to our weapons shop. We carry all kinds of weapons that really help combine weapon. Ooh. Okay. Let's see what we can buy. Poison sword. That's strength up, formal brace. We can probably just combine to get that. Let's get the poison sword. I think that's about the only thing. Simple cloth shoes. Wonder, can we get simple cloth shoes? No. Let's go ahead and make padded gloves. The hero blade. Yeah. Alright, so we bought basically everything we could. Now, let's continue. Let's go over here. This is the only place we haven't checked out, I think. VIP card? Oh, he just gave me. He just literally just randomly gave me some, like. Okay, well, to repay him, we're gonna try to yoink some things from his house. I apologize, this only serves the nobility. Who are you? Okay. Alright. So, I'm gonna end off the episode here, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, we're gonna continue, I'm thinking, into the castle after this, or just going away. I don't know. But guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as well as the channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye. Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Legea. So I think we're going to be going in the castle. Not 100% sure. Thanks to the recent mess, the whole castle is in an uproar. I don't think they'll be letting anyone in for a while. <clears throat> okay. I guess that answers our question pretty quickly. We're not going in the castle, but we will run out of the town and do something else. Also, just a quick update. So last episode, we did all that stuff in the castle, and we upgraded our armor for everybody, and we got Maya and stuff, which is super, super cool. Let's run out of the town, though, and see what's a goodie. So we got the forest maze to the south. We got Mount Gable. I'd say let's go to Mount Gable first. Um... Because that's where we said we're going to go in the the tavern. And I think we can find somebody here. And then we'll go to the other place afterwards. Heal Leaf. That's a rock. Alright, our first enemies. Let's see what's no, good. No. Stone Beast. Oh boy, this thing is beefy. 
Alright, let's go ahead and we don't have anything, so we'll just use Mountain Crusher for now. And with her, let's just guard. Ooh. I think it actually has quite a bit of health, actually. That's a little bit scary. We only did, like, maybe... Ooh, 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 ooh. Ouch. Each ow. As long as... As long as she heals him before this thing attacks. No! Okay, well... He's kind of dead now. You kind of needed to heal him before. Uh, are you serious? Come on. I really wish Maya would have healed him before he died. Let's see what's up here, though. Let's see, do we got another Baki warrior? Okay, so these are upgraded Baki. Not just Baki, they're Baki warriors now. Alright, let's hit that and guard with him. 16, 14. Ah, oh, that hurts a bit more. Come on! Dude. Are you... How strong are these things? We might have to dip, honestly. If I can't even do damage to these things... Gimme, gimme. Oh, no. He just stole something. I don't think I can get that back. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, no, we can do damage. It just didn't do damage at all the first time for some reason. It should give us quite a bit of XP. 500? Yeah, leveled up. I was like, that... That is... A good... Okay, let's use her... Let's... Life Blessing. There we go. And use one heal powder on him. The enemies here are strong. Very strong. So we need to we need to be careful. I might even run away from a bunch of these. Fla Ooh, this one's probably really, really strong. Okay, let's cut an attack. Let's see how much this attacks for. Ow. Oh. Okay, that's... Okay, actually, that's not super, super strong. We could probably... Yeah, we could... I don't... If if I could use a special, I could probably kill it. I don't have enough, though. Get some good stuff. Let's keep heading up. Oh, I was literally just about to press triangle and heal. Haven't noticed us yet. Oh, first... Okay, we have first strike. Definitely gonna battle, attack. Oh, the smite! Oh, that killed him! Look at that! Gotta keep going. Perfect. That level up really helped us then. <clears throat> that is not a lot of XP. I thought that would be a lot more XP, honestly. Alright, but they're getting easier and easier, which is nice already. Seems like Maya's happy. Is there someone here? There he is. Middle-aged man. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, Maya. Maya, it's you. What are you doing here? Who's this kid? Kid? I'm not a kid. Hmm. Is that a fact? So what's your name? Aqua. And you? Me? My name is... Stone. His name is gonna be Stone. Because... When I first played this game, when I was little... That's what I named him. I named him Stone. So we're gonna keep on the tradition, his name is gonna be Stone. There you go. Yep. His name's gonna be Stone. Stone, I'm just an old man living in these remote mountains. Look at those mountains, something is poisoning them. It didn't used to look like this. 
It's only a matter of time before this place starts dying. A mystic. I've been trying to use my origin to breathe some life into the earth, but Stone, do you sense it too? Something is forcing this change. Rivas, it's good to see you again. Anyone can see that something's wrong. All it takes is one look at the mountains. <clears throat> well then, are you also aware that this change is the work of just one mystic? What? That's impossible. No, no one has an origin that strong. This mystic does. He holds the supreme origin. As the name implies, his origin has seemingly unlimited power. Aqua, listen to me. The supreme origin belongs to the same man you're after. The man with golden eyes. You know about the golden eye man? Where is he? What's your connection to this kid? He, he stole Aqua from my village. In order to get the Aqua back, you've got to find him. That's why you're after him. That mark on your chest, are you a mystic too? I don't know what a mystic is. I don't know. Everyone keeps calling me a mystic, but I don't even know what that means. I guess it's safe to say that your origin hasn't awoken yet. Okay, listen up, kid. I'll explain it to you. Diva, that's my origin. Can control forces of the earth. And Rivas can control the forces of life. Origins are sentient manifestations of the forces of nature. Origins have a soul that lives inside us, with the soul of the human host. Those of us with two souls are called mystics. A man you're chasing, Golden Eyes, is a mystic for sure, and one that appears to have infinite power, or at least strong enough to affect the entire world. He's not just another human, he's something else entirely. Do you see that now? I knew that. That may all be true, but I'm still going to get the Aquaf back from him. Tell me where he is, please. Aqua. Jeez, you don't get it, do you? Don't go charging off right now. You'll get killed for sure. You're going to stay the night, right, Maya? It's okay. I just washed the sheets and my cooking has really improved. Hey, wait. I still need information. Slow down, kid. You're staying here tonight, too. There's still a lot you don't understand. Oh, looks like they know each other. Looks like we just woke up. Maya's still asleep. Let's head outside. Got a nice little save point, so we're gonna 100% make sure and save. So you're up. Morning, kid. You know, there's a reason I train like this every morning. I have to be ready to fulfill my mission in life when the time comes. Your mission in life? Perhaps destiny would be a better way. Ever since I learned that D.Va was inside me, I've done a lot of thinking about what it means to have this power and why I was entrusted with it. I finally decided that Origins and Mystics were here to put here to protect the world, at least that's what I've come to believe. Maybe that's hard for you to understand since your origin hasn't awoken yet. 
That mark on your chest means that there's an origin inside of you and a destiny for you to fulfill. A destiny for me to fulfill. It's a mole rat! Oh, it's a bigger mole rat! Alright, let's get it. Alright. Quickly, protect Maya. Yeah. I still ha have a. This time, preferably, with a little less dying. Do that and let's guard. What is he gonna do? Dark and blaze. Uh, blind guard triggered. Okay, so he guarded himself. We should be able to do quite a bit of damage with uh true moon blast though. Ow, ooh, ooh, ow, ow, ooh, ooh, that hurts. Should be able to do quite a bit of damage with this. Okay, so let's go ahead and guard. No, 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 I didn't want to do that. Uh, battle, guard, guard. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it would have been nice to guard, you know, before he attacked. But that's fine. Uh, let's do Mountain Crusher. Guard. Ow, ow. Hopefully we- hopefully he's not- he didn't defend himself. Okay, yeah. Alright, one more hit, one more hit, one more hit. Good, good, we got him, we got him. Close one. Yeah, that, that little thing does quite a bit of damage. Your boy Stone is quite a quite an origin there. Well, kid, at least you know how to handle a sword. What were they doing here? Man, those plants are dying. Look, they smash everything, there's nothing left. <clears throat> I may be able to rip open the earth, but I can't make a single flower bloom. I can only help the healing process. This power we share with Origins is tied to the will of the host. It can be used to destroy or it can be used to help the wounded and those in pain. It all depends on the host. Well, kid, as far as I can tell, you've got a good heart, and you're also a mystic. If you're planning to go up against Gold Eyes and a Supreme Origin to get that Aqua Lift back, your only chance is that other spirit inside you. You've got to wake it up. Deep within your soul is another spirit. You must conjure it now. The power is lying dormant inside you. Free your mind and call to it. It will awaken. I'm sure of it. Power inside me. In your present condition, you won't get that rock back and you'll end up dead. Then what should I do? How can I tap into the power inside of me? There is only one way. You must stare it into the very face of death. You must push yourself to the brink. The face of death. Put your life on the line. Are you ready? Ready to face down death. I need the power no matter what. If that's the only way to awaken the power inside of me then, I'll do it. I'm ready. I have to, I have to try. Okay. Follow me. Alright, let's get it. Mr. Stone over here. I wonder if he's just got some, like, huge monster tied up in the back. This road leads up to the summit of the mountain. You'll find a cave at the summit. 
There's a spirit called the Mountain Morgue that lives there. He's usually very, very gentle, but he'll try to kill anything that attacks him. I know it sounds a bit barbaric, but you're going to attack him. You will find yourself fighting for your life, I'm sure of it. I'll wait here with Maya. Bro, you're not gonna even come with me as like, uh, Maya left the party. Like, hey, you might die, so I should probably go with you. No, he's just... Hey, if you're dead, that sucks. So, I don't know if that's the best way to approach this, but... Alright. Let's get going, I guess. Alright, so our first monster... I haven't noticed us yet! Spike lizards, okay. It's a good thing, I get the first attack. Oh, okay, we're not venomed after battle, I didn't know that. Venom cure? Bronze Barom, okay, let's, let's see what that does. Okay, apparently not anything. Fight a stone beast. Okay. There's something buried at your feet. Okay, well I can't get it, so that sucks. Alright guys, I made it to about the same spot here. What is in this chest? Alright, let's grab this item. Scroll of identity. Let's go ahead and use some heal powders, climb up this. Get to that mountain, it's literally right there. I'm hoping I don't get attacked by any... Nah, maybe, just kidding. Alright, we got healed. Let's go fight this stupid thing. Oh, oh god. This is truly like one of those Luke Skywalker things, you know? Ooh. That's a big boy. gigantic why would we attack that that's stupid this will either awaken the power inside me or get me killed let's find out Oh boy. Mountain board. Let's just use Red Whirlwind. Oh. That, this thing is not affected by any damage. It's not working. What should I do? This thing's about to punch me. Um... Didn't expect that. I guess we'll try again? Am I dead?
like those two. It's the same thing. Am I the same as them? Deep within your soul is another spirit. You must conjure it now. It will give you strength. Another power lies within me. We got our origin, flaming fist, my dudes. Let's get it. Oh, this boy's mad. <laughs> I think we got him, boys. about to spit at me, so hopefully this killed him before it spits. No spit. Damn. Oh, we did kill it. Okay, good. I say, if that boy spits on me, I'm dead. Hey, we did it, guys. Are you, are you the origin inside me? Yes, Galay is the name. I am the origin of fire. If you had waited any longer to awaken me, you would have been dead for sure. Galay, that's the name that the other person said earlier. Maya was worried about you. Is that your origin? Such power. Who would have thought the kid had this kind of power inside of him? You finally awoken the giant within you, Aqua. Is that why you brought me here, Maya? Yes. I hoped that you would realize your potential as a mystic. Your origin may be awake, but you're still a novice. You've got a lot to learn to. You've got a lot to learn about fighting in origins. Come with me. Maya and Stone have joined the party. Let's go! We got your boy Stone. He's so cool. I still can't believe that this was in me all along. Hey, get a move on, will you? The master's already leaving. Master? It's better than calling him Pops, don't you think? If it weren't for him, I would have never woken up. You'd probably be dead. <laughs> master, huh? I do like it this this origin it's also funny too like better than calling them pops holy crap stone has a lot of HP he's level 25 jeez I wonder if maybe we weren't supposed to come here this early in the game you're late kid yeah I was gonna say that He's very strong. I, I was starting to wonder if we were supposed to go to the other place first. Either way, let's fight. Uh, we don't have enough MP for our origin, so we'll just use Mountain Crusher. Stone Beast 1. Guard with her, and with him. 
Earth energy. We could just attack normally. Critical. Oh no, he doesn't have any... Oh, he has a lot of slots. That's one, and then up, right, right. So that should be two moves right there. Let's begin. Alright, so that's Moon Splitter. And... 1,300 damage. Jesus. We're literally doing... We're literally doing nothing. This guy does a good bit of damage. Jeez. Master, why aren't you using your sword? I've always preferred to use my fists. I can feel the battle with more clarity. This is a memento of an old student of mine. A student? Yes, and in it thrived the spirit of my former student, Rouse. Which is why I must never ever lose it, for to lose it is to forget him. So he doesn't want to use a sword, because he doesn't want to lose a sword. Nice. Alright everybody, I think I'm going to leave off the episode here because I went ahead and did some of it, um, but I just died like five times, so I'm going to save it for next episode, and I'm probably going to stand right here and do a bit of grinding, so guys, thanks for watching, if you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment, as a support my channel, and I will see you guys later, God bless, and goodbye. Hey everybody, it's David, welcome back to another episode of Legea. Today, we're gonna go back to the Cave of Trials and try again for the fifth time, but this time it's gonna be just a tiny bit different because I have a new strategy, we're not gonna fight as much, we're gonna try to run through it without as much fighting. Also, I did a bit of grinding and I got Aqua 2 level 15, meaning we got another art block. Meaning that, we get more moves, so we're gonna quickly try to find a battle. And then we're going to try to learn some more moves here. Alright, that should be a new one right there. And I guess we'll attack the other one just like that. So, yeah, this stone beast is definitely going to die from stone. This should be a new move, though. Yep, new art. Have an attack. Okay, that wasn't, like, super, super strong. But it did something. Ooh, why does it gotta go for Maya? Okay, well, she actually didn't get hit that hard, which is cool. Alright, so we're gonna attack and we're gonna do another new one. Okay. And I'm gonna guard with stone this time, so we can get um, Aqua to attack. And it's gonna be another new art. And that one's actually probably... So soon. One of my favorite arts, just by like attacking style. I just think that looks really, really sick. Alright, I think we got one or two more to learn. Alright, that should be a new one right there. And we're gonna just down attack with this one. There we go. Finish so soon. Finish so soon. Battle Flash. All right. Okay, I don't know if this is a new one, but it might be, so I guess we'll find out here in a second. It is a new one. All right, cool. That's kind of neat. I like it, I like it. Alright guys, so I think that's going to be enough for new arts. I'm going to heal up, save, and then we're going to go head down. Not another encounter. Yes, we made it. Alright, cool. So I'm probably just going to cut out all my other attempts. Take a look, Aqua. Because I've done this four times, by the way. I just keep failing. 
This is the Cave of Trials. I trained here in my younger days. At the very back of the cave, there's a scroll that reveals a secret sword technique. I want you to go and get that scroll. You want me to get a scroll? Question mark. It may sound easy, but trust me, it's not. The cave is filled with monsters. You won't be able to get to the scroll by yourself. You're going to need the cooperation of your origin. Cooperation? Question mark. Stand over there. And up we go. All right. Origins do things like this. I'm certain that your origin has the power you'll need to accomplish a task. Whether you make it through the cave alive or not depends on how you use your origin. I'll wait here with Maya. Good luck. All righty then. Let us get going. Maya and Stone left the party. This part of the game I really don't get. So, you see how Maya and Stone just left the party? Okay, well, we smashed this rock with our origin, right? So let's smash this rock. Smash, smashy smash. And Maya just left. But, um, psych. No, she actually does come with us. What's the matter, Maya? Hey, Aqua. I don't think you're strong enough to make it through the cave by yourself yet. Take Maya with you. Uh, something about healing. Should be good. So I don't know why they even made that cutscene where Maya left. He should, from the beginning, he should have just been like, take her with you. Because you need healing. Cave of Trials. Okay, so we can go left or right. The right um, is basically just a wall. There's nothing we can do there. So let's just jump over here. Break this with him. We can go up there. We can go up towards the left. And there's a chest up there with I an item. But I do not want that item. Also, I'm really debating on... Ooh, Maya has no health. I'm debating on attacking. Since we have first strike... You know what? I'm just gonna take it as... Like a gift. And run away. I could fight that. Like I said, I've got a new strategy. I kept dying. So, I really need to take a new strategy and... Um, not fight. Because, obviously, I'm gonna die. These things are pretty strong in here. So I'm just going to go ahead and cheese it a little bit. And guys, trust me, don't, it's, I'm not like a baby for not taking these fights. Like, literally, I've tried multiple, multiple times to go through this with fighting. It does not work. Okay, now the question is, am I able to escape from normal enemies? Okay, well, they attack first. Escape, okay. We got attacked once, but we escaped. And actually, that reminds me, I need to heal. Maya's basically dead so let's heal that healing powder on him all right we should be good oh no that's a dead end oh i'm gonna have to waste walking space that is a shame that uh, okay well, i'll probably run into an enemy here soon yeah right before the exit nah it's a little bit frustrating noticed a first strike perfect 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 man we're gotten we've gotten pretty lucky with these first strikes once again, I'm going to go ahead and escape. There's no reason to alert their attention and fight. The XP that they give us is not that big. Or the... Oh, that's a dead end. The XP that they give us for the amount of health we're probably going to lose is really not worth it. Okay, so up here... Uh, I think we need to fight this guy. I think. I mean, he's in the wall. A hole in the wall. Uh, it just kind of makes sense that we probably have to fight here. Defending. Oh, he didn't do any damage. That's sick. Oh, he's not defending. What a madman, he's not defending. Oh my, okay, I'm... No I, problem. I really don't know if it's the level difference, the attacking difference, or something, but we've... We're... Or, um, okay, maybe that's not it. Oh, we just have to go through here. So again, I don't know if we've gotten lucky, but... So far, it's been fairly easy. I'm not going to even go for that chest. What's over here? Fire will reveal the path. Okay. Light it up, boy! There we go. Okay, not sure where we're going. But... I could definitely see the levels helping. I'm really glad that I powered all the way to level 15. Okay. No, no, no. Oh, oh, I'm stupid. We could just yeet. 
That's how we do it. Avarice Jewel. Don't know what that does. Let's go this way. Okay. Okay. Huh? No idea what that was about. Heaven's Path. Okay. No idea what that was. It just got returned. Go! Have to fight them? I don't. I really don't want to. There's no reason to fight. I'm. I'm good. I'm good on levels, and they chunk so much damage. It's good to just dip, honestly. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, where does this take us? Real quick, I'm gonna go ahead and heal. No, heal powder. Use one powder on him. We can, we'll, we'll be good. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. There is only one truth. Okay. Okay. If it works, it works. Do the most left one? Not sure. Whatever. Not worried about it. Just grab the scroll. Secrets? Yes. I'll take the secrets. They're mine now. Yoink that rock out of the way. And let's get it. There we go. Get me down. Is this the scroll you told me about? Yes, that's it. You're not quite a warrior yet, but you did good, kid. At least now you have the first-hand experience of the origins. The scroll contains a secret sword technique of Tenga Ryu. Some call it the Sky Fang School. The Sky Fang School, what's that? It's a style of sword fighting that I mastered. It allows you to infuse your sword with your inner fighting force. The scroll contains the secrets of the Raging Fang technique. It's elementary, but useful. Like the smithy tempers steel, so too must you temper your mind. Devote yourself to mastering this technique. Aqua learned Raging Fang technique. It looks like you've learned Raging Fang quite well. In that case, you shouldn't have any trouble learning more advanced techniques in the future. Okay then, let's all head back to the house. Let's do it! Stone, join the party. Alright, so we're still good. Let's take a look at equipment. Here I go! Oh, we can do Raging Fang now. Okay, let's try that. It's a hyper art. There we go. Let's see what this looks like. Hyper art. Okay, it's a good move, not like super amazing, but you have to think that right now we have five art blocks, once we get six we can do that twice. That's pretty good. Okay, so let's try to fight, uh, find some enemies, and we'll get stone a couple new arts here. Down. Okay, so let's just do that one for now, begin. That should be a new art form, there we go. Lightning. Oh, that is a, quite a bit of damage. Okay, and hopefully these flowers won't do much damage anymore to us since we're pretty leveled now. Guard, guard, attack. Let's learn something new so we can learn... So he already knows Jawbuster. So let's go down, up, up, up. So this should be double kick. Double kick, there we go. Down, down, up. There we go, and this should be double fist. Double fist. Very nice. Get out of that. Right, right, left, right. Okay, let's do it. That should be goblin dance. That's pretty cool. Next. 
Fever Wind. There we go. That is a good bit of damage. Get up. So this should be Deadly Hands. Big boom. It is done. Up, right, left, left. Should be another super attack. Iron fists. Very nice. Let's begin. I think this might be a new one. Yep, this is a new one. Ooh, that is quite a bit of damage. Jeez. One up. I think this is the last move we can learn for now. Right, pretty, pretty good move. Pretty good move. Okay, my controller is weird. Stay, uh, not stay aqua. Say aqua. This aqua, if you're looking for, what exactly is it? Let's see. It floats in the air. It's very shiny, and water comes out of it. Oh, it's a rock. A shiny rock that floats midair and water comes out of it. You wouldn't try to fool an old man, now, would you? A rock that makes water. It can only be one thing. A sacred azure stone. You know of it. Yeah, when I was held captive in Doplin Castle, I remember the bishop bragging about it. Doplin Castle? That's where they locked me up. You sure that's where it is? Hmm, but why did Goldeye steal it from your village? What does he plan to do with it? If we find that stone, we might find Goldeyes too. Master? Question mark. Let me tell you something, Aqua. I like the scenery here. The sunsets here were especially breathtaking. But I can't enjoy the sunset anymore. The eerie mist covering the mountains has made it impossible. In order to get back to the mountain I love, I plan to fight this gold-eyed devil that's disrupting the balance of things. You fight to protect your village, Maya and I to protect nature. We fight for different reasons, but our target's the same. How about it, Aqua? Master, let's go to Doplin Castle. We'll leave right away. Kenjiro. Stone! Exclamation mark. You again. I don't know why you keep coming back. Doesn't the fact that I travel all this way just to see you so many times mean anything to you? Alright, Kenjiro, I give up. You can have the pot, along with everything else in the house. It's all yours. Really? You're going to give me the pot? Even the hanging scrolls? I won't have any use for them where I'm going. Anything you think is valuable, you can buy. Hmm, I was hoping to get some traveling money, but never mind. Alright then, shall we go? Did we get some money for that? Yo fam, let me get that cash, you know what I'm saying? How you about to just yoink us things without giving that giving us that cash? I don't even think that was real. I always saw somebody made it up. I'll take this. Alright. My guy. Give me that cash. Alright, whatever. Let's get let's keep going. Uh we we'll save on the we'll save on the main map. Fine. Oh, hopefully I didn't make a mistake by not saving. I don't think there should be a fight here, though. Hmm, I was hoping we'd make it down the mountain before it got dark, but oh well. We'll rest here for tonight. About camp. Camp is possible at any location where there is a tent icon on the field. Status brings up menu screen. All standard command functions can be accessed. Combine. Combine armor, weapons, potions, and accessories. Rest. Use a camp kit to recharge your parties. HP and MP to full. Chat, listening on the characters, reviewing conversations. Cook to cook and save the current game. Since you're here, you might you must taste my world famous curry. Stone curry. You made stone curry. Ah, it's ready. It's so delicious. It'll bring tears to your eyes. Stone, I'm crying. Because my mouth is on fire. Fool, it's not curry if it hasn't got a little spice. 
What's the matter, Maya? I guess it's so hot she doesn't want to eat it, Stone. That's strange. I thought it was pretty good. Max HP increased, HP recovered, MP lost, defense down, strength up, agility up. Status perimeters change depending on the kind of foods you eat. Effects last for the fixed number of battles. Effective perimeters are marked with an arrow on the status screen. Okay, let's go ahead and save real quick. Just in case anything happens, saving is always good. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go to status. I think everyone's good. We can heal later anyway. Let's go ahead and chat a little bit. Hey, tell me about your past. Uh, let's see, I was fighting all the time. I just wanted to test how strong I was. That's all I wanted to know. I see. You've got to get out and try things while you're young. Sitting around doing nothing is the worst. The worst thing is to regret is not having done, done something. So, is there anything you regret not having done then? Let's see, I should have gone after even more ladies when I was young and handsome. I know I had what it took to attract the ladies, but I, 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 looks like there's a major regret. Aqua, you've been practicing the technique I taught you the other day, right? I want to learn a new skill. Yes, I use it all the time, but Master, please teach me some more. Be patient and keep using them. New skills will awaken within you. Really? Yes, only those abilities developed when you just truly matter in the end. Keep up your training, Aqua. Why is Master Cookie so spicy? Spicy, I held out on the spice for you. You held back on the spice? How spicy is your real cooking? Now, this is nothing compared to the foods in my hometown, Tanza. Mm, what's wrong, Maya? Why are you frowning? Have you ever washed your clothes before, Master? Of course. Near as I remember, I washed them a month ago. A month ago? That's right, anything wrong? You might want to wash them more often. Look, Maya doesn't like the fact that you smell. <laughs> I see, I've lived alone for a long time. I completely forgot about it. These are some pretty com pretty funny conversations. Do other people know about their origins when they're born? It depends. Some become aware when they are born. Some don't realize it till they die. As for me, I'm just like you. I felt mine during battle. We fought together ever since. Stone and I share a mutual existence. The death of Stone's soul means the same for my own. He is more stubborn than I am. Simply put, if I die, so does D.Va. So they're between life and death. Correct, but even if we share destinies, our souls are separate. So communicate well with the origin within yourself. A stone that gushes water, huh? And you have absolutely have to say have it. Yes, I've got to have it. That's the whole reason I left home. I see. Well, according to the divas, it was taken to the Doppelin Castle. That castle again, huh? What do you mean? Well, actually, the castle is where I met Maya in the first place. They were gathering up mystics, and I got caught. I see. That must be how Maya got caught, too. Mystic hunting, huh? Pretty scary. It reminds me of a long time ago. What happened? This was before you were born. People used to believe that mystics were the cause of misfortune. There was a huge uproar, and an entire town got destroyed. Ever since then, nobody dared to say the word mystic, but I guess the history repeats itself. But the ones making a fuss about mystics this time are some big shots. They call the mystics... The messengers of the gods. The messengers of the gods. It's a little exaggerated, isn't it? Well, let's go to the castle. I guess we can see those guys for ourselves. Those big shots. Yeah, probably. There must be something big behind this whole thing. I hope not, though. By the way, what's your relationship with Maya? Uh, answer honestly. After we escaped the castle, we've just been traveling together. We don't have any special relationship. Hmm. That's what you say. But it seems to me Maya's really opened up to you. She's such a shy girl, too. Listen, boy, martial arts are all about discipline. Discipline is the only way you're going to master your skills. And, huh? Hey, you even listening? Of course I'm listening. Of course I was listening. It takes discipline to master one skill, right? You were listening. Okay, the seven martial arts principles are courage, mortality, humanity, wisdom, courtesy, integrity, and honor. How long is this guy going to talk? I'm going to keep chatting, honestly. Let's head to the... Uh, okay. I think that was the last one. That's right. When we go there, we should go straight to the... Okay, yeah. I think I think we're done chatting. Let's see if we can cook anything other than stone curry. Okay, we need to learn recipes. Combine. Can we combine anything? Simple shoes. Okay, I think we'll do some combining later. Alright, I think we're good. I don't think we have a camping kit, so we can't heal and stuff. But it's okay, we'll go to dark and do that. Sound asleep. 
Poor girl. If she weren't a mystic cursed with the blood of her ancestors, she'd probably be living a normal life, surrounded by family. The blood of her ancestors? A long time ago, there was a race called the Cabell. They might have had human bodies, but they had the power to control everything in the universe. The Cabell called it magic. Maya is from the same bloodline. She used to have the same powers. If it weren't for those powers, Maya would never have... Never have what? What, what happened? Her powers went out of control. If I had only realized sooner, I might have been able to help. She never would have. That's a secret we're gonna have to learn for ourselves later on, probably. Alright! Aqua acquired four pieces of beef, four vegetables. You've learned how to make camp. Very cool. Alright, let's get out of here and go to the main map. We got a rock we can break now. Let's see what's on the other side. Now I'm like really curious on what is over here. Secret cave? Up on top of the hill? So, but we did save at the camp, so it's fine. If we die, we're, we're, we'll be fine. Ooh, some treasure chests, huh? Okay. Leaf of Defiance. Bronze Barome. There's a buried... Alright everybody, so next up we're gonna go to the Darkened Citadel and then go to the sewers, which we'll find out obviously later. So guys, thanks for watching, hopefully you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and comment and subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye. Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Legea. Today we're gonna be going back to Darkened Citadel and see what's good really. So let's go ahead and enter it. Uh, I didn't save. Might have been a bad idea, but it's fine. This town hasn't changed. If they did bring the Aqualith here, it probably would be in the castle. It's up at the end of this road. Alright, before we do that, um, we've already checked out this entire town, so I'm going to do this off camera. So, real quickly, I just noticed something interesting. Oh, you have the VIP card. In that case, I have something to show you then. So we got that VIP card from that rich guy over there. So does that mean we get new things? Ooh, we do get new things. Oh boy, look at that. Okay. So heal leaf. Let's uh, let's get maybe twenty of those. Yeah. Again, I think we're good with that. It's quite a bit of money. Yep. Okay. Cool. That is, we just spent a lot of money. Hopefully, we didn't maybe spend a little too much. With accessories, too much at the moment. I think it's better if we go to, if we upgrade our armor, I think this was most important. Iron sword, so this would be, this would be higher attack. Okay guys, I think we're good with that. We bought fire, the fire edge, lizard chest guard, uh, this for Maya, some silly shoes for Maya, and a leather brace. Yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, Stone uses his fists. So he doesn't need a, really need a weapon, and, is, and so far he's a little bit better than everybody else at the moment, so he'll be fine. So let's go over to him, so let's go with uh, the Fire Edge, Lizard Guard Chest, Leather Brace, okay, and he should be good. Silly Shoes, these are better, and she's got an accessories. Okay, and he's good too. Okay, cool. So, everybody is good in that sense. How is our... Okay, our healths aren't full. Let's head over into the castle now. We should be everything good, full MP, everything. So, we already went to all these buildings once. So not going to go through them again. The drawbridge is up. Can't get in through the main entrance, looks like. Did you come to see the castle? Apparently they're on emergency alert. I'm sorry, but you can't go in. Ever since the bishop found the sacred azure stone, the castle's been this way. wonder what they're doing in there. The aqualith is here in this castle. I've got to find a way to get inside. Okay, so to get inside, we need to go through the sewers. I'm pretty sure. At least that would be my best guess. Austin family. 
we, we got the emblem of nobility. Okay, guys, so I just kind of read up on what we can do. So basically, we got that fire emblem from the trash. We can take it to the guy in the hotel. Let's go through a bunch of rooms to get into the sewers. But before we do that, we're only level 15, 13, and 26. What would be a good idea is to level up to around 20 before we actually get into the sewer. So if we talk to the guy here, they say that no one enters the forest maze in the west and makes it out again. It's not for amateurs. So because we talked to him, now the forest maze is opened up on our map. So what we're going to do is, well, what I'm going to do is do a bit of grinding here. So I don't know how much I'm going to put of this on camera, but I'm just going to go over there and... Yeah, I'm gonna fight. Now, these enemies are really hard, but I think Stone could take care of them. I think he'll be fine. So, yeah, let's enter here. The Forest Maze. And I think Stone will be able to take care of them and give us some nice XP. We will not find the Aqua Fiera. We must hurry to Darokin. Okay. Well, that doesn't really matter, because I'm not, I'm not here to do anything. I'm just here to fight. So, let's see what kind of enemies we got. Bean gun, Vorst, and Bean gun. That's on Bean guns. Okay, let's do Battle Flash on the Vorst. Let's guard with him, and with him, let's do some Fever Wind. So we can do two on Bean gun one. All right, let's see how much health these guys have. Oh, these guys have quite a bit of health. What am I saying? Even Stone can barely one-shot them, actually. Oh, he can actually one-shot them. Okay, never mind. Yeah, yeah, okay. Stone is fine. Stone will one-shot. Um, ow. Ooh, ooh. Okay, that's not too much damage. It's about the same as the mountain guys. Let's see how much damage we do, though. That's a real question. Okay, that's... Um, not a lot of damage. That's fine. We can just repeat this. Stone will basically just clean up everybody. And he should be able to kill this. Bam. Okay, so we did quite a bit of damage to him. Ooh, what is he gonna do? G Gust Howling. Oh. Ooh. That does quite a bit of damage, actually. That's a little bit scary. Okay, so we're just gonna guard with her, guard with him, and then beat the crap out of this thing. Alright. Now, let's see. Let's see how much XP this gives us. Hopefully it gives us quite a bit. 3,000. Jesus. We could literally do like two or three more fights and get to level 15, uh, like 15, 20. Okay, well here's what I'm gonna do. Alright, we can't kill this little bean thing. Oh, 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 that thing is the damage. Alright, I guess we'll just uh, blast it up, my guy. And then I guess we'll just use Earth Energy on that one. Alright, so actually the first time we're looking at his origin power, so let's take a look. Oh, that thing don't mess around. That's like 5,000 damage. Don't waste my time. Aw, oh, this thing's gonna run away, isn't it? Stupid lips. I keep seeing this thing everywhere, man. I don't know what this deal. Oh, we can kill it. We can kill it before it runs away. I think we have higher speed this time. Haha! <laughs> Can't run away from me this time, boy. Right, let's see what we get for killing Ellipse. 3,000 XP? Okay, that's a good amount of XP. 
Eclipse Tear. That's probably worth quite a bit. Don't waste my time. Ooh, a hell gig. Ooh, what is this? That's new. Alright, you know what? Let's not mess around with this one. Let's go ahead and use Raging Fang. No, no, no. You know what? We'll use Moonflower. Yeah, let's use Moonflower Guard. I guess. There we go. Okay, we stole something, which is cool. Wow. Okay, that. That's a pretty scary monster, actually. We're doing quite a bit of damage, though. Like, we're doing quite a lot of damage. It's actually kind of scary. Iron Muscle. Oh, boy. He's thick! He's thick now! That's right, we can still beat the crap out of him. Oh, we do a lot less damage, I think. It's okay. He's still dead. As long as, as long as, uh, Aqua attacks right here? Yeah, he's dead. Yep. Too easy. Here I go! Uh-oh! Don't waste my time. Don't waste my time. Don't waste my time. Here I go! Don't waste my time. Whoever gets the head wins my time. Alright, everybody. So, I leveled up Aqua to level 21, meaning he got another uh, art block. Alright, everybody. So, it's been... A couple days since the last time I got on this game, but quick little update. So I kept grinding in that forest, got myself to level 25, Maya 24, and Stone of 31. I can tell you right now, we're over leveled. Most guides in this game tell me to be around 20 when I enter this next part of the game. So we really shouldn't have a problem, uh, but since I did so much grinding, um, I think I can upgrade some of my thing so iron get a boots get one of those all right cool i think that's all we need for now so we're gonna equip that stuff later let's go back in no not the accessories we're fine with accessories and i don't exactly know how to work them yet so let's come back here buy many more of these since now we have so much cash we need plenty of these because i know there's some camps in there and attack okay we'll get five of these all right that is a good bit of our money wasted or not wasted used since our last grinding but i think that's gonna do some good so uh yeah let's go ahead and continue with the story so we got uh the emblem from that trash pile over there so now we go to this hotel i'm so sorry but the mention is required ah that's the emblem of nobility please accept my humble apologies ross and family please do come in that is not us. That is not me. That is not you. That is not any of us. But we don't care. I'm in here. Do something. Thank you very much for using our hotel. Which level of room would you prefer? Bro, I can't. F Wait, is that 10,000? Um. I can afford 10,000. Wait, 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 wait. I clicked the wrong button. Uh, I clicked the wrong button. Hopefully we don't actually have to pay. I have to pay for that? That would suck. If you need anything, please let me know. Uh, I just paid a lot of money for that. Did it even... Ugh. That sucks. <laughs> Oops. Oh, maybe I just went to the wrong room. Oopsies. Hmm, it does look like it connects to the sewers from here after all. Phew, what a stench. We are in uh, the sewers. Alright, so now we're gonna go through this bad boy to get over to Darken Castle. Um, quick fact. This is my least favorite part of the entire game. I absolutely dread this place for all that it is. It's literally just a bunch of puzzles. Get them crater out of my face. 
it's locked. Wow. Surprise. I really don't like this place. And it's probably gonna take me forever to figure out what to do. You know what? That's okay. Locked from the other side. Okay. Here, nothing. And there's enemies in here. All right, let's see what's good. Don't waste my jelly time. melt and nether kind. Um, okay. Let's do battle flash. Um, can I hit these jelly melts? I really hope I can. Kind. Oh, okay. These guys aren't that strong. Okay, we definitely like leveled ourselves enough. If we can one-shot these guys, we're fine. Let's just hope. Okay. Oh. Okay, so... Oh, I did not hit him because I didn't hit down. It is a terrible... Oh, I can't go in the sewer. Okay, I... Hmm. Okay, new enemies. Bone warriors. They actually look really cool. Yeah, they look really, really cool. I like it. Alright, hopefully we can just one shot these. Cool. I'm a little bit scared. I don't know if Aqua can one shot these. Hmm. Maybe should use a special move. Oh well. Branded Spellbound. I don't know what that does. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to one shot them. It's okay. So is this the red door? Yes, yes. Use the key. Alright, cool. We got into the red. Alright, what does this do? Oh. Evil fly, more evil flies, but once again, I don't deal. I'm not gonna deal with it. It's not giving me enough XP. Enough XP. Fight those things. Blue door. Uh, not yet. Actually, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna quickly save. We're gonna save. Because I don't know if there's something behind that blue door. And there's a camp right here. So that could be like a sign like, hey, you're about to do battle. So, fuck. Yeah, can, can I cook? I can cook that uh, curry, can't I? I think we're fine with that. Yes, let's open this. Okay, so we can turn this lever now. Which is cool. I guess we gotta go up or down, down. Can't open that. 
Which is both prosecutor now. Just over here. Also over here. Okay, that's another lever. Let's pull this lever. Uh, so no, what I'm doing? Oh, I pulled this down. Okay. I'm guessing we're probably going to cross here. Oh. Yeah, it was over there. I think it was close. Whatever, I don't think there's anything so important. Oh, okay. I wonder if I need a water flow. Over here. Oh, well. So that'd be great. Now we're going to cut the stones. See where they're going to go from. Now that's what I get. Let's keep going. Yes, let's keep going. Do you want to fly? Okay, here is the yellow door. We don't have a yellow yet. I have to deal with that later. Let's go now. There we go. Okay, so now we got this. Oh, sorry. Now we want to turn the water on. Turn the water on, right? Okay, now we're going to turn the water on. Okay, so I found a little bit of breakthrough, turned the water off again, and came back over here. Now we seem to be some stuff I can do. So we're going to need a lot of now. Okay, so this is where I've been before. Okay, so I need these two. But not that one, so... All right, so I just kind of figured out how to switch characters. I don't know why I haven't done this yet, but uh, yeah. So I'm supposed to light this with Maya, grab the yellow key, and skedaddle. Oh, here's the yellow door. Yes, this is what I wanted. This is what I wanted. The yellow door. Yes. All right, now, my phone away. Yes, pull. Oh, can I? Hello? Yeah, I was like, can a girl not pull it? Hello? Sexism? What's going on here? All right, cool. Got that open. Now we can deep cross here. See what's inside here. Just probably a lot of problems. That's like a thousand death sword. Right? Like, I don't need to do much. Paralysis. Cool, cool, cool. Very nice. It's not good, like, this place is cool. Can I get all types of stuff? 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 Can I get a bell ruins. Oh boy, this place sounds scary. Am I supposed to be here? I don't know if I'm supposed to be here. But, uh, hey. What the heck? Why not? What is this? But wait. Obliterate Solitude. Okay, guys, so we're going to save right here, and I think we're going to call it for this episode, guys. So thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as a personal channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye. Hey, everybody, it's David. Welcome back to another episode of Legea. Looks like a thunder switch. I don't have... Okay, so long story oh. short... Oh, there's new things in here. Long story short, those are thunder switches use those I need to have a different character which I do not have ouchie, ouchie. let's see how much this thing does oh it's not even that bad you know what just because this thing made me mad I'm gonna beat the crap out of it battle flash let's get it beat it up no 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 no, no don't do that and no actually I want to do something with you too 
I beat that up. Beat it up, beat it up, beat it up, beat it up. Beat it up. Okay, cool. We actually just killed it in one little. Okay, cool. So then, um, your boy Aqua can focus on the Bone Warrior and hopefully kill it. Yeah. Nice. Down so soon. Nice. Okay, so that thing wasn't as tough as I thought it would be. Gave us like no experience, but hey, what to expect? Keep moving. Keep moving, moving, moving. Man, I keep, gotta get back to the right character. Punch through the wall. Back this way first. Except we're gonna have to fight first. Stone Golem. Alright, an upgraded version of the Sand Golem. Let's get it. Let's do Raging Fang. Raging Fang. Let's see how tough this thing really is. Let's go ahead and Cannon Blast. Right. This thing might be tough. Oh, that thing is pretty tough. You want this? Okay. We actually might need this. We might need, uh, yeah. We might need hyper arts. I will definitely kill it though. Nice. We killed it just about one turn. So that's pretty good. Didn't even let us attack us. Actually, I'm kind of scared if it does attack. Because golems are very slow, so they make up for that in like really high burst damage. Oh wait, I'm still going this way. Just in case. Um, okay, what's over here? I guess we'll check the room out first. Okay. Adventures log. I should probably check that, right? We were trapped in the room in which, uh, the. Uh, don't know how it glowed. Looking around, our fell on the unique plaque of F I S H. Oh, this goes down, down, down. Jeez. Let's see what this door is about, I guess. Nothing? Okay. Weird flex, but okay. Check out this door if we don't get in a battle, at least. are new. Uh, let's fight them, I guess. Skull Raptor. Oh, wait. Uh, with him, I should probably do another attack. Uh, let's do that. No, oh, don't guard. And with him, I guess we can just... Yeah. Let's see. Can we one-shot these? Oh, yeah. We can one-shot these. Okay, so this this was a lot easier than I thought. So E, H. Okay, so this one needs to be on M. Um, we need to spell out fish, right? F I S H. So that one. What is this? T? No. R? No. I. Yep. And then we need to find the F and this one. And the door should open. There we go. Easy, easy, easy. Okay, that is not where we're going just yet. We're gonna explore the rest of this place. Sculpture. Know what I was supposed to do with that. Oh. 
Okay, well, that was... I think I did that puzzle by accident. But hey, I'll take it. Why not? Easy puzzles. Nothing in here again. Okay. Not like I care. Alright, let's do this one. The less a goody. Nearer is clear, distance obscures. Okay. Let's try. Wait, nearer is clearer? Okay. Let's do that. That's pretty cool. There is a thingy. So I will go ahead and save. Don't cry, dull knife. Let's see if they said anything. Okay, cool. Ah, I think I think we'll be fine. Let's go through. What's this? An ancient ruin. There appears to be an inscription of some sort. Could it be a spell? Hey, Maya might know something about this. She's from the Cabell, ain't she? Question mark. Question mark. Maya, are you alright? That day. Memories of the day her powers got out of hand. If only... If I had seen the signs, had I been aware of Miles' power sooner, I would have been able to stop it. The tragedy could have been prevented. Tell me what happened. My, uh, Maya's family. When her powers ran amok, they were wiped from the face of the earth. Hey, it's a little fat king, huh? Who dares to trespass here? Speak if you value your lives. Your faces are familiar to me. You. You are those fugitive mystics. If I had known to find you here, it would have spared me the trouble of sending Elliot. Hey! That's the monster that was in the jail. Ah, uh, do not be frightened. Trust in me. I will not harm you. But I am not the Lord of Darakin and the Bishop of the Holy Order of Vanderess. I, or I am? I was? I can't read. And who are you? I have no business with you. Step away from there at once. Who do you think you are? <laughs> You're only a petty villain who somehow came into power. How dare you? You would call a bishop a villain? There is not an iota of evil in me. Your eyes betray you. The truth is plain for all to see. This kind of looks kind of funny. And what would a villain be plotting in such a room? Planning to call on some demons, were you? Demons? Perhaps you are correct. The people of Cabell who perished several thousand years ago, they started demonology here in this room. Magic that manipulates heaven and earth. Such powers could very well beget demons. You are wrong, Velma. I do not aspire to create demons. I require soldiers of God. Entity that governs all life. That is God. I seek that. The power that manipulates life at will. And this room, it gives me that power. The wisdom of Cabell will reveal to me the way of the God. Wait, up, okay, whatever. You disgust me. All you speak are words of selfish desire. What blasphemy to even consider manipulate nature and life to suit your own will? God, don't make me laugh. It is impossible for lowly folk like you to comprehend my will. I alone hear the voice of God. Using brute force, is that your solution? I am the ruler of this country, not to mention God's will on earth. You dare strike me. Apparently you are not aware that blasphemy against the heaven has, has dire consequences. Man, that thing is a huge mouth. Let's get it! Ooh, are we fighting her too? Are we fighting her or just the little monster thing? Ah! 
Look, look. Oh, that thing is gonna go super sane. That's not fun. Uh. Oh, that's nasty. That's bad. No, that's nasty. I ain't trying to fight that family. Ooh. All right. All right, let's get it. You understand now, Bob, for the power of Cabell, the power of God, with the strength of Cabell and the mystics at my command, I will establish the ideal world I've always envisioned. Join me. What do you say? I grant you the opportunity to join God in creating a utopia. I have no interest, bruh. Yeah, I'm not interested in any utopia that you come up with. Cool, nothing is impossible with the secrets of Cabell at my command. As they say, the true path is apparent only in hindsight. I am truly disappointed. Hey, decided to follow me, could have been honored a citizen of the beautiful utopia. I don't care. Bishop, surely you're not going to. It cannot be helped. God's servants, they may be, but they are of no use if they refuse to do my bidding. You will simply understand. Alas! This must be a test that God has placed before me. It pains me. It truly pains me. Now it is time for Slogar to test his new powers on you. Even if you are helpless against the powers of Cabell, revel in his strengths before you depart for the other world. Alright. Let's get a fight. Let's get it. Now, I don't know if I saved. Or no, I don't know if I healed before I saved. I know I saved. I don't know if I healed. Is Maya even going to be in this fight? Yeah, she is. Okay, everyone looks healed up. So I think we should be pretty good. You know what? I'm just going to go... I'm just going to go... Roaring Fang. That's new. I'm just going to go Bam Bam. Bam Bam. I'm just going to go Super Hyper. Okay, we're just going to go Fever Wind with this guy. And we'll begin. Oh, yeah. So Maya can't do anything right now. What is this guy doing? What do we do, Master? It can be helped. We will have to take care of this on our own. Okay, so Maya won't be able to help us this fight then. Ooh, that means we have no healing, basically. Oh, we're not doing damage to it. We're not doing damage to it. Oh. I just wasted all of that AP. Cool. That actually kind of hurts. Alright, maybe we'll use our origin then? Right? Um... We'll try attacking again. Let's see if the origin does anything. Clearly, it wasn't really nothing hitting it didn't do much. Maybe some good old fire in the face does nothing. Okay. Even origin moves aren't working. Powers have no effect. A fiend of the night can only be fought by light. Well, um, we have no light. So that sucks. Extinct fall. Hey, brother. So, um, master. Keep your wits about you. He's distorting his own image. It's no wonder that the moves have no effect. Okay, well, what do you want me to do about it, family? I guess we're maybe supposed to, like, outlive him? Bronze Brome? Let's use that. And then let's just attack again. Let's try to get our AP up. So weak from this. It's still some fun. And then... Heal with that. Give us a good bit of healing right there. Okay, um... 
just heal leaf on ourselves. Let's do that, guard. I don't know if we're gonna get anywhere with this, but hey. I guess we'll find out. I'm, really, I'm starting to think we just gotta wait him out. Must be the power they were talking about earlier. She just fried that boy. Actually, just fried. Just like before. Again. <gasps> well, looks like we'll probably be able to hurt it now, at least. Hopefully we can hurt it now. Um, let's try Battle Flash. I don't know. Don't guard with him. Let's try Cannon Blast. Yes, now we can do damage. Maya did something to take away its shield, which is nice. And see, now it's taking a lot of damage. Yeah, see, now you know what's good. Come on, let's get it. Dust break? Bro, that's not gonna do nothing to me. What you mean? Alright, let's uh, go ahead and do that again. With him, do that again. Oh, beat the crap out of him. That was awesome. Beat the crap out of him. We do about 3,000 damage for us to start every single time. So. Oh. Ow. Okay, we're definitely gonna have to go ahead and heal ya boy. Let's go ahead and heal Leaf ourselves. And with him, go Fever Wind. There you go. There we go. Hopefully we get off the heal before he attacks. Okay, good. And we might have to heal a couple times, actually. Uh, what's he gonna do? Sting fall. Yeah, that, that only does about 200 damage. That doesn't really do much, actually. Okay, uh, battle. Oh, Maya is just kind of sitting on the floor. Okay. Yo, oh, 1,000. Okay, I didn't realize I had that. Yeah, let's, let's heal for 1,000. And then let's go cannon blast again. There we go. Two thousand nine hundred. That's pretty good. Let's go ahead and heal a thousand, so then we can actually start making some leeway on damage with Aqua. We can attack him again. Sorry. Now we could probably survive another two hits, so we're gonna go. We're gonna do Battle Flash one more time, so then we can just pull out two Hyper Arts next time, and we'll do Fever Wind again. Is it dead? Oh, dead. We don't even need the hyper art, whatever. Yeah, we beat it up with our fists. Okay, that was a good bit of XP. Eh, kinda. Not, not amazing XP, but you know. Ugh. Maya, Maya, was that you? Was that your power? I remember this terrible light, the very same light again. I did, did I Maya you can speak as your voice returned What happened? 
Did I did I use that power again? Why do I have this power? How I wish I didn't. And father, and mother. Maya, don't don't blame yourself. We couldn't have defeated him ourselves. We needed your power to do it. Power itself isn't inherently good or evil. It's up to the person who wields it. We couldn't have made it without you. I believe in you, Maya. Thank you, Aqua. But I don't know how to use magic, really. Question mark. Maya has potential for magic in her blood. She has yet to be able to wield it. But at the moment, we must concentrate on finding our way out of this labyrinth and into the castle. You're right, the Aqualith is waiting for us. Let's go. Alright, let's get a move on. Right, hopefully we can find a save point. Let's see what's behind this door. And it seems to be books. Demon theory? Ugh. Stars? Ugh. Organs? Camping kit? I'll take the camping kit. Can I yoink those potions? Apparently not. Ancient writing. Fundamentals of geological faults. I, sorry, I don't care. I like geology as, the, as much as the next guy, but uh, yeah. Okay. All right, let's keep going down. Maybe we'll come back to, ooh, those are enemies. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to fight each of these. Go to this door. Can I just ditch the other room? What does this say? There is an order to everything. Well, yeah. That's how things work, huh? Okay, no. Okay. Well, this puzzle's fairly easy then. We just gotta find the correct one. Nope, that's not correct. Yes, that one's correct. What about this one? Okay, that one's correct. Hey, we got it literally like. Almost first try. We didn't. We found the first one and then we found the rest almost instantly. Adventures log two. Okay, that will probably help us with the turquoise puzzle. Not turquoise, tortoise. Tortoise. I can't say that word. Uh, items. Okay. Richa uh, of tortoise. I was put up by the pedestals there. Too powerful. Yellow earth bathed in indigo and the world was cleansed. Red bore green winds and the world. So, yellow. Yellow, indigo, red, green. Indigo, red, green. Yellow, indigo, red, green. Nice! Geniuses! 200 IQ. Alright, now let's check out this one. Start out with the rightmost. Oh boy. Okay, I don't know what to do in that room yet, so we're gonna try the second room. Oh, it's the chest. Adventures Log 3. Okay, that could probably help us with Scorpion. Let's just check out... I know we're probably gonna have to fight those skeletons. We'll do that in a I minute. Skull Raptor Jelly Melts. Uh, Maya talks now. We've never heard Maya talk. All of a sudden, she just talked. I will not lose. So, uh, that's new. Okay, we need Sharon, which is character we're getting later. Wink, wink. That's... Ooh. Can we fight... Can I, like, straight up this fan? Oh, we can just... Bop them. Get out of here. I want to fight you. Get out of here. There's sculpture. Alright, what does this say? The clock shows 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock? Wait a minute. Right, okay. Let's turn this one off. This should show 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock, right? 3 here, 12 here. Signify it's three o'clock exactly. Oh, okay. Okay, so before we continue there, let's 
Let's go back to the other one. Right, right, right. Next room over. Okay, so we got another entry, right? Oh, Scorpion. Seven. Seven, four, two, fifteen. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, nope, not him. There we go. Seven, four to the right. So one, two, three, four. One, one, two. And what was it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Oh, I keep doing that. It's so annoying. I think this is right? Yes, that is right. Okay. Good. Smart boy. Smart boy. Where does this take us? Play cure. Get right over it. And continue with what we're supposed to be doing. Run through this room. Alright, now. Continue. Is this locked? Use gold key. Yes. Uh, but I don't want to go just yet. Hello? Oh, smash. Get those out of the way. Okay, can't go that way. Let's see what's over to the left. The effect of cooking wore off. Okay, another thunder gate. And a hole in the wall. Cool. Meaning we have nothing left to do. But, uh, go over here. Is there anything? Better. Let's go. Good stuff, good stuff. Looks like we're in the castle now. Go back in here. Tech medicine. Take it. HP and MP fully recovered. Okay. Then, uh, I'm not gonna take any other ones. I know one no. of first strike. Sick. Okay. These are new. Let's try this move. I don't think I've ever done that move, actually. Let's do it on Doplin Reserve. No, on the Officer. I think an Officer would be stronger than a Reserve, so. Do Fever Wind on the other Officer. And we still can't do anything with Maya, so we're just gonna chill. Okay, these things aren't even strong at all. Jeez. I thought that thing would be a lot stronger. Okay, we did 2,600 damage. Let's see what this does. Ooh, damn. Ooh. That's a banger right there. They're just like made for blocking and not attacking, but he blocked quite a few of those. Alright, oh, we got stone to eight. That's kind of cool. Hey, remember the monster that was in here? Yeah, we killed it. Okay, there's gonna be nothing over there. I'm not gonna question logic. Stone has a new block, so we, there's probably some new moves we can play here. Um, man, I know I'm gonna encounter some. Oh, the fat, chunky guy, man. I think I'll help you. Alright, let's go ahead and save real quick. Okay, let's also do some healing up while we're at it. There's a chest in this one. It's locked. Oh, yeah? Can I not use Origins in here? Okay. Go through here. Chest. Empty. Empty. Alright. Good thing we didn't get into another fight. Ah, oh, now we're gonna have to go through all of this again. Uh, real quickly, let's use a healing powder on Maya there. Wait, how much health does she have? Oh, yeah. She, okay, she's... Yeah. Okay, hey, look at that. Woo! Nice. Uh, oh, I was gonna... Ch okay, no, I can't. Origin power. That's kind of a shame. Please! Let's get out of here, dude. I don't want to fight any more of those peasants. Literally do nothing. Run down here. Let's do up another save real quick. We need to go to the top here. Yes, this is where we need to go. But saving was a good idea. What are in each of these rooms? Chest. Dawn's up poison? Question mark? 
Let's check out this room. Anything in here? Nope. We can go to this other room. Anything in the wardrobe? Nope. I think we're gonna call it for this episode, guys. So thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like in the comment as it was my channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye. Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Legea. Oh, okay. Hey, who are you? I don't know. Ooh, that's a big boy. It's a big boy. Yes. Red Armored Hulk. We fought the blue one earlier. You there. What? I can't read. Behavior to display here in the Doppel Castle. Insolence. Impertinence. Up ahead in St. Dobrin's Church, Doplin, Bishop of the Holy Order of Banderas, is Raynolf, sir. He mustn't say. Oh, yes, Doplin bringing in the sacred azure stone is top secret, isn't it? Yeah, kind of is. This is the man. <laughs> He's the one that defeated Balkan, Raynolf, sir. Yes, we defeated his brother? What? Balkan? You shall address him properly. It's the mighty Balkan to you. Is he like his brother? So, this is the lot that killed my brother. Yes, that is his brother. I'll show you a thing or two before you die. To avenge my brother Balkan's death for the honor of the Red Knights. <laughs> In the name of Saint Jopran, 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 I don't know. Dude. I, Raynoff, will see hell on earth. Alright, buddy. Try me. What's the matter? Speechless at the sight of me, are you? Well, there's no escape for you. I will avenge my brother's death. I'll kill you slowly. Inch by inch. Hi, right, brother. I dare ya. Let's get it. Rain off of the brave. I'm not gonna even care about the Crimson Warriors. I'm just gonna... Bomb rush him. Roaring Fang? Will do. From bomb rush rain off the... The red? I don't even know. Cannon Blast. And then... Moon Splitter, why not? Right at Rain off the Brave. Guard with her for now. Yes, yes. That is a That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Not too shabby. Let's, let's see how much his Hype Riot does. That is some good stuff right there. That is some good stuff. How much the Red Knights do? Aw, oh, these Red Knights don't even do anything. They don't even have to draw. Oh, let's see how much. Oh. Three attacks. Okay. <laughs> ah, the scent of battle. This one reeks of Balkan's regret. <laughs> Alright, buddy. I can also smell you burning in hell. <laughs> Okay, buddy. Whatever you say. We're all attacking Aquaman. Leave him alone. All right, let's let's you know, let's let's uh, fang him again. Go ahead and blast him right in the head again, and then we'll use a uh, heal leaf on your boy Aquaman. Yeah, he's so hard. Gotta make sure boy Aqua don't die. We can do his hyper art. Okay. Ow, ow, ow. It's not over. She could Dude, she's gonna get one shot. She literally just got one shot. Are you kidding? What am I supposed to do about that? Are you serious? Alright, alright, dude. You guys, you guys wanna play a little bit, huh? Alright. Right. Alright, oh, fine. I'll bring my organs into it, alright? These people think we're playing. We ain't playing nothing. Out of here, dude. Now we were playing games. Finish so soon? Hmm. I see. This must be the origin I have heard about. 
I cannot stop trembling. Its power is incredible. <laughs> I'm filled with fear, but I will not run away. Alright, buddy. After all, I am Raynor the Brave, leader of the Red Knight. Sir Raynor. All hail Raynor the Brave, pride of the Red Knight. Alright, dude. Whatever you say, alright, buddy. Dude, does he has his does does he have his little crimson knights next to him again? Yes, he does. Very nice. I'll take them off with me. I'll take them with me. Why not? It's a nice little cherry on top. It really is no use. The young nobles are painted to die right here. At my hands. Are you serious? I just wiped like everything this dude has, and he's like. They are fated to die by my hand. No, dude. Don't you get it? Bro, this dude's like, I'm gonna kill him. And he does a solid 200 damage. Bro, what you think this is? Alright, we're gonna use a restore leaf on me real quick. Uh, and then with him, we're gonna use a revival bottle. These are quite expensive, but... Um... I want, I want Maya to get her XP, dude. The XP matters to me quite a bit because... I don't know if you guessed it by now, but I'm keeping Maya in my party throughout the end of the game. So, I definitely want her to have her, uh, her XP. Except, she can get one shot. That's the issue. Yes, yes, attack him. You're not going to do much damage to him. Rage wave. Oh. It's not that bad. We definitely need a. Okay, I was like, we need a heal with Maya. We definitely need a heal with Maya pretty quickly. Um, let's do Battle Flash and then hit your boy Brave. Let's go ahead and do Cannon Blast. Oh, wait, Cannon Blast and then Moon Splitter on Brave Origin. Oh, that revives Anderson. Oh, okay. Well, hey, there's our revive. Uh, let's do a soft blessing on everybody. Let's do it. Punch this guy in the face a few times. Wind of comfort. Okay, good. She heals before any attacks, so there's no like chance of instant death, which is very, very nice. Although I'm really doubting how much healing this does. It'll probably not do more than 200. 400, okay. Hey, I'm not complaining. I'll take it. Take it. Do a little bit of damage. Do a little bit of battle flash. There we go. Not an amazing amount of damage since it's not a hyper art, but. Ain't nothing. Ow, 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 ow. Don't, don't attack her, dude. Don't. I don't want to revive her again. It's expensive. No, dude! That's like $2,000 to revive her, bro! Leave her alone, man! Jeez! You know what? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna punch you in the face. You want this kick? You want this kick? Man, that's so much money, man! Why are you guys screwing me like that? Jack Slayer. Okay. What should we do this time? Split world. Not that much damage, my guy. Can you not do that, please? Go ahead and use that on me. Go ahead and use a revival elixir on your, your dead girl. And hopefully she doesn't get targeted by the stupid soldiers again. Alright. Heal up, heal up, heal up. Okay, what is he gonna do? Raging wave. Mom! 
bro. I just want to give Maya her XP, dude. Why you guys gotta make it so difficult? God, I could end this fight so long ago, but I just want to beat them, man. Whatever, bro. Fine, we'll just beat you up then. Guess we don't. Oh wait, Fever win. Messed it up again. Uh, like that. Hold the moon splitter, man. Come on. Beat him in the face. Are we done? Oh, looks like that's it. Dude, oh my god, one turn. One turn away from Maya but not being dead. Uh, the dude's angry, bro. He's like, uh, <laughs> 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 Is in your hands. You have a third brother? The they have a third brother. He's down. The rain off is down. Run. Hey, the brother. <laughs> Don't be like, oh no, we gotta run. Dude, just run. It doesn't matter. I don't care. Okay, but. Did he just say that? Oh, that's. Ooh, that's that a lot of XP though. Did they say they have a third brother? He said the brother, now it's only in your hands. Rain off the brain has been defeated. Run, escape. Dang. So we're gonna have a third brother to beat up. It's gonna be sick. What's well, so brave about her? I'm expecting more than a challenge. Doppler up ahead. Sacred? Azure? Let's get it. Sacred Azure stone's probably the Aqua with Aqua. Yes, it sure is. Let's get it. Let's go. Alright, let's go. Let, let us go ahead and do it. Real quick, we're gonna heal though. Heal all the way. And there's a save right here. So we're gonna go ahead and do a quick save. like that All right, let's see what's good chapel of st. Joprin hey that's Doplin what's he doing what's that There's something engraved in it Oh my, that monolith, there's one just like it in my village. That monolith, there's one like that in your village too, Maya. Yeah, but there's something a little different about this one. There's something black and gray in it. You! Question mark, exclamation mark. What? What are you doing here? How in the world did you get away from Slogar? You didn't notice that Slogar was dead? No? Just exactly, what exactly are you up to? What's that monolith you're worshipping? Some kind of religious mumbo jumbo? Mumbo jumbo, bite your tongue. This represents all of my ambitions. I mean, Avalon's ideal world. When the black sun engraved on this monolith rises, then our utopia, our kingdom of the gods, will be born. Don't tell me you lot came here looking for the sacred azure stone. You can't have it, it's mine. A stone, my village needs that stone. Hand it over. What are you talking about? Avalon gave me the stone. Besides, I need it. Want to make me into a god? I'll never give it to you. Well, too bad, no problem. Oh, this dude's going into a black hole. What? Oh, bro, it's Avalon, ain't it? Bro, he's about to step out. No, wait. No, yes, maybe? Where's Avalon at? Yes, bring on Avalon. There he is. That's the guy I was looking for. Or not looking for because he's strong. Uh, 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 you! Exclamation mark. Exclamation mark. Gold eyes. Avalon is golden eyes. Woo! Avalon. So it's Avalon, is it? Avalon. Yes. Just as I was told, here are Earth, Life, and Flame. How is it possible? If he is human, even if he is a mystic, then by all rights, he should be dead. How could he survive? Remember, first episode, that dude stabbed us. What force is this? So, this is the supreme origin. It radiates pure power. And yeah, that dude stabbed us in the first episode. He saw us, he was like, yoink. So, he probably thought we were dead. I 
think this is the man. Ogle, let me answer your question for you. Oh boy, he's raising his hand. That's not good. Yo, yo, can you? Oh, okay. I was like, bro, he's about to like force choke you, like that. Darth Vader, dude. That's our stone. I need that. <laughs> give me the stone. Give me the stone. Give me the stone. Wait, Avalon, what are you doing? What are you going to do? He's just going to give us the stone? Yoink. Take it. Yikes! Hey, that's my line. What is this? What is this light? Yes, there's no question about it. No question about what? He is a star shaper. Huh. If you want the stone, go ahead and take it. Soon the eclipse will completely cover the earth and a new world will be born. And then the old race will perish and only mystics will survive. This dude is trying to wipe out humans, brother. I was born with one purpose alone, to change this world. I will become the ruler of the new world. <sighs> okay. You are the chosen one. Come and build a new world with me. Uh, I'm just gonna reject it. Count me out. I don't give a damn about your ideals or the new world. I came here to save my village. Do you actually think I'd help you with your crazy scheme to change the world? Our powers are for protecting the natural order, for protecting the world. I'd rather die than be part of your world. So you, you refuse to cooperate, do you? You insist on defying me. I see. Avalon, let me handle this. I'm sure we'll meet again someday. Okay, so basically, if you don't follow along with the game, basically what just happened, our main goal was to get that stupid stone back. Now, it... We got the stone, that's not an issue. Now, the point of the game is, we're gonna try to stop him so he doesn't uh, kill all the humans. Wait, just a minute, Avalon. So that's a new revelation. Now we don't care about some stupid stone. Now we care about, uh, you know, trying to save all of the humans type of thing, you know? Avalon went yeet into that portal. Hold it, we're not we're not through talking. Yes, we are. Slogar is oh, but you probably don't remember that name. That beast you fought in the Cabal ruins. That was just a mere imitation of the real thing. What I'm summoning now from the depths of hell is the true beast. Although its appearance is similar, you will know the difference as you pass from this world. Okay, buddy. I guess we're fighting the real thing now. Oh boy, that one's much bigger, but guess what, we're great at this game, so we're gonna 200 IQ it and beat it up. Yeah, let's do it. Alright, um, first let's see if we can do damage to it. It seems to happen a lot in this game where like it, you can't do damage to it, so I'm not gonna waste too much AP. Do Fever Wind, a Critical Thrust. Guard with her. Let's see if can we actually do damage to it. Why? They're from the same family. Why do they choose to be destroyed? I don't know. We are a race very much in touch with nature, and if we are to disobey our hearts, there's a price to be paid for such actions. Also, through that dialogue, we also found out that. We're a star shaper? Anything with the word star and shaper means we're probably a big so. <sighs> Feels like he could almost sweep out my heart just by looking at me. Leave this to us and hide in a safe place. I'm scared. But we can't run. I'm fighting too. Yeah, that's the spirit. Nothing is going to stop me from returning the Aqualith. Not even this thing. I will beat it up then. Let's go. Ready. Let's get it. And we can't do damage. I told you guys, don't waste your AP first round because for whatever reason, all boss fights in this game does not let you do damage first turn. Why? I don't know. Won't let you do it though. Bang! What are you gonna do? Come on, just a blow. That's not even that much damage, brother. Alright, do we have to maybe 
throw an origin thing at it. Let's just throw an origin thing at it. See what it does. This stupid thing is just vibrating, man. Stop vibrating. Infuriating. Let's see if an origin does anything. If an origin does nothing, then uh, we probably have to wait it out like the last one and uh, wait for Maya to go ham and just throw some light at it or something. Yep, that's that way. We just have to wait it out. So we're just gonna heal, attack, heal, attack, heal, attack, heal, attack. Let's see what he does this time. That's the blow! That's the blow. If we don't use magic, we can't. We can't. Come on, Maya. No, I can't. Maya, you got this. What should I do? I have to do something. Or else... Use your magic. Come on. Alright, we're just gonna get our AP up. Start with him. We're gonna origin life blessing with her. Yeah, we just gotta wait this one out, I think. Wind of comfort. Gonna heal up real quick. Do the same. You know, let's just guard, guard, origin. Let's go ahead and heal again. Okay, we're just gonna wait this thing out. So, uh, yep, we're just gonna, yeah, wait it out. How much we can do about this one? I don't know if we actually have to attack it for cutscenes to trigger. Um, we'll figure it out in a second, I guess. If it doesn't trigger something, then we'll probably attack it next round. Oh, see, we don't have to. We just literally just have to wait. Oh, that's a yikes. Oof. 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 This thing came from another world. Does this beast have any weakness? Magic. But hey, uh, not like we have a I won't magic lose. user. I will keep my promise and return with the aqualet. Hi, right, buddy. No oh. matter what, I'll never give up. Same. Come on, my dude. Throw some ice, ice beams at it, man. Uh. Yeah. Some magic particles. Yeah. Do not just speak the words. Feel them in your heart. Earth and wind, water, fire. You must hold the whole world inside your body. Earth and wind, water, fire. Yes, that's how you do magic. Very good stuff. Guard, guard. Let's attack. Cool. We can attack now. Uh, let's see. I don't know. Water, water. Oh, we got a few blocks. Water, water, fire, fire, wind. Let's get it. I'm not gonna Google moves right now because I don't know. I'm just gonna finish this fight and I Google moves. Gust the blow. Let's see how much magic we do this thing. How much damage? I can't do it. Something's not. Right. Come on, just throw fire at it, man. Earth and wind, water, fire. You must hold the whole world inside your body. I'm going to try again. There you go, I believe in you. Alright, guard, guard. Earth, wind, water, fire. Water. Water is the best. Water. Ah! Alright, come on, Maya. Leaving you. Who's <laughs> that? Oh no, he's, he's she's glowing. Yeah, she's glowing. 
Eat it up! Come on! Ooh. Ooh, that's some magic right there. Oh, he beat. She, Are you all right? She beat that thing up. It worked. I did. There you go. Good stuff. I like it. All right, come on, beat it up. Man, I'm really tempted to look up some of her moves now. Down, down. I guess we'll just do that. This should be another move. Get some of them right quick. New art. Ice flow. Well, that is a misspelling. It's supposed to be ice f l o w. That is f l. That is really bad spelling. Ooh. Then water, water. That should be a new move right there. We leave ourselves to make sure this guy don't die, because I can use a revive, but if I don't have to, I don't want to. Now. Boom, boom. Left. And then water, water. Let's try that one. This one should be a good one. Wonderful. Whack, whack. I like she just started magic and all of a sudden she's just like, oh, that sucks. That, that is, that could, she done got blown away. Oh, oh we can do damage now? We can do damage. Oh. That makes sense. Shoot. I don't have to fight with just her. I am dumb. I am dumb. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna beat it up then. We're gonna beat it up. And we also got another block for Aang, so we could do a move. We're gonna beat him up then. What are we doing? I didn't realize we could fight with, with swords just yet. Okay. I feel pretty dumb now, actually, that I. Oh, 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 oh. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, my guy, don't do that. What are you doing? Dude, he's gonna kill us. Oh, he's gonna kill us. Jesus. Dude, we can't do anything, bro. Hello? Can Maya get unstunned by chance? Thank you, jeez. Come on. Alright. Uh, let's, uh, let's go ahead and use the origin, revives, let's go ahead and revive Aqua, eh? Give me strength. Probably a good idea. Probably a good idea. Now, how much is he revived? Oh. Toxic dark? Okay. It's good that he attacked him. Because everyone else is pretty low right now, so we're gonna go ahead and use another bronze barome. Get everyone back up. Use another bronze barome. Get everyone back up again. Because <sighs> stone is stone is stunned right at the moment, so we're gonna have to kind of wait him out. Although this fight could have ended probably a while ago if I only realized that hey, hey buddy, you can uh, attack with swords now. God, I feel like an idiot. I could have done so many things. <laughs> Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and do Battle Flash. Down, down. With her, let's try a new attack. Um, Down, down, up. And then we'll just do Water, Water. Again. Okay, we got some bigger ones coming along. New art. That's not that strong. Oh, the thing is a dark Tyvena, so I guess that makes sense, right? He's a dark monster. Dark probably doesn't do that much damage. Just the blow. That doesn't do much of anything. But you know what does do something? When my uh, controller gets unplugged, 
because then I can't play. Attack. Uh, let's do the same thing. Uh, we're gonna attack with a new thing. Let's see. Alright, water. Right, 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 down, down, water. This, this should be a good one. Nice, strong one right there. Water. Hit him with a nice sprinkle of water. Toxic dark. Ooh. Stone is no longer paralyzed, so that's good. Battle. Uh. This is the same thing. Uh, item. No, 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 no. Item. Heal potion. Heal yourself. Attack. Let's try left. Yeah, there you go. Oh, man. Or was it down, down left? Oh, I think I was right. I was fine. Probably gonna do some hyper arts in the second one, Aang. Or Aqua, Aang, whatever, man. Nova Heat. This should hurt him. Nice. Water. A little bit of that water. Just the blow. We're gonna go ahead and do some hyper arts on this guy now. So we're gonna go ahead and go, um, it's like that. Bam. With him, we're gonna go ahead and cannon blast, and then lightning kick, and then we're gonna item with her and use a heal leaf on herself. There we go. Spell does some strong damage. I should probably be attacking with him a lot more. Uh, this, this boss is basically a joke. Like damage-wise, he really, he really doesn't do that much damage. Ha! Hm. Nice noises, man. Okay, she's out of die zone, so that's good. This thing's never gonna die. Augusta Blow! I guess we'll go back to Windblade. And down, down. Cannon Blast again. Go. You won't Is it dead? Nothing. Well, it was something. You're almost dead, buddy. Go ahead and use Heal Leaf on yourself. Him, do the same thing. Attack. I'm not dead, huh? This is gonna take forever to die, man. I guess, and then the Moon Buster. Better do Cannon Blast. Cannon Blast, but then also Critical Thrust. And then with her origin, let's do a Life Blessing. There we go. Oh, 
thousand damage. Close call. Oh, we finished the fight. Okay. Good, good, good. Ten thousand experience. Too bad. Fire big bang. Ice flow. Inferno. Thunderhead. Dark disaster. Ice fire. Nova heat. Aqua spirit. Magma mayhem. Heart block increased to six. Let's get it. And we still have two or three more moves to learn on her. We're all alive, and it's all thanks to Maya. That guy said Aqua is a star shaper. Hmm, that man also carries a supreme origin. What was he saying? Something called the Eclipse would completely cover the Earth? He's a mysterious one. Oh, we got the Aqualith. The stone is starting to glow again. Aqua, you can save your village now that you've got your stone back, right? Yeah, that's right. The whole village will be safe with this. In that case, let's get a move on. Back to your village. I still wonder why. Why did it give me back the Aqua? It's true. Why did he give him back the Aqua? Oh, that's a spooky place. Got a giant, like, earth. I'm so sorry, I had no idea Zone Stora could be defeated. Take these back to their altars. The sacred stones, but... Yes, of course. Ross and I will defend the altars to the death. Hello? Dialogue? I wanna know. Why did... What are you thinking, having them take the sacred souls back? I want to give that boy a little test. I have to see if he really holds the same power I do. If he really is a star shaper, he'll eventually find his way to me. And he'll be carrying all three stones. I look forward to that moment. The eclipse will soon start. If I want to create the new world, I must gain control of this power now. Right, so we gotta get all three stones. Looks like it. Okay, guys, so we're gonna save right here, and I think we're gonna call it for this episode, guys. So thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as a personal channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye. Hey, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Legea. So we finally got the Aqualith back, and we're gonna head back to uh, Home Village. So this should be pretty cool. Let's get started. Uh, right now, I'm in the Doppling Castle, if you guys remember. And the game really should be wrapping up from here pretty soon on. Um, enemies are going to get a lot tougher. We're going to level up quite a bit. We're just kind of walking out of the castle like nothing's going on, which is kind of cool. Um, one thing that we should do is we should probably like upgrade our stuff. But I'm not exactly sure what there's actually to upgrade. I'm pretty sure all this stuff is like what we have right now. Maybe, wait, hold on. We haven't tried combining weapons. Fire Edge. This is what we have now. The Venom Blade. Oh, let's make the Venom Blade. Right, so that's a little bit of a stronger sword. I guess what we'll do, we'll just go over to... Uh, the item shop, uh, restock our items, and then, uh, yes, oh, yeah, and then, and then we'll just upgrade stuff later on, I guess, let's get lots of heal leaves, um, let's get four of those, we have plenty of everything else correct, yep, okay, uh, and I guess we'll get a few more elixirs, there we go, alright, we're good. We're basically pretty stocked up. We were over level going to the last dungeon, so it didn't really matter. Like, we didn't use many healing items. Alright, so we're gonna go back to the town of Knoll. So we're gonna be ske skeeting through uh, the, the Gale. Yeah, and there should be people waiting for us here, which is kind of cool. never been around here before. Who would have thought there would be a town beyond such a canyon?
Aqua, you're looking well. Huh? Oh, this old guy is stone. I guess you could call him my master. She's Maya. They both helped me find the Aqua. But hey, you've got the Aqua. Sure, we brought it back. Wait here, I'll go get everyone right away. That's kind of neat. Old guy, master. Oh, I think we need an ice lift to stop your head from swelling. Now I see. I've been too easy on you. Next time we'll have a special lesson in humility. So you better be ready. Oh boy. Since that dismal day, the day the day Aquilith was stolen, we have endured a grim existence. But you, you have saved us. On behalf of everyone in this town, let me express her gratitude. Thank you. Now, the hand that returned the Aquilith must restore it to its rightful place. Oh boy. What's going on? Hey, there's water again. Nice. I like water. Water's good. In my name. <laughs> Look at the running animations. Those are great. Aqua, you, you son of a gun. You really did it. Aqua. Ah, uh, tonight we must celebrate your success. That's right. We've got to get moving. Come on, Nancy. Boy, that, that dude's running. Wait a minute. You, I'm really proud of you, Aqua. Yeah, you better be proud of me. I'm sick. Save the town. Sick. In the house. Well, here comes the toast of the town. We're cooking up something extra special for tonight, but the ingredients are top secret. Don't oh, Maya, they're eating too, right? Uh, I think it would be a pity for us not to accept your invitation. Don't you agree, Maya? Thank you so much. I hope it won't be an inconvenience. Oh, no, no, no. It's nothing special. But please stay and make yourselves at home. Trust me, it's nothing special. What did you say? <laughs> not mistaken, aren't you the one who's always asking for seconds and thirds? And who always compliments my cooking? Well, I guess I have to let you off easy today after all. You're the hero that brought back the Aqua. But it's not like you got it back all by yourself, right? Just you, Aqua? That'd be impossible. But Nancy, there's something burning. Sigh, a waste of a perfectly good meal. Oh, you leave us for a day or two, and what do you know? Came back looking more like a man, right, Aqua? Oh, and you certainly worked wonders on this boy. I suppose it's up to me to thank you, seeing that I'm the closest thing to a father he's got. How about joining me in my room for a drink? You look like you can knock him back. Do I hear a challenge to a drinking contest? Be warned, I can drink till kingdoms come. This should be interesting, as you wish. We'll drink until one of us can drink no more. Hehe, <laughs> I hope we don't run out of stuff. <laughs> Gotta love those two. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Don't worry about cleaning it. I've got it. Please, I'm, I'm used to doing this sort of thing. Well, if you insist, thanks. Gotta get started. And he started cooking all over again. Maya and have left the party. Alright, so it looks like Maya is chilling with Nancy. Where's my room, fam? Is there, did I yoink things out of the drawers? Oh, I already yoinked some stuff, didn't I? Well, let's go see what these tore up to. A very impressive selection. Let's try this one. Gold. Go, goes down easy and has a refreshing appetite. That's what I needed. What's the matter, Aqua? We're in the middle of a contest. Man to man, wanna join us? What do you say? 
Oh, bottomless. Is this really some of you? He's a bottomless pit. Oh, <laughs> we still have plenty left. Uh, how about an Aqua? Now you probably wouldn't like it. Yeah, those those two are funny. Old old man drinking and then um, what the old man has to say? Thought we were doomed. If Aqua thinks you, the sun we can all live in peace again. Um, so yeah, I guess let's take a rest. I think that's probably what I'm supposed to do, right? Yeah, 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 okay, now everyone's gone. They're probably outside waiting for me. Yeah. Yes, very nice. Okay, I'm smart. What did I keep? There, or there. Tighten your, ah, ah, I don't know what they're saying. Guide your weight through your fist. Ah! Combine your moves. Both large and small. Focus to finish off your opponent. Guessing stone is giving Galvin, Galvan, a little lesson, huh? Oh, Aqua, you're finally awake. Since you said that he was your master, I thought I'd test him a little, but look, he's teaching me now. His style may be unrefined, but he has a lot of potential. Really? You think so? <laughs> I think it's time we left, Galvin. Galvan. Oh, let's be off then. We thought we'd go to Hunter's Wood to do a little hunting. And I'd and I'll be going along to make sure that they don't get attacked by monsters. Well Stone, I'll be looking forward to our next lesson. Hmm, seems like we have some free time. Any ideas, Aqua? Um Let's go after them. What is this hunter's wood? It's a forest near. It's beautiful, lush green, lots of animals. Oh, how lovely. Let's go, Stone. Hmm, bad idea. Besides, I can teach you a new move or two, and the buildings will be safe from your wild strokes. Alright, then let's get going to Hunter's Wood. Maya and Stone have joined the party. Are they Gucci? They're Gucci. Okay. So uh, obviously, for the game to progress, uh, the enemies in Hunter's Wood have been replaced, and they are stronger now since we have continued on with the game. Let's help things work. So, we're gonna save real quick. So let's just go over here and see what is good in uh, the Hunter's of Wood. Woo! Enemy already. Okay. Let's see. Saber Wolf. Okay. Oh, and my sword looks sick. We need to find a suitable opponent for our lesson. I will teach you the Sky Fang art known as Divine Bolt. First look, battle. Okay, I know how to battle. Next choose attack. I know how to attack, brother. Oh, now enter. Up, up, down, down, right. Up, down, down, right. Okay. We will watch from here. Okay, now finish it, Aqua. Oof, oof, oof. Let's see what he's gonna do. Hyper art. Down so soon. That's a good one. Oh, nice job, kid. But don't forget. Forget. Mind bolt. Nice. We got the mind bolt. Forget what the Okay, well, won't might as well go real quick. And let's keep going. See what's new. Uh I hope the Madhound Saber Wolf. Okay, there's like two different wolves. I need to do some uh let's attack the Madhound. I don't know which one's stronger, so I'll just attack that. The third, let's do Big Bang. And the Water Water. On this one, and go ahead and do Fever Wind on him. Critical Thrust. Alright, there we go. That should be it. Okay, they're not super strong. They can be. Oh, okay, yeah, they're super weak. I thought his attack would end. No, we overdid it by like a thousand damage. Oh, they sure attack really hard though. 500? That is a really good attack for that. 
power to destroy. Big Bang. This is a, this is a cool move, actually. Yeah, it's... Yeah, water, water. Water, water. Got him. Ooh, this one's a lot stronger, actually, yeah. Yeah, let's stop at this camping site. Let's go ahead and cook some stone curry. Yep. Nice. Some good. Let's do a little bit of chat and see what they say. Nancy, such a great sister, so she's pretty energetic. Uh, yeah, she is. She's not my sister, but and Nancy shows full of energy. Too much for me to keep up with sometimes. I envy. I wish I had a sister like her. Oh, Nancy and I aren't related. She's Galvin's daughter. Really, that means I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You didn't, you didn't know. I guess we do look like brother and sister to outsiders, though. Chat. If Galvin isn't your birth parent, who is them? I, I don't know, really. Sorry. I, I, I just shouldn't have. That's okay. Don't worry. I don't care about my real parents anyway. I'm fine with Galvin as my dad, even if he is a little uncool. If he heard what you said, he'd be touched and cry. No way, I bet he'd say, I'm uncool and hit me. Hmm, that's your right. Galvin and Buerto should be ahead of us. Let's find them. Alright, let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and find them. Look at this, a huge long-tailed deer. Oh, that certainly is quite a catch. Did you really kill all those monsters? Oh, that was nothing. I'm the captain of the Vigilance Corps, after all. Huh? Sky. What's happening to it? Good question, what is happening to it? It got so cloudy all of a sudden. Storm, maybe, but something's not right. Oh boy. The sun disappeared. <laughs> uh, it's pretty normal. Did, did the sun explode? There's a spooky sun right there. Hey, what's going on? This is creepy. The sun's black. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Monsters just... Ah, what are those things? You too. Get back to town. Wait, what are you going to do? Don't worry about us. Just let us take care of it. Galvin, you go on back and win the people in the town. Well, alright, but I want you to be careful. Let's get it. Seems like we got some new enemies. Corrosive Tusk. Alright, let's see how strong these things are. Uh, we'll go full out and you know what, we're just do we're gonna do a raging thing. Uh, just to go ahead and test them out. And do one of these. Alright, do that. With her, we're gonna go ahead and one. Go on that, and then with him, I guess we'll just go and again, I wanna test to see how strong these things are. So we're just gonna go ahead and just beat one of them up. There. Please be stoned. Oh, come on, man. Whatever. Okay, these things aren't super strong. Yeah, we stone can still beat one up. So they have around 4,000 HP. 
They basically attack the same as the other creatures. Okay. Oops. Oh, it's still pretty strong attack. I guess that wasn't a move? Unless I did like a hyper by accident. Okay, now let's go ahead and we'll just do battle flash since we know this these things aren't super strong. Go ahead, finish that one off. We're gonna guard with him. Go ahead and knock. Okay, don't do this to Stone or Maya. Stone or Maya. No, that's fine. Oh, wait, Stone is. I thought Stone was immune to that. Nah, that's fine, whatever. That is fine. Bum, bum. Yeah. Good amount of damage, I like it. Now, the only problem is that if this thing attacks Maya, she dead. So, I need. Okay, there we go. I was like, I need a stone attack for something. Very badly, so Maya doesn't get attacked. I have you. I have you. Very nice. I get better as I get older. Yeah, I bet you do. But I'm not too much XP still, man. Darn. Those monsters were terrible. Was it caused by the black sun? I wonder. Or was a flash of a black? Then those things were suddenly alive again. Well, then it makes sense, don't it? It's just like that mural. This is just like the mural we saw at St. Joffrey's. Oh yeah, that, that one was hanging in, in the church. Soon the eclipse will completely cover the earth and a new world will be born. Was this the eclipse Avalon was talking about? If what Avalon said was true, it's got to be more than just this. I mean, if we believe he's trying to destroy this world and create a new one, then this is only the beginning, an omen. If something terrible is going to happen, it'll come later. That's what I think. Anyway, let's go back to town. Everybody's probably worrying about us. I have better Okay, new 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 thing is Chaos Weagle and whatever that thing is. Yeah, they're not that strong. If Aang can one-shot them with right. just his first thing, he'll be fine. This thing is a little bit stronger, but uh, yeah, Stone is still one-shotting, so that's good. Now, let's see if she's able to. Let us don't oh, get into a battle. All right, let's get out of here. There we go. All right, let's see what's going on in the town, I guess. Maybe let's check the front of the town. Okay, the Aquilith is still. Wait, what does it say? All right, it was something about Aquilith is still going, but people are uneasy. What is a black sun? Let's see. Aqua, you alright? Don't worry about me. I've never seen anything like that before, but it was no match for me. Is the town alright? Yeah, I don't think anyone's seen that before, especially not in Hunter's Wood. We never know when we'll run into something like that again. You better be careful. Monsters now mutating into even greater monster obsidies? I think that black sun has something to do with it. I don't know, but it is ominous, that black sun. Galvin, I advise you to stay away from Hunter's Wood for a while. Fair guests, my apologies for the disturbance. Aqua, it is time for you to rest. I don't know, it seems pretty obvious to me that, um... Yeah, the monsters were by the... Because of the black sun. Seems kind of like two and two to me. But hey. Let's take a nap. Good, man. Um, let's see what he's up to. Just as he back, brought back Aquilith, now it's the creepy sun. 
All my years, I've never seen a sky like this, and with the events on it, it is a dire point indeed. Well, I guess it's time for us to fix it, huh? Is this what the, that guy meant? An origin of infinite power. Are we, are we going to become like those monsters and hunters would? I don't want that. We just brought back the Akala. Are we going to sit here and watch the world crumble right before our eyes? There must be something. There must be something that, no, that we can do. Me, everyone, the world, all changed? No, we can't let this happen. Aqua, you have spoken well. I feel very much the same, but that black sun, there are too many things not known to us. So, let's ask Reem. Reem? He is a spirit, a spirit that has lived as one with the earth for days from the days of old. If possible, if anyone can tell us about the black sun or the rot, it would be Reem. So, this Reem, where is he? In my hometown, past the forest maze, in a town called Yuno. Alright, Yuno. Aqua, you know it's quite far. I am certain there are many who will be sad to see you go as soon as you've returned. Prepare well for your journey. We will be waiting at the entrance of the town. Come when you feel that you are ready to depart. Alright, so I guess let's get going. Are you all set? You didn't forget anything, did you? No, I don't, I don't think I forgot anything. There's not much to do here. Well, I we start off to you know. Yes. Which way is Yuno? It's west of Darakin, but along the way we'll have to pass through the forest maze. Wrong the forest. There's a strange mist in the forest. It confuses the senses and makes one lose one's way. Then what should we do? Only Mizzle Red Sand will be able to counter the forest's evil presence. The guy has some in my home. Out of the way, we should go to Mount Gable to get it. Okay. We're going to Mount Gable and then the Forest Maze. What is the matter, Aqua? Nothing. Nothing at all. Alright, we're saying goodbye to the town once again. But guys, we're going to end off the episode here, guys. Thanks for watching. If you didn't enjoy, make sure to like and comment as well as the channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye. Hey, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Legea. Last episode, the sun turned black. That's not good, right? Um, we were tasked with going to Mount Gable, grabbing some red sand, and then heading over to the forest maze, and then getting to Yuno so we can talk to some spirit. So, uh, yeah, let's get started, I guess. Mount Gable first to grab some of that good, good red sand that uh, Stone was talking about. Well, let's see what kind of enemies are here. We haven't been here yet. Since the sun happened and there's new enemies, so let's. I'm not gonna underestimate these guys. Actually, yeah, I will. Uh, let's see how strong these things are. Volt Spine. I guess we'll just do Aqua Spear. Aqua Spear is pretty dope. And then Water Water, the second one. And let's just do Fever Wind. There we go. And then we can do Jaw Buster. There we go. Alright, let's see how strong these things are. Okay, they are pretty strong. Okay, I miss un miss underestimated them a little bit. I think I'll just like pass through here and I'll grind at the forest maze. Um, I wonder if there's anything over here. You know, I'm not gonna check now. It's fine. We'll check later. There should be a flower enemy and um. Like a rhino enemy. I want to see what they turned into. Here I go. All right. Oh, there's oh the mad thorn. Okay, so I guess the flower enemy is just that. All right, there's a camping site here. If we're gonna stop, we might as well cook some stone curry because this stuff gives us quite an attack boost. Rest because we need our MP back, and then just in case we somehow get wiped out here, there's a possibility. I don't know if there's a boss at the top of the mountain. I don't think there should be. They're just getting some red sand. But hey, might as well be safe. I'm sorry when I lose a little bit of progress. Here I go! Yes, these are the rhinos that I was talking about. So, elegrams. These things are probably quite strong. So I'm just going to go ahead and do... Um, 
ultimate moves on them. Because why not? The Mountain Crusher Elegrin. Okay. Now let's go ahead and I guess we'll just do that and then water water and then he'll have stone attack by himself. He has like full AP so he could just do job blaster on this one. Alright, let's see how this turns out. Okay, the thing are actually these ones aren't as strong as I thought. I'll take it. Easy fights, easy fights. We got a new... An, okay, this is new. You know what? I'm gonna try it because... Yeah, I've never done it before. Let's go ahead and give it a try, huh? <clears throat> oh, and we did it before the attack. Cool. Hellfire Wings. Should be interesting. Okay, he just like goes Super Saiyan. And... Okay, he goes Super Saiyan and flies through everybody. Don't waste my time. Cool. I like it. All right, we should be up at the top here now. He said he had some. Oh, didn't he sell his cabin to the? Hmm, this is strange. It should be right here. Someone really cleaned me out while I was gone. He even made off the dishes and my clothes. Darn, I completely forgot. I told Kenjiro that he could have it all. Ah, uh, that explains everything. Yeah, he did tell him that he could have it all. But what are we going to do? We can't make it through the woods without Mizzle Red Sand, right? Hmm. I think the only thing we can do is start looking for Kenjiro. Let's just hope he hasn't sold it already. Alright, Maya. Now, where would he go? Somewhere with a lot of people. Well, let's go find him. Okay, so... Yeah, I guess we gotta find him. Can we interact? I'm sure there's like something over here. What an ominous looking sky. Sure is. Okay. I honestly don't have a clue where we should even start. I kind of know, I kind of don't. Uh, we'll see. I have better. Oh, these are new Master Bakis. Um, yeah, we haven't faced these yet. Um, let's. Yeah, they're not very strong. They block. They can block. He already blocked a couple of my hits. But yeah. Hopefully not get another encounter. Yes. Okay, we made it out. Okay, where could we possibly go that has a lot of people? Best guess? Darkin, right? Biggest city in the game? Probably where he's at. Real quick, before we do any more searching, let's stay the night. Now, where would this guy be, huh? Oh, there he is, Kijiro. I'll buy anything you want to sell. I'll sell anything you want to buy. Hey, Kijiro, about that stuff I gave you the other day. Remember that thing called Mizzle Red Sand? That was a surprise stone. The town alchemist was just begging me to sell it to him. What? Did, did you sell it? I wouldn't let it go that easily. It's worth a fortune. Why, look, I have it right here. That's a relief, Kenjiro. Would you give it back to me? No, Siri, you gave it to me, so it's mine now. We really need it. We'll pay you as much. Honestly, I will beat the crap out. Like, technically, it's stones. You can just give them a little punch in the face and take it. And what's the issue? No, I wouldn't. I won't give this here up, no matter how much you'll pay. Bro, come on! Please, Kenjiro, we're begging you. We'll do anything for you. Bro, you literally stole it from his house. Like, oh, oh shucks, since y'all are begging, I guess I better oblige. Yeah, you better oblige. Listen up, I'll give you the measle red sand, but I want a lips tear in return. We got that. Lips teardrops? The lips are as hard to find as they are famous. They only shed tears from those lovely eyes once a year. It's, an incred it's incredibly rare. I think I have it. Is this it? Yeah, we got one before. Oh, aha, how'd you come up that there? I 
It don't matter. We're trading. Trade. You just give him the stupid lips to your man. You gave lips to in exchange for Mizzle Red Sand. Darn, I was looking forward to selling this baby, but... Nothing. I was just talking to myself. Honestly, I still would have maybe gone the route to just punch him in the face, because that's mine. But, howdy everyone, I'll buy anything you want to sell. That's a VIP card, sell you some great stuff. Okay. Uh, this guy should have some of the good good. Venom Blade. Um, is this stronger? Oh, it is? This Ice Sword is stronger. Okay, guys, so I think I'm just gonna end up buying all of this stuff. And then I also need Shadow Boots. And, yeah, we got the Beast Mantle. We got some shoes. Okay, I think we're good with that. I'm gonna buy all that. That was quite a bit. And then accessories and tools. Low feed. Ah, uh, yes, let's buy plenty. Let's buy 20 of these. Magic potion. Let's buy. Ooh, we can't. Alright, let's buy. Let's buy one of those. Let's buy five of these. Um, let's buy maybe five of these. We're not gonna need any of those. Flag our tree. Okay, now these are. This is what we kind of need to ch pick and choose. Um, then one of these. And I think that's basically all of our money right there. So that's kind of cool. Okay. So, uh, now we can go to the forest maze, which is really nice. Um, before we do that, let's stop by the jewelry store. And we can combine some accessories. Let's just go ahead and... Uh, okay, so now we got two rot rings. We can combine that with. Let's just do this one, I guess. And then combine that with the other rot ring. Get one of these. Hmm. Need so his sword is already good. Uh, but this is better. Um, I'm not gonna do those. This is better. Okay, now we gotta kind of pick. Um, so this increases your defense. We could put one of these on. I guess we'll just increase his defense by 16. Um... do that yeah there we go and then next character this is a lot better nothing in there spike shoes are way better and then we could do do the leather hood let's see um go ahead and do that Go ahead and do Poison Guard. And then with him, that's better. That's better. So we'll just add that in there. We can add one of these. Um, okay, and then we'll put the Sharpshooter. Yeah, okay. That is fine, I guess. Let's play with their skills. He has no defensive skills, all or nothing. Okay. Cool. Okay, I guess that works. Um, go ahead and go to the forest maze, I guess. We're gonna quickly save. Yeah, I think it's gonna be really important for me to learn how to combine accessories better. I don't know if I'm literally just combining them over and over and just wasting them. But either way, what's gonna happen now, guys? We're gonna go over to the forest maze and I'm gonna do a bit of grinding here because we're only uh, level like we're close to like level 27 like 28 29 that is not gonna be anywhere near enough I want to get to at least like 40 I don't know or at least 35 so we use the red sand good now we will not be led astray but we should still proceed cautiously that black sun may have affected the forest also okay so I think just oh we still got the stupid thing on Hmm. I guess I was walking out. These boys were upgraded into. Hocus Carcass. Hocus Carcass. Hocus Carcass. Okay. 
Let's see what these boys can do. Focus Carcass. Go ahead and do Mayhem. There we go. With a Water Water. Now let's go ahead and do Aerial Attack. And do that. Now, hopefully... I think I might miss. I, I will miss. Dang it. It's so annoying when these things are like down low. Okay, this thing's almost dead. Almost dead, not dead though. They are pretty strong. What really matters is how much XP they give us. That's what really matters. Oh, this thing's this thing was so close to being dead. Are you serious? Okay, cool. Let's see how much XP. That's what's important. Six thousand. Okay. Man. Hmm. I'll take you. Okay. So there are some new enemies: Beam Cannon and Dino Toro. And even that, see that one missed. We need to hit that one low, apparently. I don't know. So, let's see, we did about 3,000, so the thing has about 4,000, around HP. Let's see how much this beam cannon has. Big bang. This should kill it. I, If it doesn't kill it, I'd be surprised. Wow, okay. Things have quite a bit of health then, more than I, a little bit more than I thought. That, jeez, that thing is gigantic. It looks like our first boss enemy, but tiny and purple. All right, we're definitely gonna roaring fang this boy. Let's get the crap out of this crab. Let's see how strong this crab is. Oh, that crab is strong. I'm actually kind of glad I hyper arted. As I'm probably gonna need that hyper arc to kill. This thing is 10,000 HP. That's like as much as a. It's like half a boss. Yeah, okay. But. Your boy Aqua got it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, that is 5,000 damage. That thing is almost 10,000 HP, though. And hopefully it'll die. Hopefully this will die. I don't know if dinos are pretty. Like, weak to magic? I would hope so. I mean, yeah. Oh, yes, the thing's gonna die. Yeah, and then one, one, one water, two water attacks. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Cool. All right, everybody. So, uh, probably 30 minutes to 45 minutes later, uh, I got done grinding, or uh, I got close enough to where I thought I was fine. So, um, I lied a little bit. I did get Aqua to level 34, and um, yeah, I just did one more fight, got my another level. So let's actually do this thing. Let's go ahead and explore. I haven't gone past this first little front, so I don't know what's in here. And of course, we're going to have a couple more fights along the way. That might get me to 35. Uh, so might as, might as well take some of these fights. The, that's another big one. I wonder if this is an effect of the Eclipse 2. Stone. Yeah, you just watch. Aqua, this will be a good test for a new art. Okay. We will synchronize our moves for a massive attack. Are you ready? First, select the battle. Your turn. Select attack. Now, do this. Okay. Down, left, up, right, down, left. Down, left, up, down, right, left. Down, left. Okay. Airborne Fury. Okay. Down, left, up. Down, left, up, right, down, left. I think that was right. Okay. Now it's my turn. Okay, he's, he's doing his own now. Now begin. Why does it attack first? I thought it was supposed to be a test. It shouldn't be able to attack first. That's unfair. Variable art. Okay. Finish it! Bro, oh, 17,000 damage? Sheer perfection. Jesus. You combine our strength. I expect that you can do it with the others as well. 17,000 damage? Jesus. That is a big boy. That is a very big boy. Alright, let's go ahead and... Um... Now, I should 
Yeah, it's easy. 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 Ooh, a lips king. Okay, this gives us lips tears. Now, I can get this off. Oh, wait, I can't do not enough AP. Hmm. Uh, let's do Rabbit Attack and then Wind Blade. For her, let's go ahead and go Big Bang just in case she attacks first. I don't know why she would. And with him, let's go Cannon Blast and then. Yeah, let's do that. And yes! Okay, good. So. I think this should be able to kill it. Okay, very nice. I'm glad we got to kill it before it ran. Actually, now that I think about it, the Lips Kings, do they run? I know the normal Lips run. I wonder if the Kings ones do. They might not. Maybe maybe I'm just missing. I, mean, I, don't, I don't know. Okay, so I'm supposed to- yes! This is the log that I was looking for. Yes, okay. I was- I'm just looking at a map right now. There's supposed to be a log here. And... Take that tree out of the way. Boy! Try to get in my way. Yes, yeah, this is what I was looking for. And this should take me up here. Alright, this should be taking us to you know. Finally, my favorite place in this entire universe that is Lagea. You know. You know where it is. Is you know. That's my house. The path that continues on leads to Rams Cave. Rams, Rams, Ramses. I don't know. Huh? Haven't you ever seen snow before? This is snow? Question mark. It's colder here than in Aqua's town, but it's warmer inside. Let's go inside the house now. You know, what's wrong, Master? No? I don't deserve to enter this village. I bet the other villagers would agree. If only I'd noticed your power a little sooner. Then when you wouldn't have lost your family and friends. But Stone, you saved me. I think the village will forgive you, Stone. Go inside. Forgotten village, you know. And they all have like similar clothing to Maya. That's sick. Maya, Maya came back to the village. How does? Uh, I was like, that kid's can't. The cat can't be more than ten. And Maya is only fourteen, and she left years ago. Whatever. Loopholes. What's going on? Stone, where have you been? You disappeared. I'm sorry for making you worry. I'm sorry. Maya, what happened to you? I thought you lost your voice. This is great. Talk to me, Maya. Congrats, Maya. You finally came back, Stone. Didn't you know how lonely little Maya was without you? I, I don't deserve to live in this village. I couldn't save Maya's family or the villagers. 
Hey Stone, nobody could have stopped it. It wasn't your fault. That's right, Stone. And you say Maya, nobody blames you, so why would you why should you leave the village? You and Maya and everybody in the village. I feel like you're all family. What's the point of being family if we're all separate, huh? Am I right, honey? That's right. Isn't that why you came back, Stone? Welcome back, Maya. And Stone. Is this your kid? Boy! Um, no, he he's a student, I guess his name's not. Maya's 14! Oh, I was shocked. I thought you'd had a kid. You've had a hard time, haven't you? We've, we've had nothing but trouble since the Black Sun appeared. It's not an exciting village, but make yourself at home. Let's have a drink for old time's sake. Promise me, Stone. Sigh, just like a fish. Loosen up a little. It's a perfect occasion. I told you, the incident has been forgotten. Nobody cares anymore. You're right. I was being silly. Let's go back home now. Wow. A lot cleaner than before. The house was a pigsty when Stone lived here. Stone used to live in this house. I'm renting it now, though. Do you want to live here too, Aqua? There's still an empty room. Ooh. Hey, Maya. What's wrong? Nothing. The room Stone used to live in is spare, but there's nothing in there except the bed. Okay, Aqua. Go ahead and use the room. What are you going to do, Master? Me. Actually, I felt more comfortable living in a shack on Mount Gable. Anyway, can we see Rain tomorrow? I've, I've been invited to Simba's home. And Maya just came back too. She needs to catch up. Yeah, but, um... Alright then. Decision's made. Stone. Sheesh. I guess Stone is happy to be here too. Though he doesn't show it. Um, Aqua? I'm going out too. I want to visit my parents' grave and tell them I'm back. Oh, okay. Don't worry about me. Alright, see you later. Peace. Alright guys, we made it to You Know Village. Stone and I have left the party. So, we're gonna end off the episode here, guys. Thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as well as my channel, and I will see you guys later. Next episode, we'll be exploring, I think, decorating our room? Yeah, we'll see. God bless, and goodbye. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Legea 2. So, last time, we just got to you know. So, yeah, we're just gonna keep going from here. So, this is Maya's bed. Okay, cool on that one. Uh, let's see what's over here. I'm guessing this is our bed. <clears throat> we talked about going tomorrow, but there's no point in going alone. Forget it. So we can't go that way. It's a uh, elaborately built spot. It doesn't look that elaborate, I'm just gonna be honest. But let's go in here. This is the food storage area. Uh, we can grab this. Yoinks. Can we oh I was like, can we get up to the other one? That would be sick. I love how they made like a little parkour, parkour map for us here. It's very nice. Thank you very much. Uh, let's go over here. I'm guessing this is the weapon smith place. There is nothing but snow here. Life was hard and dark, and but it wasn't as bad as it is. A VIP card. Very nice. Let's see what we can buy. Okay, so that's cool. Steel saber. That's very nice. Mm, you know, we won't buy a bone jacket. Alright, that's fine. Oh, wait, can I... No, I'm not going to sell it. Okay, cool. Now, I'm going to do more buying and stuff. Obviously, when we get our other characters... Let's go see... This house is... But I'm guessing this might be the... Maya, uh, she lost her parents, it's not the way she's, uh, I guess that's like either the town leader, or something. Okay, if we go down more, we'll exit the village, another snowman. Very nice. 
Ooh, accidentally went to Stone's place. Whew, I hit the spot. It's so good, it makes a grown man cry. You know stuff is the best. I know, I know. No need to hold back. You're our guest. Bro, Stone is downing at someone else's bed. Are you a student of stones? You know what? This old man taught me how to use a sword too. A long time ago. Old man? Who's the old man? I'm still active as ever. That's right. I suspect you'll be active to the end too. Oh, I've been dreaming of this. This is heaven. Alright. <clears throat> Stone is getting his fill of uh, the good old alcohol. Very nice. I'm glad Stone is having a good time. Because Stone is... Yeah, the dude's never happy. So that's very nice. Alright, over here. Um... Oh, we can buy items. Buy... Ooh, very nice. Um... Let's buy... If we don't have any of these materials, I might as well just buy them. Alright, we're gonna spend a little bit of money here, but I want to make sure at least I have one material of everything. Enjoy gardening. Thanks. Take care of yourself. Thanks very much. Wait, oh, wait, wait, what does it do say? Maya and I, we go way back. In fact, we're practically dating right now. Bro. She's like 14, buddy. She's 14. This dude better be 14. My god, we got a pedo. Messed up. Oh, we didn't go over here. I'm a dummy. Are you cold at all? You seem lightly dressed to me. Bro, I'm good. Don't worry about it. Yeah, we didn't go over here. Mother, thank you. If I hadn't heard your voice, I would have. Father, I won't run away anymore. I won't curse myself anymore. This power, this power of mine will come in handy someday. I'm sure of it now. Sorry, I thought I heard something. So don't worry about me, mother and father. Ah, I'm sorry to keep you waiting. Shall we go home? I and Maya joined the party. Okay. It's great. It's great. It's great. Very nice. Check out this house right here. Uh, something about spirits. Very nice. There's probably items maybe in those cupboards, but whatever. Not. So we got a nice little spring here. Uh, can't do anything with that. Or if we can, I don't have a high enough IQ to do that. Alright, uh, let's maybe grab stone. Can I grab stone yet? We got Maya. Maybe, maybe I needed to grab Maya. Yeah, yeah, I need to grab Maya and then come to stone. <laughs> He's drunk. Hey, Stone, Maya, and your student came to pick you up. You guys have to dance too, Sanji, the mountain man, best tree climber in the land. Ha ha ha! Oh man, I'll take care of him tonight. I'll send him home by morning. Can't be helped, I guess. Alright, very nice. Dude is drunk. Come on, Stone. Haha, <laughs> wow, Stone, nice moves. Wander, wander, or he out, uh, uh, whatever. Alright. So, he's gonna join us in the morning, apparently. Let's, uh, let's forget about him. He'll be partying on that. Let's go back to the house, okay? Yes, let us. Let's go back to the house. Can I sleep now? It's a bed. Really? Guys, it's a bed. Oh. It's the town. Ah, Stone wasn't partying all night, huh? I never thought I'd come back here. If only I had noticed Maya's power a little bit earlier, you wouldn't have lost your lives. All I can do now is apologize. All I can do is to watch over that child in your stead. Steve? Stead. I swear I'll keep that promise to my dying breath. Nice. What a good man. 
By the way, I just punched my table by accident, so you guys heard that. My bad. How late are you planning to sleep? The entire world is in danger. Time is a luxury we don't have. Look who's talking, Stone. You were out all night. Hmm. <laughs> that was then. This is now. Whatever. Let's go and see Rame. To that door. Man. Stone, join the party. Alright, we all good? We all good? Okay, nice. Now, we could go upgrade our armor, but you know what? We'll do that later. Alright, where's my boy Rain at? I could save. I should, probably should save. You know what? I'm not going to because... Too good? Too good at this game. Don't need to save. That's the monolith. Very nice stone. It's just like the one we saw at the chapel, but this one doesn't have the black sun. Oh, that one glows, though. Oh, it's a He's a human? No, it looks human, but it's a spirit. A spirit, question mark. Remember the Mount Morgan, Mount Gable? It's like the morgue, a spirit. Speak though. The Mount Morgan inhabited Mount Gable. Raymond inhabits the great tree behind the monolith. You are Aqua, aren't you? How do you know my name? Don't be surprised. I know almost everything about this world. The roots of this tree spread all over the world, and I can learn what's going on from those roots. Rain, about the black sun. What's the eclipse Avalon is talking about? The eclipse, the terrible power from another world created the black sun. The power is consuming this world. The eclipse is turning all things into evil, darkness, chaos. Th did that man Avalon make it happen? Yes and no. The answer is carved into this monolith. Behold, the source forge. The Source Forge, question mark. The very creator of this entire world. The creator, the origin of our entire world, can this really be? I understand how difficult it may be for you to believe. To prove it, I'll show you memory. My memory of this world of yours. Ah! Disappearing. Flashback. What's this question mark? It's the core of the Source Forge. It's the place where all life is created. The Source Forge wasn't always here. At first, this world contained nothing. And then, three sources of power were born. They were... The power of fire. And wind. And water. It doesn't make any sense. It should be, um... Fire became the sacred burning stone. Water became the sacred azure stone. And wind became the sacred teal stone. Shouldn't it be like water, fire, earth? Their power melded together and the Sorge Forge was born. The stones then created life. And the Sorge Forge was born. The Forge sent it into the world. This life that was sent forth continued to evolve and propagate right up until the present. But the delicate balance of the Surge Forge, that source of all life, was ruined by him. The arrangement of the three sacred stones at the core of the Source Forge is responsible for producing the world's life, and that man has upset the precious arrangement. Switched him around. What an evil man. I can't believe you've done this. The 
orange is now red. I mean, deep. That doesn't seem very nice. So that's what I saw in my dream that time. When the arrangement of the sacred stones was changed, the source forge began on a mine. It began trying to create a world full of evil and chaos, covering everything with the power of the eclipse, born of the black sun. Is this source forge if we restore its balance can't we change the world back to the way it was stone it is impossible for you you cannot restore the source for source forge aqua only you can restore the source forge me why me yeah, why do I gotta do all the work because you are a star shaper question mark the man with the chapel called aqua that too star shaper what's that mean Power to manipulate the Source Forge, power to shape the future of this planet. Only you and Avalon possess this power. Where did this power come from? Tell me, what am I? What am I? Is that your query? You and Avalon were born, nay, were chosen by the Source Forge. Born from the Source Forge. The Source Forge was created with the desire to promote life on Earth. Or perhaps it was the will of the sacred stones, the creators of the Source Forge. The life that sprang from it spread across the world, creating more life over the ages. From a realm devoid of time, the Source Forge has stood watch over the cycle of life. But unforeseen seeds formed during the cycle of death and rebirth. I speak of mystics, beings who were a mixture of the forces of nature and humanity. Were these mystics born to create a world full of hope, full of dreams? Or were they born to destroy the very world the Sorge Forge had created? The Sorge... I hate that they named it that. The Source Forge became interested in the Mystics. It even hoped that the Mystics might guide this world to a better place. And you and Avalon have the power to use the Source Forge. The future of this world is in your hands. But Avalon has come to hate this world. I think his sad experience of being a mystic has changed him. This world is being consumed by ruin and the only one who can stop it is you. You are the only hope. Ah. Man, sounds like every other plot. <laughs> you, you, you are the only hope. I still can't. It's hard to believe I was created by the Source Forge. I don't feel like I've got any special power either. But sure about one thing. I can't let the world waste away. Amen. Aqua. Aqua. <laughs> Aqua. How can I restore the source source forge to the way it was? If the pyrolith, aqualith, and aerolith are properly arranged within the core of the source forge, you can reset the source forge and remove the black sun as well, Aqua. But to do so, first you must collect these three sacred stones. Avalon may try to stop you. You must resist his limitless power and win. Rain, why are we here then? To fight against him at Aqua's side? Aqua, you won't be alone. We'll all fight together to save the world we live, we live in. Astra, Maya. I knew it. Our meeting was no qu accident. We were fated, fated to fight together against Avalon to save the world. We won't let this world be destroyed, and I'll change the for Source Forge back to the way it was. Very nice. We're gonna do it. Raim, what's wrong? The power of the Eclipse is stealing life force from my tree. Raim, hold on. No! He's going away. Forgive me, I cannot remain in this world for long. I will leave my memories in this monolith. Only mystics can locate the sacred stones by touching this monolith. 
The Source Forge resides inside a tower leading to the center of this world, the Demiurge Tower. Sacred stones will guide you there. Rain? Be gone. Just in time, too. Rain. Perhaps we'll see him again after we restore the world stone. Master, Maya. Let's go. Right. You better find out where these sacred stones are located. Try touching the monolith, Aqua. Let's go touch it. Very big stone, very nice. Touch it. Let the question appear in your mind. Touch. Alright, so the aqua lift, very easy. It is at our hometown. Which actually really sucks, because we're basically going to have to take away their water source again. Which is not very nice. I'm sure they'll understand though. The fire stone is in some lava place? Question mark. Not 100% sure how we're going to get that one. I guess I don't know where it is. And the air stone is on some really, really cool temple and my favorite place in the game. Just saying. I really like it there. We're gonna get there soon enough. Not yet, but soon enough. So, it showed us where all three of them are, though. Was that real? Looks like we're going to have a hard time finding anything here. About the Aquath, Aqua, you, you stone. We need the Aqua to restore the world. Let's go back to No. Yikes. Um, yeah, that sucks. If you guys don't realize what's going on, Basically, up until this point in the game, we've been fighting to get back that stone to give back to the village because that stone provides water for the village. So taking it away is basically kind of like, hey guys, I know I just like did all this to bring it back, but um, I'm going to need it, so I'm going to yoink it back. Alright, we're also going to save on a separate file in case uh, audio issues or something. I don't know. Just going to do that. Um, so yeah, we need to go back to Noel. Um, rearrange the room. So I think this is a feature in the game where I can place furniture. So we got this, uh... So yeah, we can collect furniture inside the game to kind of populate the room. We did find this in the storage area. So we're gonna go ahead and place this, uh, yeah, right there. Okay, yes. So we, we so yeah. Um, so... Feel free to use this room as you like, but don't put too many things in, or it'll lose its sense of personality. So yeah, we can kind of decorate this room the way we like, which is really kind of a nice feature put in the game. But I'm not going to focus on that too much. What is this? Let's plant seeds and grow flowers. You can plant seeds here. If they bloom and bear fruit, you might get items. Like pot means selecting a pot, planting seeds, and adding water to check. Okay, select pot. So we can um, use harvest. Okay, so let's harvest. Yes, let's harvest the spice. Plant seeds. So we got different types of seeds. Let's use a royal seed. Water. Water. Okay, and let's go back. Select pot. Select this one. Let's water this one. That one's not done just yet. Oh! Uh, select pot. Let's go to this one. Um, we can't uh, harvest it yet, so we're just going to water it. And then select pot this one, let's plant another seed, let's put the stink bowl. And then go ahead and water it. Okay. We can dip for now. Um, so we're gonna go go back to Noel. Now before we go, like I said, I wanted to wait until everyone kinda got thing back in my party before I buy anything else. I right, will just buy that for now. And let's go ahead and combine weapons. So for Aqua, can we make something even better? We can make something better. Okay, so let's go ahead and which one? Obviously, this one's stronger. Okay, so we can make this one the Holy Basher. 
Got to make that. Uh, everything's fine. Alright, let's go ahead and head back to Knoll. There might be a cutscene here. Of us leaving. Apparently there's not. Okay, well, I guess everyone's just Gucci with us leaving now. So let's go back to Knoll and grab... Um... Aqualith. Which, they're not going to be very happy about. But I am sure that they'll understand, and quickly, um, we're going to save all that progress. Okay. So now, is the village chief up front here? Can we just grab it? So after all I went there to get it back, the Aqualith is going away again, but this time I'm taking it away. This time I'm taking it away. Should have put the emphasis on me. Let's go to the village chief. That's proper etiquette. Before we steal the life source of a town, we should probably speak to the village chief. You know what I'm saying? Aqua, when did you return? Well, Hawk actually proceeds to tell the entire story of everything we learned. Ah, I see the Black Sun must be quite powerful. In order to save the world, you need the aqua. Am I right? Yes, that is very nice. So, the goings on at Hunter's Wood are happening elsewhere. All that destruction. Aqua, as I have said this to you before, the thing that keeps all of us here alive is that lake and the aqua. You know that. That is why you brought the aqua back to Knoll, isn't that right? This matter concerns everyone in this town. We shall gather and discuss the issue. Well, not like you have much discussing, my guy. You ev Either everyone's dead, or this town dies. That's a yikes right there. You know what I'm saying? Ahem, uh -huh. let us begin. We are gathered today to discuss one important issue. It concerns Aqua taking the Aqualith with him. Whoa, hey, wait a minute, Aqua. Why would you want to take the Aqualith away again? Is all the water going bye-bye? And what is your opinion on all this, Hawk? Well, we'll have to go through a drought all over again? No, Aqua, don't take our Aqualith. Well, dude, I'm not going to just take it for no reason. Like, I'm sorry, everyone. But our son, I need the Aqualith. The world won't return to normal without it. <laughs> Don't you see? This guy here loves to make people really happy and then screws them in the end. Only thinking about himself. He doesn't care about you or me. As long as he's happy. That's who he is. Bro, silence you. Like, I'm literally about to shove a sword through his throat. Dean, were you not rescued from Hunter's Wood by Aqua? What did you do after that man seized Aqua? What were any of us doing then? Nothing. We had all given up. We always let it be, saying that it was meant to be. But Aqua, you were different. The morning after you heard that the Aqualith had been stolen, you left Knoll to get it back. All alone. You didn't know how it would end. You didn't fear the unknown. You kept your faith. I admire that. And now, the problem is spreading from our small town into the rest of the world. The Black Sun, to get rid of it, you need the Aqualith. That is what you said, right? Of course, it is hard for us to lose the Aqualith, but perhaps it is time to stop fearing change and stand up to it, boldly. Don't worry about no. We'll be fine. We'll do our, we'll do our part. Aqua can't do all the work. That's right. Anyone got a problem with that? Settle it with me. Aqua, there are certain things that only you can do, right? Well then, go do them. Aqua, the final decision is up to you. We're gonna take that. I'm sorry, but it's either the town or the world, so, um, see y'all later. I mean, guys, it's not like we take the stone and it's never coming back. Like, I'm gonna yoink the stone, redo the source forge, and then bring it back. Y'all won't, like, y'all just need to ration your water for, like, two weeks. Like, two months, a month tops. And y'all are good. Won't be an issue. I'm not gonna die. 
I can't apologize enough to all of you. But in order to stop the Black Sun and return the world to normal, I need the Aquila. Alright Aqua, we'll try to be strong too. We'll do our part. This is hard on us, but it's even harder on you Aqua. Not having the Aqua is a problem, but if the world disappears, there would be no point in having it anyway. Aqua, take care of the Aqua. Yeah, she knows what's up. There you go. We can't fear change. You know what? That's true. We can't just sit around and mope. Aqua, you'll come back, won't you? The people of this town are depending on you. That's a reflection of your consideration for this town and for all who live in it. Come back whenever you want. This is your home. Alright. We have gotten the first stone. And this is where we're going to leave off the episode, guys. So, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as well as the channel. And we'll see you guys later. God bless. And goodbye. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Legea 2. So, we left off last episode taking the Aqualith back. And now, our goal is to get the other two stones to save the world, which is very nice. I don't, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I literally don't know what to do at this point in the game. But hey, we're gonna figure it out, huh? Only two left, the Pyrolith and the Aerolith. I don't know about the Aerolith, but the Pyrolith, Pyrolith is a volcanic rock, right? It's probably in Drac, it's probably on Draconia. Hmm, I've heard that to the southwest lies the volcanic island Draconia. Let's go and take a look. First, we'll need a boat. South of here, there is a port city called Tanza. Pick one up there. For that, we'll have to pass south of Darakin through Cravia. Okay. Didn't really pick up all of that. Port Town Tanza. Okay, so basically, we gotta go through here. Through Cravia. Okay. Cool. Very nice. So, like I said, I don't know what to do in this game, but now I do. Let's go. Know exactly where to go. So, yep, we gotta get there. To get through there, we need to go through here. Enter Free City Cravia. Very nice. I like it. What do you mean we can't go through? Why the hell not? My proclamation of the new bishop. From now on, we can't let you through this checkpoint without a Cravian pass from the new bishop. Sorry, guys, I gotta take my phone. You gotta be kidding! The hell with this new bishop! Why can't we use our permits like we used to? These are the bishop's new new bishop's orders. We can't let anybody, not a single person, through this gate without a Cravian pass. Hey, come on, you know me. I work at the inn. You, you can let me through, can't you? No one goes through without a Cravian pass. Cravian passes are issued at Doplin Castle in Darkin. If you want to go through, you gotta get a Cravian pass. Alright, so, yeah, we... Yeah, we can't go. We need a Cravian pass. Uh, talk to any of these people, say what's good. Yo, yo, yo. Alright, so, like you said, we gotta go to Doplin Castle to get one of those bad boys. So, I'm just gonna guess that we probably gotta go to Dark and Citadel and get one. Very nice. Now, here's my issue, right? Uh, what's our MP? MP, MP, full, full, full. Very nice. Female voice, don't give me that, you told me you could. Well, male voice, I never said any such thing, give up on it. There seems to be a fight going on, let us take a look. Well, well, it's Aqua, welcome. Hi! I'm waiting right here until you get one for me. Don't forget. going on ah uh, she wants a Cravian pass I don't mind her coming to me for help but in this case I can't do anything for her oh don't tell me you guys want one too um it's a Cravian pass it's a pass need to get through the checkpoint at Cravia you used to ha you used to have to have a permit and they were really hard-nosed about it but now you need a Cravian pass where can we get one of these Cravian passes? At Doplin Castle, that new bishop supposedly issues them personally. What do you mean, supposedly? As far as I can tell, not a single Cravian pass has ever been issued. 
Looks like the new bishop is trying to isolate Darakin. I see. Well, that certainly explains why not even you can get your hands on one. Exactly. I can't do anything about this one. That's awful. Why would you want to seal off the checkpoint? Who knows? All that trouble to seal the place off. Maybe they don't want letting something out? Anyway, there just aren't any passes out there. It's no use. Hey, you guys, you've sneaked into the castle before, haven't you? Ah, never mind. No need to answer that. It's just that if somebody could get into the castle, they could steal a Kravian pass. They exist, that is. If the passes don't exist, they could see the bishop directly and make him issue one. Now, who could do that, I wonder? It's just an idea. Nice. Overhearing the conversation. Ouch! Oh, Sabrina, the walls sure are thin here, huh? You can hear everything. So you guys are trying to get a hold of a Caribbean Pass too, huh? I see. Who are you? Question mark. Who? Me? I am Sharon. And I am going to leave Sharon as that name. She is very nice with Sharon. I'm Sharon. I can't get through the Kavian checkpoint either. I'm stuck here, there. I asked Mr. Information there to get one for me, but he's useless. Yeah, you might have asked me, but I never said I could do it. You never gave you never give me any respect. But then when you need something, you come came running to me. Are you still mad about that one incident that was such a long time ago? You sure can hold a grudge. Um, look, I'd really like to help you. For old time's sake, really. I can't get you something that doesn't exist. Excuse me, but... Well, is that so? Fine, I won't ever ask you for another thing ever again. Um, excuse me. Please, please, please don't fight. If you don't have a Kravian Pass either, why don't we try to do something about it together? Maya. But she needs help. We have to try and do something for her. Yeah, but we don't have a Kravian Pass either. We've got to go to the castle and try to see Bishop or something. We've got to get one of those Kravian Passes. Oh yeah, that's right. You guys are going to the castle, aren't you? Let me come with you. What? That mark on your chest, don't tell me you're a mystic too. You, you're a mystic too? You bet, my mark is on my thigh. Wanna see? Sure. It's age appropriate. YouTube will take down my video. Well, I thought you were going to show us your mark. Question mark. Hmm, it's just kidding. Do you think I'm going to strip down right here? Give me a break. And I really wanted to see it too. Anyway. You want to come to the castle with us? Pretty dangerous trip. We can't promise you. Uh, sorry, I can't read that. Hold you back. But I'm the great, undefeated Sharon. You don't believe me? Why don't you take me along and see? If I do hold you back, you can tell me to scram. I won't mind. Hmm, I don't know. Aqua, what do you want to do? Let's just. Why not? Sounds good to me. The more in the party, the better. Especially if she needs her help. See, there you go, a boy with sense. You're going to be great, important man someday, I can tell. Great, now let's... Now that that's it, let's hurry up and go. How are we going to get to the castle? Where was that secret passage? The first floor of the fancy hotel, wasn't it? That's right, it said the three-star hotel. Well, if you know where it is, then let's go. Come on, let's move, people. Hold on. If you're going to the castle, you have to be careful. I've been hearing a strange rumor. The guard says the new bishop is strong, strong enough to rip up steel with his bare hands. I don't know if you can believe what the guards say, but I still think you should watch it. You're going to give me free advice? That's not like you. Well, you did come to me for help, and I want to be of some use. Be careful, Sharon. <laughs> don't worry about me. If I didn't get the, but if I didn't get the, that pass, I wasn't going to break down the castle gate anyway. I was going. Ah, I can't read. Okay, onto the castle. Let's move. Sharon has joined the party. Now this is the hardest part of the game for me. I think I might have to switch out stone it saddens me but i think i'm gonna have to switch off stone here um how do we do this sharon sorry stone yeah 
I like... I could switch out... But here's the thing. The way I'm seeing it is... Lang has to stay. I like Maya. Like, Maya is my favorite character in the game. She's not leaving my party. I don't care if she's weak. She's not leaving my party. And Stone is very cool. But, like, Sharon is so strong. And she's also really, really cool. So... She's staying in my party. Or, she's... So, for those of you that really like Stone, I'm sorry, but it happens. Now, I don't even see much garbage anymore. I wonder if it's because of the rise in prices since the Black Sun appeared. I don't, I don't know, because, I mean, Maya said we gotta go down. Yeah, we can just go through here, right? You just go straight to the Cabal Ruins? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I don't know, maybe I just skipped a whole plotline, but I'm pretty sure this is where we're supposed to go. Yeah, see? Hey, over there, that thing, doesn't it look really suspicious? Yeah, that's a thunder, thunder, it's gotta be a switch, I'm sure of it. It stinks like a rotten egg. Time for you to shine, Aerodel. Boom. Pow. Look at that. It's a thunder switch. Impressive. Voila. Now, are you glad you brought me along? <laughs> Over here. And I'm, I'm guessing it's probably the, still the same enemies, I'll take right? You. No, they're different enemies, apparently. Alright, let's test out our new character real quick. So, uh, I guess let's do Windblade on him and then Blade Dance on Shadow Skull 1. Uh, let's go ahead and just do Magma Mayhem and then just whatever. Okay, let's see what Sharon- now we don't have any moves on her. Alright, open up a list of her arts, let's go through them. So first we got right, left, up, and then we got up, down, right, and then we got four more so we can do up, left, left, up. That should be three of them, so let's begin. Ah, <laughs> funny sound. Okay, so these things are actually pretty strong. They're a little bit scary. Three thousand? Those not that bad. Oh, 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 Man, when did he do so much damage? Ooh, excuse me, damage all of a sudden. 4,000 keys, man. Dude's been working out. Brain increase. What does that do? That is spooky stuff. Aqua Spellbound. Does that mean we can't, like, perform anything with MP? Magma Mummy. Alright. And then we're gonna- we have a couple more moves to do with her, which is gonna be great. Earth, Earth, bang, bang. Alright, so that one's dead. It's very nice. So we're just gonna battle, guard, we're gonna guard, and we're just gonna attack, cause she's gonna kill it. So, let's go ahead and do left, up, down, left, and then left, up, up, up. And that should be two more right there. Yeah, sure, is it that strong, actually? Which is interesting. I thought she'd be a lot stronger, but I guess we did over-level by quite a bit. But I think overall, she's still stronger than Stone, so it's fine. So it's fine. So we stopped at Rumble Spike. We've got... We've got a couple more to go. Anyway. Let's go down here. And let's see. I guess... I, see, in these cases, I would cut. But there are new enemies, and we have some new moves to go through. Let's just go ahead and Windblade again. Just do the same thing with her. And then we got some new moves, so let's get it. We got, um, let's see. So we stopped there, so we got right, down, right, right, and we got down, right, down, left. Okay, so that should be two moves right there. Oh, these things can do that. It's kind of scary. Ready? Ready. Her moves aren't that cool though, kinda sad. 
but her her special attacks are probably very strong. So. Oh, okay, I was like, is she dead? Oh, she she defended like four of those. She's insane. What inhuman reactions? Okay, these things are weak against fire. Okay, so they're weak against fire. That's good. Good now. Defend, defend, defend. Are you kidding? Oh, are they immune to wind? They're immune to wind. That sucks. Okay. Well then, we're just gonna guard. We're gonna go ahead and not do that. We're just gonna origin. We're just gonna do what is this? Uh, just do life blessing, and then with her, do some new moves. So we did. Oh, uh, what did we do last? So we did rage wave, right? Okay. So now we got rave storm. So let's go ahead and do down, up, right, left, right. And we got five more slots, so we got down, right, left, right, up. Okay, so these should be two new moves right here. Yeah, and this should be very, very strong. Yeah, that's pretty... These are pretty annoying, honestly. That, that one looked cool. I gotta give it that. That one looked cool. Okay, this is gonna... Oh, oh, she's dead. Oh, she dead. Oh, she dead. She's dead. Oh, she didn't get the heal off. No. That sucks quite a bit, actually. Let's keep moving. And real quick, let's just go ahead and heal everybody. Oh, crap. Probably should just, like, wasted items. Who cares, though? I'm sorry. Alright guys, there might be new moves here. I think these are her Okay, so these are the super moves that I couldn't do before for some reason. This is another new one. So I think all of those moves that I did before, plus these ones, that is all of that is all of the moves right there. So we have gotten all the moves for it. The only thing that we haven't done yet is her origin power, which I'm not gonna cut yet because that is what I'm planning to do right now. Because one of these beam things did spit a seed, and these seeds for some reason are only hurt by elements. And looks like another one spit another one out. Yeah, we're gonna do her elemental attack real quick and then we'll go back. So real quick, just to show you guys, so these are all her supers, so she has five supers and then I did all of the normal ones beforehand. So let's go to her origin, lightning arrow, and it does hurt everybody. Okay, very nice. So just gonna get this out of the way. This is what it looks like, a lightning arrow. So the dude holds up his little arm cannon thing. So it actually healed the carcass, the focus carcass, carcass. It actually healed it? Oh, damage absorbed. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna well, get back to the point where we were as far as we can. See what's in this room. So, one, two, three. Okay, so the boxes do signify something, that's what I thought. I was like, wait, well, yeah, I probably should break them. Alright, so notes one. So, that'll help us probably with one of the puzzles. Alright, everybody, so we're here at that puzzle. That's not what I meant to press. Let's go to items. And then we got explorer's notes. We were trapped in a room in which hung a plaque of the snake, deja vu, but the plaque of the snake told us otherwise. I suspected there was an inscription on the pedestal, a different set of letters. This room must be SNA key. That would have been too easy. It seems that snake was the complete opposite answer. We will be trapped here for some time, I think. The opposite of snake? So maybe every letter that's not snake? So U? Uh, S would be in there. 
E would be in there. L is not in there. So U L U L W U L W Q. Yeah, so literally every other letter except snake. Okay, is everyone healed up? Okay. I guess let's see what's over here. Literally nothing. I don't even know why I walked over here. Okay, so we can go down or we can go to the sides. I'm just gonna go down, honestly. Okay. Let's, let's move that. Okay. So we can get this chest real quick. Like a retreat. Is there something over there? Is bolt strike scroll? Let's go up here. And okay. I'm gonna count right before the bar. It's in this door right here. Is it just an item? Okay. Blind cure. Very nice. Let's keep going. Okay, so there's a stairway down the other way. Distance also provides clarity. Nothing can be taken as absolute. Okay, so maybe let's try lighting just these two up front. And that'll be the door. Okay. Very cool. Let's see what's over here. The camping. Okay, so we could see what's down the stairway, but I'm too lazy, so we're just gonna not do that. How about that? So, we can go ahead and status. Alright, uh, let's just... We can combine, which I don't need to combine at the moment. Let's have a chat. Good. The guys aren't here. Now's my chance. Maya, just why are you traveling with those guys anyway? Huh? I haven't really given it much thought. I left my village to look for stone, and then, uh, then you met up with Aqua, and now you're here, right? That's right. Okay, let's forget about the old man for a minute. Tell me honestly, what do you think of Aqua? What do I think? Come on, don't play dumb. You know what I mean. What do you think of him? Well, I haven't really thought of him that way. I guess he's a good guy. Huh? That's it. What do you mean? What do you want me to say? Ah, uh, she's still just a child. Well, you see, when men and women get together, things start to happen. That's the way things work. So, um... I see. Control it? What, Sharon? What do you see? Oh, nothing. Never mind. Ha ha ha. Things sure have been a strange twist of fate, huh? Just us getting- just us mystics getting together like that. I don't know if I'd call it fate, but you- blah blah blah, what did you say something? Me? No, I didn't say a word. Aqua has his on display for the world to see, but where do the rest of you have your mark? Yeah, now that you mentioned, I haven't seen them either. How about you, Maya? Where's your mark? I- I can't tell you. <laughs> just exactly where is it, I wonder? Some place she can't talk about, maybe. Hmm. Aqua, just now, you weren't imagining anything weird, were you? Confess, honestly. <laughs> Was it that obvious? Well, geez, it was written all over your face. I'm thinking weird thoughts, your face. Ah, that's why. So, uh, ah, adorable. Sniff, what about me? How come nobody asked about my part? <laughs> poor, poor guy. Alright, one more chat. I knew you were something special, Shannon. You're alright in my book. See, what did I tell you? I told you you wouldn't be sorry. Her technique, it sure seems a lot like Alfie's technique. Could she possibly be? Um, hello, old man. You started this conversation. What are you muttering about anyway? Hey, what did you say? What are you, what are you calling old man? But by the way, where did you learn these techniques of yours? I've been training hard under my father ever since I was a little kid. He used to tell me, you're my successor. Make me proud. Yeah, I really was crazy about my father. I was training man. I got to be with him every day, so I was glad to do it. What did your father do, Sharon? Why, of course, he was a prank. Oops, I mean, he, he, I can't tell you. Why not? I told you everything. You'd take the mystery out of it, don't you think? I'm more interested with a few secrets. New bishop, huh? I wonder what she's like. Oh, I'm vulnerable. We gotta be prepared. That's right. We've got to get the creepy. Okay, that's enough chat. Real quickly. Let's cook. Oh, we don't have enough for stone curry? No, we should have brought some, we should have bought some more ingredients. Uh, is there anything else we can cook? If not, then I guess we're just not gonna cook anything. Alright, whatever, we won't cook. Let's go ahead and rest. 
so we can get our MP and all that good good stuff up. Let's go ahead and save. Alright, let's go ahead and do a nice little savey save right here. And let's keep going. Image of a lizard. Oh, we gotta do this again, don't we? Go get the notes. Yeah, we're gonna have to go get the notes for it. Alright guys, I think I got it right here. Did I get it? Yes, I did get it. Okay. Cool. Not exactly sure how I got it. Explorer's Notes 2. Okay. So that should give us the puzzle for the lizard one. Please make it without an encounter. We made it. I'm so happy we made it. Okay. We're going to read Explorer's 2. We weren't trapped in the room in which hung a lizard. Seven different pedestals, each a familiar color. The robes of the Kevlo Priest. Then the answer must be in order in which they stand. Red, orange, green, blue. Oh, why can't I not remember? The gods show no mercy to those insects. Red, orange, green, blue. Okay, guys. So apparently it's the order of the rainbow, which is not that obvious, actually. I don't, I don't really know how that's like, how it's supposed to be a hint. Because that's really not that obvious. But anyway. So red. Orange. Yellow. Green. Blue. Indigo. And violet. That is the order of the rainbow. Which I actually don't know by heart. Which is... Probably a bad thing, but eh. Alright, now where do we go? Um just explore everything, I guess. Let's go this way. Okay, so here we got a thunder switch. Go ahead and thunder it up. What is over here? Yeah, another room. Okay, what is this about? There's nothing in these. Is that the order? Okay, we let's just remember this order. Yeah, let's go this way and check what's on this side. Okay, so this is the main puzzle. Let's go see what's in here. Oh, okay. This is what we already got. Okay, so 243, 243, 243. The image of a bird is engraved here. Okay, so. I'm guessing maybe let's go. Okay, if we think of this as a clock, we just have to light up one, three, five, and seven. And I guess turn off the other ones. So one, three, Five and seven select. Okay, perfect. Okay, we're done with that. So just if you, if you guys are playing this game, one, three, five, seven. Oh, okay, we got a share and switch here. Light it up. Okay, we just get passed through here. And I guess let's just go up, right? We don't have to do anything else. Let's walk up the stairs. Let us climb. Climb, climb, climb. And an encounter right away, dude. Are you kidding me? You're just a big fish. Gold in a small warriors. Pond. Okay, these are new. Okay, these are new. I guess let's just uh, go all out on them just for fun. Let's do and let's do that. Gold warrior, okay. Now with her, let's just go ahead and do oh no no, she has big bang. Let's just do ice pyre. And then dark disaster. Now with her, let's just go Bloody Spark, and then Bloody Spark again. Alright, let's see how much damage this does. Oh, these things, these things are bent. 
pretty well. They're not super strong though. Yeah, they're not super strong. Except we still, yeah. Let's see how much magic is doing. Okay. Man, man, these things defend a lot. It's kind of annoying. Why is this struggle with venom? Interesting. Let's see how much this hyper art does. Okay, definitely killed him with that hyper art though. She's saying it's going again, yeah. Yeah, Lang is gonna be 6,000 damage. Jeez. Alright guys, so um, I am going to end up the episode off here because I think this next part is probably a big part. So guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as a the channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Legaya 2. So we went through the Cabal Ruins last episode. Now we're finally in the castle trying to get those Caravian passes to go to Tanza to get the Firestone. Yeah, anyway, let's go. Uh, there's probably going to be nothing in there. Uh, soiled the letter. Someone soiled the letter? And an encounter. Let's keep moving. Um, there's nothing up there usually, so let's just go straight upstairs. And then, there's usually nothing in there, so I'm just gonna skip. No, there's a- there's a- Alright, so here's the checkpoint. So let's go ahead and make sure we save. <clears throat> because we don't want anything bad to happen, like us dying. I have to go all the way back before the Cabal Ruins. Now that would suck. Also, we should probably save, or heal, before we save, but it's whatever. Use a prison key. Yes, this is the Atsu key that we got earlier in the place. Silver Broom and Restore Blossom. I don't, I don't know. Those are probably just like really good healing items. They don't really matter though. All right, let's keep going. I saw a chest down here. Oh, it's empty. Uh, and I'm pretty sure that's... Yeah, 100% sure that's empty up there, too. Okay, now we gotta... Can we break through this yet? No, we still... I don't know how to get to that chest, man. It's annoying. I don't know how to get to that. Okay, let's keep going and hopefully don't get another encounter. There we go. Looks like... Why did the music change so happy all of a sudden? Let's go ahead and heal everybody. Okay, well, let's try downstairs, I guess. Let's try it over here. And this this is probably where we're supposed to be going. Oh, the music has changed. Yes. This looks like the place we're supposed to be going. Ooh. Spooky piano music, huh? Very nice. And that's our boy. We killed... Yeah, we killed his, um... Elfin. Oops. Ah, he messed it up. Ruined. You are the new bishop? What? What kind of way to speak to a bishop is that? Question mark. He's not the new bishop, is he? Wait a minute. Don't tell me you've forgotten who I am. Hey, he's Bubba. Um, Bubba. Mr. Bubba, when you say my name, don't forget it. It's Mr. Bubba to you. Hey, we killed his elephant. Snickers, snort, chortle, chuckle. I'm about to beat this dude up. Ha 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 I'm gonna beat this dude up. When Doplin told me to look after the castle while he was gone, I was mad at him at first. But now I'm glad he did. Snicker, that Doplin said if we kept the checkpoint closed, these guys would show up here. And by golly, he was right. I don't believe it. Don't tell us you've sealed off the checkpoint just so you could catch us. No, no, not catch you exactly. Or like, give you a good beating. I'm gonna avenge Elfin's death. You gotta be kidding. Do you have any idea how much trouble you've caused me? You, shut up. You possibly couldn't understand what I'm going through. I've, I've lost my beloved Elfin. Yeah, sorry about that. Elfin? Oh yeah, that thing that I met up with in the canyon. You know, the thing that I beat up. 
I swore to Elfin then, I swore I would get revenge. Alright, dude, whatever. I guess I'll just beat you up instead then. Oh, please, please, survivor. No, we're dead. You made a big mistake. You made me really mad. Did you see that, Elfin? I did it for you. I can't believe it. <sighs> All right, let's try this fight again. By the way, I'm probably not going to talk as much now since uh, I don't feel like talking and I'm going to focus up. by 86 that's actually good and I'm actually not gonna even bother healing that I'll tell you why because basically he one shots every single time he attacked him but he didn't one shot so that basically means even if I heal him the next time he gets attacked he's probably just gonna die right away 
so I'm just not gonna heal. He'll get attacked, he's gonna die anyway, but that gives me an extra attack, basically. So actually, that's good that he survived. That's like pretty lucky, but I'm not gonna revive him. I'm just gonna go ahead and keep attacking. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do Raging Fang then. And then Battle Flash. And I'm just gonna keep doing that with him. And then, yeah. I'm really hoping he doesn't defend oh, on Blang's hyper. If he defends this, it's gonna suck. Okay, good, he didn't defend it. Oh, he didn't defend on any of it, it's pretty good. See, and now she's low health. She would have 100% died from that, so that basically just gives us an extra turn, you know what I'm saying? Huh! Mystic my foot! I'm a gazillion times stronger than that! Okay, so I'm just gonna hyper art with Lang again, and then... I'm gonna use a revival. No, not on me. On mine, there we go. Yeah. So he has another target to attack, which is nice. And anyway, honestly, Sharon is not doing that much, um... That much damage. See? So basically, she actually might... No, she's not gonna survive it. She almost survived it. But basically, that kind of... That gives us a chance to kind of attack a little bit. So we could just keep up this method of reviving, letting him attack that person, and then just attack with Lang, since he's doing a bit of damage. Although, he's not gonna be doing damage now. So we're just gonna go ahead and we're just gonna origin. And then we're just gonna do another elixir on her. There we go. And since Sharon is fast, she'll always get the she'll always get the revive off before you can attack, which is nice. Unless he attacks Sharon, and in that case, we're in a bit of a bad spot, but we're just, hey, we're just gonna hope he doesn't, I guess. And we're gonna hope that this does a bit of damage. At least five thousand. 5,000, okay. We need, basically, we need 5,000 to win. We need at least 5,000. See, and he attacked my... And she might actually survive it. She's nuts. He's insane. Alright. Uh, we can, now, we won't be able to, so we're gonna have to save up our energy. And... Blue Moon Buster. Okay. With her, we're gonna go ahead and... What's everybody's... Um... Oh, we didn't re get her... Oh, no. Okay. What's every... Uh, I don't know. Uh, okay, we're gonna go ahead and just do... Um... Browns for... Oh. Hmm. You know what? I might as well, at that point, just uh, restore uh, 2,000 HP on him. Should I? Well, I guess she's not going to be attacking much anyway. Um, let's go do her origin, honestly, because she's not doing much damage on, like, physically she's not doing that much damage. So I'm actually guessing her origin's probably going to do a lot more damage than her attacking. I'm guessing at least 6,000. Oh, below 6,000, that sucks. Okay, good. So nearly 7,000, which is really nice. That's really nice. good. Already dead, buddy. I would say it's over. Plus, not to mention, like, yeah, she died and we killed her, but at the same time, she attacked me. So, technically, whose fault was that? Not mine. What? Whatever. I guess we'll have to kill him. Too. AP charge. Very nice. Alright. Uh, do, ooh, we can we can hyper very nice. Let's go ahead and use 
Roaring Fang. And then we're gonna have to use Battle Flash. Okay, with her, we're gonna go ahead and let's just attack. We might as well attack. And then with Sharon, we're gonna go ahead and and her supers are not that strong, honestly, so we're just gonna attack like normal. Watch this! Watch this! Come on! Come on. Oh, wait, wait. wait, I wish she had MP still. We could use her origin. Oh, well, we'll check after, I guess. Either way, she's gonna run out of origin power after the first attack or... So I guess it doesn't matter in which order we do it, unless he kills her, and then that's kind of Sorry! Oh, we oh we killed him. Jeez, this fight was a lot easier than last time. Last fight was hard, man. Hmm. I don't think the game remembers that we lost. Like, it doesn't decrease its difficulty because we lost, right? Hmm. I don't know. We must have got a really lucky run then. Or last run was just a really unlucky run. <laughs> I'm not strong enough. I'm not strong enough to avenge my poor Elfin's death. Elfin, sob. Damn it. Damn it all. Sucks for you, buddy. Okay, bro, you're gonna break the floor. Stop. It's your own church. Okay, I admit it. I did lose. I lost fair and square. It's all over. Right here and now. All over for this guy named Bubba. He's gone. Gone to that place beyond the twinkling stars in the sky. Gone to be with Elfin. Bro, this dude's not gonna just disappear in front of us, is he? He's gonna yoink. Bro, she's a gorilla. Come on, man. From now on, I'll be a lonely hunter. Searching for tomorrow, people will call me a drifter. Dreaming in an unknown tomorrow, traversing a wilderness of blood and pain. That's who I'll be from now on. Alright, dude. That ought to do it. Just enough to save face, even though I did lose. Well, I guess I'll hurry up and get out of here. Bro, that is a terrible cover story. The wilderness is calling me. I guess I'll be heading off. I guess... I guess Doplin headed south, looking for something called a sacred stone. Bubba, what made you decide to tell us? Uh, I don't know. It was just a whim, I guess. Instead of Doplin, I'd rather you guys. Nah, never mind. And here's a little present from me. You want to get to the checkpoint. Take this. Ah, what a nice guy. I don't wanna I don't wanna kill him anymore. He's very nice. Bubba dropped something on the floor. Yeah, he's he's a cool guy. Always liked him. Mm hmm Yep, he's a very nice guy. Always was. Hmm, what's this? Acquired a Cravian pass. Hey. Got it. We can now go into the Cravia, which is really nice. Alright, I'm not gonna heal because I'm pretty sure there's a checkpoint up here. And I'm, I'm, there's not going to be another fight on the way out. If there's another fight on the way out, I'd be surprised. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, do a little bit of the save save. Very nice. That fight... Okay, so once again, I'm not going to show the fight where I lost in the footage because there's no reason to. I lost it. I have to get the drawbridge down. Oops. Um, but just know that... I mean, obviously I lost, but like he kept using his hyper art over and over almost every single round and killed one of my party members the point where like I was reviving but he killed that part party and then I tried reviving with the last character and he just attacked it before he could revive so that's how we lost but the, that round we didn't almost lose at all we just kept attacking 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 so I don't I don't know we also survived quite a few hits for some apparent reason that we in the other attempt we didn't uh, we didn't survive so that's fine real quick we're gonna go ahead and um, Heal our MP, HP, you know, all that stuff. Uh, in my in my opinion, this is actually the, um, the cheapest place to actually do that. It's only 100 Gs, which really isn't that bad. But also, before we leave, we should probably restock on our health supplies. Three of those. Ten of these. We already have plenty of vegetables and buy, buy plenty of pork. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, there's more. Pork. Oh, and beef. 
and I guess we'll buy some beef. There we go. Alright, so hopefully we'll be able to cook more when we get to our uh, camp. We'll be able to cook a little bit more. Okay, and we saved. No, we didn't save. We rested, but we didn't save. We didn't save for a while because I got cocky. And um, I ended up dying in the Cabal Ruins, and I had to like traverse back over half an hour of unsaved footage. Hey! Yo, I have Cravian Passes, dog. Let me through. No one goes through without a Cravian Pass. Ah! What? Could that actually be a Cravian Pass? Yes, sir. We'll open the gate right away. Thank you. Open the gate! Thanks, brothers. <gasps> This is the town! This is the town where, uh, Avalon! Phew, finally, we got through at last. I remember those little wind turbines, and the sand, and the walls. By the way, what do you guys plan on doing now? Once we get through here, we're going to the down south of Tanza to borrow a ship. Tanza for a ship, huh? Then what? What are you planning on going by a ship? I'm just gonna tell you truthfully. We're headed for Draconia to get the Pyrolyph. Never mind, Aqua. Don't tell her our plan. She wouldn't understand. Hey, pardon me. I'm not blind, you know. I know you guys are grappling with something really big. I can tell that much without being told. It's like you guys have... Oh, I don't know. Some kind of huge mission you gotta accomplish. Okay, I've made up my mind. I'll keep you guys company a, a while... A little while longer. Count me in. What? Really? I guess I don't mind. What do you think, Master? I don't care. She can do whatever she wants. By the way, Master, exactly how far is Tanza from here anyway? Once we get through this town, it's just south of here, but there are lots of shops here. We better take a look around. Also, if you guys know a little backstory of Sharon, remember that little part where she said her dad is a pirate? Pirates, ships, me again. Also, not to mention, if you guys recognize this town, back in the beginning of the game, we saw a uh, Lang's dream with Avalon, and Avalon, his hometown, looked exactly like this, where he was attacked. So, um, I don't know if this is it. It might be, though. Let's check out the rest of the town. Welcome to the Hunter's Guild. We provide quest referrals here. Uh, ask about available quests. Tans, uh, is sold in Tans. I want you to buy some for me. Find the rare creature. It's a, capture a rare creature called a lipster for me, and investigate the giant, the golden giant you'll find there. Um. Okay. Let's accept the quest. Um. So we basically these are quests of like things in the game you can do. I guess we'll go find that. You'll never know what. Okay. Let's let's put in the money. One thousand. That's not that bad. Hell beast. Let's do it one more time. Just one more time. Restore leaf. Oh, that's not that good. These are wanted posters for vicious monsters and criminals. These are for criminal. Yeah. Okay. What do you sell? Welcome to Dream Burger. What will you have? Um, nothing for now. Cause I need to save a little bit of money. Um. Okay. So this is just the guild. So we'll come back here and do some. Uh, other quests that's going here. Oh, you have a VP. Okay, what does this place sell? Okay, so this is the item shop. Okay, so we're not gonna buy too many items now. I'm just gonna steal this from you, little girl. Sorry about that. Oh, also, what I'm planning to do is um, do a little bit of grinding. Welcome, welcome. Only place for fresh vegetables. Get them while they last. Okay, so this is. Let's go ahead and get some milk. Get plenty of those. Let's go ahead and get some cream also. There we go. See what's up here uh oh okay so there's like different types of food let's go ahead and get a couple crabs there we go i'm just gonna steal this from you thank you thank you welcome okay so this is more premium beef let's only buy two of those plenty of poultry and a little bit of animal meat there we go that'll help us with some cooking very nice i don't think there's anything up and i'm guessing this is um okay so these are Shock Ripper. Okay, that's... Okay, so this is the weapon shop. Okay. Can I... Can I not take these? Okay. So that's the weapon shop. Right now, I'm just getting a good layout of this place. So, um... 
It's like a giant crater. Oh my god, there's a lot of stuff here. A welcome to the Cravia Kebabs. Cravian Kebabs, okay. Um, okay, so those are the... Okay, um, probably we can... I don't know what happened, but there's a big crater. Oops, sorry, I wasn't watching where I was going. Also, this even gives me a bigger, like, this is 100% the town that Avalon got attacked in because guess who made this crater? Him! In the dream, he went, Pff. You look like a nice guy, why don't I let you in on a little secret? It's a really good secret, wanna hear it? She's a hook. Yes. I wanna hear the secret. A secret, a good one, huh? Alright. Hee hee hee, wait till you hear this, it's a really good secret. Come out here so nobody else would hear. Bro. What did I just pay for? Come up close. Let me whisper in your ear. What? You're joking. You know what? I can't believe it. You've got to be kidding. My controller is vibrating. And that's the whole secret. What do you think? Pretty amazing, huh? Ooh, I feel sick. So is that the secret? No. What did I just do? Ew. That was... Oh, what's some kind of seat? Uh... Okay, none of this probably matters. Ew. Come on, Lang. I mean, I... I... Whatever. Um, let's see what's in here. Oh, this is probably the local hotel. Welcome to the Bill an Oasis in the Desert. What can I get you? Um, no, nothing for now. Um, sign more and more monsters. The crops are going to be Nobody knows. I wonder. Yeah, it's whatever. I don't know if I picked a different dialogue up. She's going to give me some other, like, maybe like an item or something. What is up here? Free food? Okay, so now we can get- okay, so that takes us up here. Uh, magic in a bottle. I guess let's take a look at the rest of these rooms. Oh, it's Kinjiro! Oh no, it's a different fat guy! Hey kid, are you a traveler? I'm the peddler. The name's Fujima. Yeah, I know, I know your brother. Kinjiro. I'm leaving for Darkin. As soon as an assistant on the caravan of travel- I uh, is a big deal, blah blah blah, nobody cares. No! I didn't mean to jump off! Let's see what's in here. Um, Kansas flooded. It got covered by a tidal wave that hit when the black sun up here. Okay, let's see what's down here. Uh, welcome to all rooms are 120. No, we I would, but we just slept at um, the other town, so it's fine. Okay, so that seems like that is the entire island. Cool. And down here is where we go to the ship. Alright, so real quick. Go back to the weapon shop. Yeah, let's see what we can upgrade for the amount of money that we have at the moment. But I do plan on going out to maybe Damascus Blade. So this is actually better. Okay, so that's, that's probably good enough. We could also probably sell some of our stuff. Anyway, let's, let's add the Damascus. Okay, and then... Who did we buy stuff for? Oh, this is actually better. Okay, let's place that. And then... Okay. Alright, we're fine with all the characters then. AP. Where is... Oh, oh, never mind. The AP we can't. Okay, cool. So that's all we can get for now. So guys, here's what I'm gonna do. Um... I'm going to end off the episode right here for now. And next episode, we're going to go down and continue with everything. This might have been a short episode because I think we only did the bubble fight, basically. Um, and I was checked out the town. But guys, we'll do the rest of it next episode. So guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like the comment, subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you guys later. God bless and goodbye. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Legea. So today, we're going to finally go to the uh, town of Tanza to get a boat uh, to go over to get the Pyrolyph. But before we do that, if you guys remember back in the last episode, we stopped by Caribia.
that's what it's called. And we found the Guild Club, where you can kind of do like special quests. And we accepted the one to go find the Golden Golem. Golden Giant? Yeah, I think it's a Golden Giant. So, before we go um, to like complete the story, we're going to quickly do the side quest because the Golden Giant sounds sick. Okay, guys, there's the Golden Giant. We can finally face him real quick. Let me just... I don't know how strong this thing is, so I'm just gonna heal just in case. I don't... This thing shouldn't be that strong. That's it. That's the Golden Giant. It attacked me. It shouldn't... I don't think it's that strong. Gorgneon. Gorgneon. Gorgneon? Gorgneon. Alright, let's just go full... Like, full attack on it. I don't care how much. Let's go full attack on it. With her... We're gonna guard with her, and then with her, I think we're just gonna go. I think I think this is our just normal attack. Yeah. Oh, so we don't know what's HP. Oh. Oh, so it's like considered like a boss enemy. Okay. Interesting. So we're not gonna know how much HP it has. So I guess we can just go. Yeah. Just attack it, I guess. I don't know. Damage. That's a lot of damage. Almost 8,000. Jeez. Let's see how strong it is. That didn't do. That didn't. That's not. It doesn't do anything. I mean, I guess she was blocking, but. Oh, she wasn't even. Man. Don't tell me it's that weak.
this might be an issue. I think two people are dead. I think two people are dead. Yeah, two people died. Ouch. Okay, well, we're just gonna revive. Wait, wait, wait. No, don't, don't, don't. I almost like revived myself by accident. It's definitely. Yeah. Thank God that Sharon is faster than this stupid thing. So, well, 100% we get a revival. But, oh, and, okay, that's not gonna kill it. Okay. So what we can do here, we can, with him, we can do the Silver Brome. And then with her, we can revive. So Sharon always revives first. Yeah. So this is like the speed of the characters. So we revive her, and then Lang does the Silver Brome. So instead of doing the silver brome and then reviving, which that would suck, obviously. Okay, we're back in it. We're back in it. Again, that's the really good thing about him is that he doesn't really fight back much. In a lot of boss cases, they're very, very fast, and they would kill you before you can even have a chance to revive. So, only problem is we lose all, um, all of your AP MP. I think it's AP. After you die, so I was gonna go all hyper hard playing, but he died. So he lost all of it. He was like close to 90, which kind of sucks. That's how it is, though. He's still alive, man. Still alive. I guess we're only doing 2,000 damage to it. Like, that's not a lot. Now that I think about it. Bolts from above. We have done a lot of damage to, like, orges and stuff. At least, like, 30, 40,000. Oh man, what's with this attack being good all of a sudden, man? Okay, well, we're definitely gonna go one more time with her. Uh, no, we're gonna go ahead and Silver Brome. And hopefully he attacks Sharon or Aqua, not Maya, because that would suck. We want to do that. Ready? Pay attention! We beat him! I wasn't even thinking! What? We beat him! Oh, I was looking at my other screen! Alright, we got a lot of money from that. 20,000. Very nice. I wasn't- I finally beat him. I wasn't even looking. Idiot. Who are these two? Balzac Mad. Balzac Real Mad. Monster was my smash. Me smash boy instead. Grr, grr. <laughs> what guy here? Stop that Balzac. Isn't it really Balzac? His name is Ballsack. Can't you see he's scared? But me want scare boy. Boy smash my smash. Enough already. You're quite the fighter. I'm surprised you're able to take out the golden Gorgion. Well, if you don't mind me asking, but what's your name? I'm just gonna tell him the name. It's Aqua. Aqua. I'll have to remember that. My name's Fanta. And this brute here is my partner, Ballsack. We're bounty hunters. I have a feeling we'll be running into you again. Ballsack. No boy's face now. Boy smash my monster. Ballsack smash face. I'll oh, put a sock in it. Come on, Ballsack. Let's get going. Ta ta, Aqua. Yeah. Alright, see ya. What a couple of weirdos. Oh well, at least the job's done. Better get to the guild and collect my money. Yeah, they better have my money. Very cool. Okay. Now, I could just take a while. Don't I have, a, like, a thing to get me out of here instantly? Okay, guys, so quickly before we enter uh, Caravia, Caravia, whatever, we're going to save. And also, guys, remember, during all this grinding of me leveling up, I also did gather quite a bit of gold. So I know last episode I said that I couldn't really buy much because I didn't have much gold. Well, now it's the exact opposite. I have plenty. So, uh... These, we're gonna buy... We're not gonna buy too many, because that's more expensive than I even thought. Okay. So 
we'll just do that and we'll buy maybe five of those because we're rich not that rich <laughs> gotta gotta keep a cap on them uh, let's go back to the weapon shop she see if we can upgrade anything let's buy so let's see that doesn't do anything um, is there a better one silver plate no okay let's buy all of that and then quickly let's go collect our our bounty and then we'll come back and buy some more also we can't forget that we, we still have a lot of stuff to sell uh, you, yep, here you go, here's your reward money. It said, it, but it, too bad it wasn't real gold, you would have been rich. Oh, it's, uh... Okay, so we got a Gaia Blade. Oh, crap. Actually, never mind, I was gonna say, I shouldn't have bought the Damascus Blade, because that might be better, but we bought that last episode, there was no way I would have known. Let's actually check, how strong is the Gaia Blade? That is a, oh, that's a lot stronger, jeez. Okay, let's put the Gaia Blade on. And maybe we'll even be able to upgrade it, like, more. Our meat is delicious, yes, I, I bet it is. Alright, let's see. So, now we can buy a few more things. So we stopped here. Stone doesn't need anything. Shock Ripper, we don't... We don't need the Shock Ripper. Um... Okay, guys, so... That's basically everything. Now, I know there's also a Charm Dealer. There's a person here. Hmm. You smell like blood. Dark red blood. I've got a sense for these things. You've covered with it. You look like a kid. Are you any good? Answer with confidence. I don't want to brag, but I'm pretty good. Hmm. So you've got confidence in yourself, huh? Watch it. Overconfidence is a killer. Hey, there's Ballsack. Oh, ho, freaky monsters everywhere. But most, the scariest monster is Steel. Ugh, Steel, he's strong, but Ballsack had more muscle. Good as that, you big muscle bound idiot. Grunt. If you've got time to be pumping up those useless muscles, why aren't you fighting? What? My muscles are as hard like steel. They make me invincible. Oh no, I'm invisible. Oh no, I mean invincible. Hey. Hmm. Nothing but stupid useless quests. Every one of them. Not the kind of not the kind of quest good enough for our skills, that's for sure. Come on, ball sack, let's go. Let's go try our luck. What is this going to give us? Attack oil. Nice. Say it's all good. We upgraded our stuff pretty nicely. And we're just going to keep going. We're going to continue the story. was the place, the dream, when Avalon went Super Saiyan. What's the matter, Aqua? No, it's nothing. This is where he went Super Saiyan. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so let's go down to Port Town, Tanza. Very nice. Very nice looking village. Nice, peaceful. It'd be a shame if something happened to it. Huh? What ha what happened? What's going on here? Okay, not gonna lie, I literally said that as a joke. I didn't actually mean it. It only happened a few days ago, around the time when the black sun appeared in the sky. The ground shook, a wave hit the town with a huge roar. <sighs> ah, so sad. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Look, my house is destroyed too. Is this because of the, the black sun? Perhaps. Could have. Could this have had to do something with the eclipse that created the black sun? Our, our ship. Our ocean. Bro! <laughs> Bro! <sighs> Bro! What are we going to do? Since the harbor is destroyed, we can't borrow a ship. Are you looking for a ship? Do you have any suggestions? I don't know if it will help, but there is a ship. But what is it? Spit it out. It's a pirate ship. It's called the Black Hawk. They say nothing can sink it. Rumor says the pirate's hideaway is called Derek's Haunt, but I doubt they'll let you on board. 
Derek Ponce. It's a cave to the south of Tanza. Be careful, they're pirates, you know. What are pirates? Oh, it's pirates. Come on, man. They spend all their time at sea. They're the lowest of the low. No. They're not like that. They look rough, but uh, they saved us many times when we were in trouble. They're like sailors. They're like saviors for us sailors. Well, anyway, why don't we check out the pirates' hideout? Yeah, let's go. I guess we might as well check out this town while we're here. Okay, so we can't do anything about that, right? My ship! Okay, let's check out what's going on all the way over here. Got a camping kit. What you selling, dog? One of those, one of those, one of those. Okay. Cool. Wind handle staff. Can I put that on Maya? What is a wind handle staff? Oh no. Okay, never mind. I was like, dude, can Maya use a staff? That'd be sick. Okay, what's sold here? Welcome. Our food's pretty special. Hope you like it. Okay, let's just try something. Why not? Chomp, chomp. Ah, whoa, this is hot. My mouth's on fire. Yeah, Stone might like this stuff. No, 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 no. I didn't mean to do it again. Let's see who else is around here. Okay. Can't believe our ship. Blah, blah, blah. Wait, wh what did this guy say? Uh, they say Thunder Windstone can control wind. Many tried to dig it in the mine. Uh, it's full of holes now. Okay, whatever. Use re irrelevant. Okay, so these guys sell, I'm guessing, right? Um. Okay. These guys are apparently. You know, we'll give them some business. Why not? We'll buy. Let's buy some mos, mofu, some tofu. Very nice. Give them some business, huh? Thank you, Captain. Don't know if it'll help you, but take it anyway. Popular Edo dishes. Stop by again. Definitely will, my guy. Very nice. Anyway, we'll be having weird... Uh, okay, cool. Can you sell me something? Oh, I keep pressing on it by accident. Okay. Let's go see what is up in here. Uh, welcome to the hot spring. You know what? Let's stay at the hot spring. I'm guessing there's probably going to be a funny cutscene. There always is, hopefully. No cutscene. Wow. That is not very typical of a, of a Japanese game to not have a spicy cutscene at the at the sauna. Hey, it's uh, Tanza Tea Cakes. Would you like some? Uh, give me six. Why not? Tanza Tea Cakes. Anything we can steal in here? Nope. Chest, we can steal that. Restore Blossom, very nice. Uh, actually, put a thousand in there. Why not? Yo, yo, come here for the hot springs. It costs 300. You know what? Let's go in. Let's go in. Yes, there probably is going to be something. A battle left, a uh, bottle left, but it seems empty. Uh, the spring, blah, blah, blah. Please enjoy our hot tub effective. Of course. Do you want to go get out? No, 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 not yet, not yet. No, I clicked the wrong thing. No. Okay, I don't care. I don't care about 300. I'm going back in. If I, I, if I miss something, haha, <laughs> you. Quit wandering around, it's annoying. Brother, I'm trying to see. There's a tiny hole here, now that you can see nothing but steam. Are you kidding me? Man! In every single Japanese thing, something happens in this sauna. Come on. That's a load of bogus. Alright, let's get out. Okay, now that I want to get out, I can't, apparently. Okay, I wasted 300 on that, but hey, you know what? 100% worth it. 100% <laughs> worth it. Oh, I was like, huh? Anything in here that I can yoink? There's a little kid. Hi, little kid. Hot spring, hot spring, yeah! Okay. Hey, what's wrong, kid? Nothing wrong. What's wrong with you? Alright, let's get out of here. <clears throat> let's go to... Whatever this place is. Hello. Ooh, weapons, very nice. Hopefully I didn't waste all my money at the other place. Let's see if they have anything. Oh, VIP card. Okay. Um, we already have plenty of those. Magic bottle. Um, 
Okay, I think we're good with that. Let's see what this guy sells. Okay, so nothing here is better. Demon Gleamer, this is better, darn it, man. Tiger, Tiger Bikini. And these are better. Okay, that's not better. Flare Jacket. Let's see if we can combine anything. Can we combine anything? We could. You know what? I'll just buy both of those. Honestly, Maya is having a bit of trouble fighting recently. Combine armor. Let's see if we can make Maya's stuff even better. No. Okay, let's see what they're up to. Hi, did you come here to see the harbor too? It's too bad. Uh, try, trying to put now all my muscles. This is a funny ball sack. We can go to the things like this. Okay. Let's see what she's all about. Hey, try my specialty traditional ramen. I've been practicing it for years. It's so good. Four thousand. Let's do it. I'm so happy. I'll pour my soul into your ramen. Hiya. Hey, thanks for waiting. This is a real deal. Three thick slices of pork and just look at this clear broth. $4,000, I'll buy it. Support the local business. Munch Munch, the food here is so good. I bet I paid $4,000 for it, man. Better be good. Let's run over here. Anything over here? Doesn't look like it. Ooh, there's a nice little house here. Guess let's investigate what's inside the house. Hello, the green... Oh, what's wrong? Not really. Uh, I'm sorry, I thought you were one of the bad patients. I've been having... Uh, if you have any monster blood meat or anything I can use to study them, please sell it to me. Um... Okay, I can sell stuff to him. Do I... Thanks for looking out for me. Sure. I don't know if, like, you need something specific. Um, you want to volunteer for my experiment. Right now, I can probably conduct... Go on. Oh! What's a volunteer? What's a volunteer? A fool. I mean, an important person who participated in this experiment to get closer to God. Into the machine, please. If I does um, try a pop quiz, right? Quiz. I'll give you a total of ten questions. Answer what you win. Sure. What is the name of Darkin's famous restaurant? Um, Darkin's. Um, the Seville Torah. Wrong. There are many schools of fighting. Which fusing of fighting spirit with the sword? Is that correct? Uh. What does want to have? Medicine. You're so silly. What is the famed dish of... Um, I don't know, dude. I'm just gonna skip all of these. Because I already got a bunch of them wrong. Oh, I got them correct. Correct. Is all of them A? Oh, okay, I was gonna say... Uh, no, no, no. Don't try. Okay. Uh, we might come back to this place later to see what that was all about, but... For now, I don't really care. Oh, that's hot, isn't it? Okay. Uh, strange storage area. Okay, I might Google what's going on in that house and if there's anything special we need to do. We'll get it. Okay, but we need to go to the pirates. Uh, apparently to the pirate cave? So that's interesting. Let's go ahead and save real quick. Now, we don't- how much money do we have? 19,000. We're running low on money again. I grinded all of that money and sold everything. And I'm, again, down to a thunder mine. Oh, that's a new area. Okay, I guess let's just go to the thunder mine. See what's up with this place. Because if this is a good grinding spot, I might just stay here. Enemy right away? I might just stay here and grind. Let's see how I'll strong these things are. Fiend bulb, shade flower. How strong are these things and how much XP do they give? Let's go ahead and do a hyper arch to test them out and then do that. Let's do it on the shade flower with her. Let's go ahead and magma mayhem and then ice flow against the fiend bulb and with her let's go ahead and attack. Just a normal attack against the shade flower. Okay, these things aren't that strong actually. They're strong. Actually, we might actually, they probably are strong. We're just a little over leveled and we're doing a lot of damage. That's gonna be, is that gonna be close to 7,000 or 8,000? 7,000, yeah. That is a lot of damage. Like, we upgraded our stuff pretty good, honestly. I guess while we're here, we'll just check out the place. Why not? You can see the earth has been disturbed. What's going on here? I guess we'll just keep going. 
what's the point of it? Not... Maybe, maybe I should have saved this for the next episode, honestly. Lightning Tear. I probably should have saved this for the next episode, but you know, we'll go a bit further. You know what, I'm gonna be generous. I like to, I like to give content. Okay, let's keep going. Go ahead and jump this. Let's see what's over here. Okay, so is there... Oh, boy. Okay, let's go ahead and... Go ahead and rest. And then let's go ahead and okay, let's just chat once. That crater uh, was that Avalon's? Yeah, that's terrible. Yeah, so they're just talking about Avalon and what happened to him. Go ahead and cook something. Um, what recipes have we learned? We could just cook his curry, I guess. What is this, cocoa cake? How much does curry do? Oh, but this. Okay, well the cocoa cake gets everything up by a little bit. Um, yeah. Stones gives us a lot of... Wait, no, no, I wanted to save. Gives us a lot of, um, attack, but lowers some other things. With the Cocoa Cake, it just kind of puts everything up a little bit. So, I'll take that over his... Okay. Go ahead and save. Now, what's this place about? You know what, actually, guys? I think I'm gonna end off the episode here. Guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to look at the comment as well the channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Legaeus. Last time we left off at the Thunder Mines. I came in here really not knowing what I'm doing, and surprise, surprise, I still don't know what I'm doing. So we're just going to continue and uh, hope everything's good. So let's go. What is this? Ooh. Okay, it just won't let me past it. Can I do something with Sharon? Okay. It clearly does not want me to get past it. So, I guess we're not. Okay, let's see what this, what does this thing do? There's a round hole. Insert the lightning tear. Yes, let us insert the lightning tear. I think I got that. No, 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 no. No, put it back, put it back. Forget it. Okay. No. Stop clicking buttons. Okay. Oh. Oh, I get it. It's that type of puzzle. Okay. And we probably gotta come back and remove it and put it in another one. I guess we'll just move over here. Okay. I kind of get what this puzzle's about. If it is a puzzle, at least. I don't know. I guess we'll see. That's the point of this game. Just explore, right? So we're just gonna explore. What is over here? I guess let's walk over here. Okay, it's just a chest, guardian ore, but not really worth- actually, usually I don't go for chests, but actually we might have to, if it contains items we need to put in those pedestals, might actually have to go. What is this? Looks like a heavy rock. Can I move it? Oh, I think I'd prob- okay, so there's other characters in this game. There's one more character- spoiler. There's one character we need to get in this game that we haven't gotten yet. Um, the jelly melt. Can we fight it? Can we, like, bang it? Yes! 200 IQ, boys. Is that literally all for a chest? Lightning tier. Oh, that, oh, so that's a lightning tier for the... I get it. So he's got to collect, keep collecting lightning tiers. So we can kind of keep setting off the switches. I get it. I get it, I get it.
Okay, so now we come back up here and we place uh, the lightning tier in this one. And that should open up another one. Okay, so that one turned off this one all the way over here. So I didn't realize that. Now, okay, so we need another one to plug into here. Which I'm guessing is down this path. Yeah, let's go see what's up here. Oh, is this where... No, this isn't where we came from, is it? I wonder. No, this isn't where we came from. Okay, I guess let's break those blocks after we see what's up with them, maybe? Magic bottle, okay. So that, I wonder, can we like break them under us? That'd be really cool. No, we can't break them under us. Okay, we'll have to go all the way around. Nice surprise. Alright, I'm hoping this is a lightning tear. Please be a lightning tear. Book of Eden, that is not a lightning tear. That's not a lightning tear. The okay guys, so just real quick, a little update, I'm still kind of grinding what we don't do. We figured out, so basically, we have to take, first, well, the first thing we have to do was place the lightning stone in the western pedestal. Then go down, get the southern pedestal, then we have to take the one from western, put it into right. eastern, and then get the last two. And also, I didn't know why I was even here, because it kind of just came here randomly. So it turns out I probably should have gone to Derek's Pond, which is the place we're supposed to go next. I should have gone there first, because basically when I'm over there, they're going to tell us we need an item from here. So basically we're going to get an item from here that we're going to need for over there, but we haven't even gone over there yet. So basically we're just kind of ahead on the game where we're going to get the item that we're going to need quicker. Which in a sense doesn't really matter actually, like, that just means we just, we have 200 IQ and we did stuff before people even told us to. But, anyway. Um, yeah. So now we want to remove this one. Oh no, remove it, remove it. No, so we want to remove that. Come over here, accept encounters. So we insert that, and that shuts off this one over here. Okay, so now we go over here, I think. Not 100% sure if my guy would move, that would help me quite a bit. Oh no, this just lets us go over here. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Didn't I, when I put it in the eastern one, didn't it also remove the one that blocked me from going over towards the eastern section of the canyon? Yeah, over here. Okay, now I know what to do. So we gotta go over here. I didn't realize this un-unelectrified. Okay, so now, please be lightning too. Oh, crap, I forgot to shoot it. 400 XP. Pure petrify thing. Okay, that doesn't even help. That's not even lightning too. Feels bad. Okay, let's go up first, I guess. Go ahead and heal the vines. Rebus. Go up. This has to be lightning. Silver. Not even a light. What? That's bonkers. Another encounter. Let's see what is over here. Um, I guess we'll go down here first. Um, okay. Let's try to be careful with this. I know there's like a little pattern here. Let's go ahead and 
that perspective is super confusing. Okay, I guess we'll come back later. Let's just come back later with that. Okay, I guess we'll go up first, and then we'll break that later. Okay, this has to be a lightning tear. This isn't a lightning tear. Lightning tear, yes! I was just saying, I'm gonna get real mad if it ain't. And then the last one should be after this, hopefully. I'm really starting to think that big block that looks like I had uh, where we just were a second ago. We have to use the last character that we don't have to do that. So I don't I don't think the lightning tear would be behind that unless we get that character at the pirate ship, but it shouldn't. Lightning tear, okay, good. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. So the other place we can't do yet until we get that last character. But now we do have all the lightning tears, which is nice. I'll Alright everybody, let's go put in the rest of these stupid tears. Uh, so we have one in here. Uh, we need one in the north and the south. No, no. We need one in the north and the west. Yes. So we need one here. Insert, yes. Insert. No, don't, don't remove it. They place the last stone, and that should open up the middle. Yep, and all, yeah, all the rest of those should open up, and we can go towards the middle where there will be a boss fight. So what we're gonna do? Stop at camp. We're gonna go ahead and rest using a camping kit. We're gonna go ahead and cook, um, and we're gonna have big strength, big boy strength. So we're gonna go ahead and make stone crazy so this this decreases our mp and stuff but it hugely increases our uh, attack and of course since there's gonna be a boss fight we better save in case we lose and i do have a little bit of a history of accidentally losing easy bosses or just losing two bosses all right let's head towards the middle and i guess we'll just take this route because why not Oh, big, oh, big lightning, big lightning. What the heck is this? That is big lightning, boy. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, do a little bit of fighting. Storm idol. Very interesting. Uh, so let's go ahead and attack. Let's just go ahead and go full, full rage mode. And do that. And by the way, guys, real quick. It's a little bit extra, so you guys might be wondering why I'm even here once again. So, the story is that uh, we need to get some items to steer the ship. Because, I mean, we don't know this yet, but I'm just going to tell you that. So we needed an item to steer the ship. So we came here to get it. That's why we're fighting. Because I know we, the game hasn't really told us why we're here, because obviously we're not supposed to go here just yet. This should do quite a bit of damage. We should do at least 10,000, I'm hoping. I'm hoping for at least 10,000, 12,000. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, fire is not good against this thing. That's... Okay, so we learned. Fire is not good against this thing. Actually... Hmm. Temperious. Actually, not as much damage as I thought as I thought it would. 
Alright, so we're gonna have to go ahead and do normal attacks against a battle flash and then wind attack. With her. Um, let's go ahead and use Big Bang, why not? And then let's try Thunder Head? I know it's a Thunder type po I was supposed to say Pokemon. I'm not playing Pokemon guy. Let's just do that. Normal attack. It's Damage. A thousand? Didn't expect that. Could be worse. Do we have attack oil? Where's my attack oil? In okay, attack raises. So let's raise his power. And let's go ahead and just do normal attack. Oh, it's dead. Okay, we didn't even have to set up for it. It's dead. Okie dokie. 30,000. Take it. Wait a minute, this is the Thunder Wind Stone. It's huge. A thunder Wind Stone, yeah, it lets you control the wind. This rock is worth a lot of money. I don't think there are any more of these left. I'm surprised the monster had it. What a lucky break. So yeah, we didn't know that we needed it, but we're gonna need it. Let's head back up, and let's get out of here. All right, guys, we finally made it out. Whew. All right, let's quickly go back to Port Town Tanza. We're going to go ahead and rest up a little bit. Oh, what is Sharon doing here? Mm, I knew I'd have a great time here in the hot spring. What do you think, Aqua? Do I look different after taking a bath? Now that you mention it, your skin's all pink and kind of sexy. Yay, so you can tell, Aqua. Wait, how much did she say she spent? How much did, did you soak your head too long, Sharon? Did, how much? How much did she spend? I thought she said like a like a thousand million G's. I'm like, huh? Anyway, um, let's go ahead and stay. I'm pretty sure will that recover our M MP? MP? Please tell me MP. Yes, MP restored. Very nice. Okay, what we're gonna do then? We're gonna save and we're gonna end off the episode here, guys. So if you did enjoy. Uh, make sure to like and comment as well as the channel, and I will see you guys later. Next time we'll go to the cave where the pirates are. So yeah, see you guys then. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Legaea 2. Today we're continuing, and we're gonna go ahead and finally go to Derek's Haunt. Um, so yeah, let's just go. Real quickly, I did do some grinding in between this episode and last episode, so everyone is about four to five levels higher and we have about 300,000 gold on us at the moment so we're quite over leveled and we have a lot of gold so that'll help us in the next coming episodes Whoa, this is a pirate ship? Sure is. Stop right there. Who the heck are you? You know that you're in a pirate hideout, don't you? 
This ain't no place for kids. Be off now. You want to keep your head on your shoulders, that is. Boy, bite me. I like my head right where it is, thank you. What's all this about, guns? Boss, is that you? It's so good to see you. Back, ma'am. Question mark. Don't try to be polite now. You already insulted my guests, you dimwit. If my father were still here, he'd have cut off one of your arms, I bet. Isn't that right, guns? Not that. Please, boss, I don't know. I'm sorry. Not boss, how many times do I have to tell you that to call me captain? When are you gonna when, when are you gonna get it right? Spread the word, guns. The captain's back. And I've brought guests. You got it. I mean, captain. We back, boys. So, why do they call you boss, Sharon? Uh huh. Because I am the boss, leader of the most feared pirating outfit that ever sailed the seas. That's me, and captain of the strongest pirate ship in the world, the Bloodhawk. So, I bet this comes as a shock to you all. Huh? What's wrong? Why aren't you surprised? Why would we be? Why would we be surprised? I, I've, I've been waiting for this moment with such anticipation, you have no idea. This, this was supposed to be the big event where I finally tell you who I really am. A normal person would freak out. Here I am acting as if my life depended on it, and I get nothing from you. You've got no heart, people. No heart. Sheesh. Oh well, forget about it. Come on, let me show you around the hideout. I think it's about time you told me what it is you're after, don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Whatever. Same thing. Alright, let's check out the place. So that's another reason why I grinded out. Okay, might as well just show you. What am I doing? So, Aqua's level 47, Maya 46, Sharon 49, and we have 400,000 gold. Um, they also learned some new things, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I forgot to put... Okay, I should probably put that on. Um, they have a couple new abilities and stuff, which we'll look at later. But I guess, um, let's take a look. What's over here? Okay, there's nothing. There's a chest. Might as well quickly grab this chest. Restore leaf. I don't even know why they have like that one. Like, one thing I don't get about games is they made this entire area just for that one little chest. Like, couldn't you put something nice in that chest at least? Okay, okay, I don't need to hear anymore. I think I've got a handle on it. I've got to tell you though, this Avalon guy in the Source Forge. It sure sounds like you picked quite a fight for yourselves, don't you think? Alphys Blade. He was my father. When he, when he was still the boss, he had a fleet of pirate ships and over 200 people working for him. But something happened. His first mate left, and then one by one, others started to leave. Now the few of us that are left spend our days hiding out in this hole like rats. I made a promise to my father. I promised that one day, one day I would make things the way that they used to be. No matter what it takes, we're going to have a fleet again, and rule the open seas. In order to do that, I've got to do something really big, something that'll shock the entire world, something something that will make Sharon Blade so famous that people will come here begging to join us. Hmm. There is no guarantee that people will thank you for helping us, all our efforts may come to naught. That's true, but I'm sick and tired of hiding out here like a sticking rat. It's times like this. I know I'm my father's daughter, just talking about something like this has my blood pumping. And now that I know what you're up against, I'm staying in for the long haul. I'm going to help you. I ship, my men, and I are at your disposal, Aqua. It's definitely accept our offer. Thanks, Sharon. We're going to win this fight, and we're going to do it together. You better believe it. We're going to be the most fierce pirates in all the... Oops, we're supposed to be saving the world, right? Well, let's not quabble. We're going to make a big splash. I thought you would turn us down, but you look more eager than we are. You really are Alphys' daughter. Alphys' daughter? Hmm. Did you know my father? Of course I did. There isn't a soul alive that hasn't heard about Alphys' blade. Man of the sea. That's right. See? He knows what to say. My father was a man of the sea, and I'm a woman of the sea. Alright, you scoundrels. Get ready to weigh anchor. Come on now. Put some spring in your step. Roger. You got it, boss. Aye, aye. <laughs> it's a small crew, but they're the best 
at what they do. Let's go. Seize the colony. Alright, let's get a move on. Is there anything for me to steal? Can I steal anything? Doesn't look like it. Alright, let's go upstairs. Let's see if there's anything to steal in here. Uh. No, I'm not gonna take a nap here because that'll probably actually lower my HP. Jane, who are you? This is my sister's room. I don't even let her crew inside, let her alone strangers. Uh, just make an excuse. Sharon asked me to get a map from her room. Just let me in to get that and then I'll leave. If my sister wants a map, then I'll bring it to her. You can't go inside. Hmm, maybe I should try again later. Can, oh, is it, can I just switch to Sharon? But I forgot we're not in the... Um... Crap. But we can't force our way in, so it looks like we're gonna have to come back later. Probably on a different... Uh, different, like, part of the... Like, later in the plot. Open. Time to get to work. Hurry and get the ship ready. We're off to... Just where are we off to, Aqua? I'm pretty sure that the Pyrolith is on the Volcanic Isle. Volcanic Isle? The only Volcanic Isle in these parts is... Uh, I believe he means the island of Draconia to the southwest, Captain. But, just where are we supposed to be looking for there? Why, treasure, of course. What else would we be looking for? Um, actually, we're looking for the Pyrolith. Pyrolith? Is that some kind of humongous ruby? I bet it's big enough to make us all rich. Captain, I hate to spoil this little party, but the ship won't budge. What? What's wrong with it, Dupin? The Thunderwind Stone is dead. Without a replacement, we're dead in the water. Thunderwind Stone? Not a problem. We picked up one at the Thundermine, didn't we, Aqua? You mean that rock? What about it? The ship is powered by a Thunderwind Stone. Don't ask me how it works, but it lets us conjure up the wind whenever we need it. So yeah, uh, last episode, we technically weren't supposed to do it yet, but we did it. Well, here then. Give the Thunderwind Stone to Dupin. Whoa, it's huge. I've never seen a Thunderwind stone this big. A rock that size should last us a hundred years or more. I'll go install it right away. So it's a good thing we got that done earlier. Okay, we've got our Thunderwind stone. It's time to get this adventure underway. Captain, I've replaced the Thunderwind stone. Ready whenever you are. Alrighty then. Get cracking, mateys. Way anchor. Aye, aye, Captain. Very nice. Get the ship moving. Let's get it. It's Kenjiro! I bet there's some money to be made on this trip. A lot of money. I'll just sneak on, they won't even notice. Bro, Kenjiro. You weird little man. Alright. So, first time in the game, we're leaving the island. We're going on to a different island. A different place. Very nice. Alright, so we're going to the Volcanic Isle. And... Yeah, like I said, we overleveled in between episodes, so this place should be fairly easy. Considering we're almost level 50, I think this place should be level fairly easy. I don't know though, I guess we'll see, right? Wow, I can't believe it. Who knew there was a path like this on the Volcanic Isle? The treasure must be further inside, right? Do you think the pilot is inside, Master? I've never been here before. What makes you think I would know? But there are footprints. It looks like someone's been here. That's right. Didn't Doppelin say that they were heading south to look for the sacred stones? These footprints could be theirs. Look at this. See? There's a treasure here after all. What the hell is this? It's just a lousy glass ball. Follow the narrow path. It leads to the, um... You can read this, Maya. It looks a lot like the letters we use in my village, but you can't read all of it. What does it mean? What are we supposed to do now? Ah, stupid Kenjiro. It's a good thing I tagged along. What the hell is this? 
Uh, Kenjiro, what are you doing here? I knew I'd make some money on this trip. I heard you at the pirate hideout, so I stuck on board. You stuck on board my ship? Well, well, we can't have that now, can we? Oh, just calm down, Captain. Don't, don't, don't do anything rash. There's only one way to deal with stowaways. It's not pretty. Sharon, I, I can help you if I'm dead. I've seen them before. The letters, the letters in the magic circle. I, I know them. If you kill me, you'll have no idea what it says. Is that so? You better be telling the truth for your sake. Well, speak up. What does it say? Let's see, um... I don't know. <laughs> That's it, let me add him. Well, let me finish. When I said that I knew the letters, I meant that I know the island they, where they came from. An island? Um, it's an island called Jinga. It's southeast of Kanza. There are giant ruins there. Really? I didn't think there were any inhabited islands in the southeast. You better not be lying. I'd be careful with my words if I were you. Got it? Yeah, yes, ma'am. I swear on my mother's grave that I'm telling the truth. I've done business with people there. Those letters are exactly the same as the ones they use there. What do you want to do, Aqua? If there's something on that island that'll help us make progress, we should go check it out. Kenjiro, you said that Jinga is southeast of Tanza, right? Aqua, does that mean you believe me? You're a smart man, alright? A smart man. Just what do you mean by that? You're surprised that he believed you, huh? If I find out you're lying, well... I'm not. I'm telling the truth. Honest. Well, I don't believe you, but Aqua seems to. You're the only one that knows the way. Back to the ship with you. You got a problem with that? I'd be happy to lop off the head right now. I don't have a problem, man. Jinga, the island of ruins. Could be lying, but should we try to find it anyway, Aqua? Yeah, we have to try. Alright, so apparently we're not coming here then. It looks like letters from Mizo, but I don't know what it says. According to saw. Okay. Okay. So there's nothing over here. We definitely just have to go to this island. Fine. Okay, so we have to go. Yeah, we have to go Hills of Giants, Jenga. And, a little spoiler alert, although it's not that big of a spoiler, we do get another character here. And our last character of the game. I'm pretty sure. And we're not going to be using him, so... But I'm just telling you, we're probably going to get a good character here. But this is a very, very cool place. Like, I... I said Yuno you know was my favorite place in this entire world. This is definitely my... Probably my second favorite place. Actually, no, my third. It's one of the statues revered by the people of Jango. I wonder if there's, like, encounters or, like, battles. Well, we might as well save. I mean, I would think there'd be battles here. Alright, so let's save right here. Hello? That's a big bird. That is a dragon. Yikes. What's that? Oh jeez. Hey, there's somebody right there. Interesting. I guess let's go see what is up. Well, let's check out what's over here. And there is because... I don't know, and also, I could probably just go to the shops and buy better equipment before if there's a fight here. But we're over level. Eh, whatever. Let's just go to him first and we'll check out everything else. I still have people here. Hmm, I, mean, I, I could go check out all the shops and stuff. Whatever, let's just go check whatever he's after first.
Leave this place, heathens. Silent Eagle. These people are different. They are nature speakers. Nature speakers? It is as the spirits predicted. Time has come. You are the nature speakers. I believe they call you the mystic stuff. What do you mean predicted? Spirit Rain told me that you would come to these islands. To these lands. Come with me, nature speakers. Chief Westwind, what of the tribal law? Does it does not our law forbid contact with those from the outside? Do not let that concern you now, Silent Eagle. Come. There's much to tell and little time. Ah, uh, let's go inside. Bum, 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 bum. You came seeking answers, did you not? Something that only I would be able to answer, correct? Yes, we're trying to get further into the volcanic isle, but we're stuck. There's this place with letters carved into the ground and some kind of jewel in the center. You speak of the earth crest. You must sit on it. Is that it? The earth crest is a door, an entrance to a narrow passage, one through which only the cabell may pass. How do you know about the cabell? I have watched the world for many, many years now. Their legends have not passed yet from this island. The Cabell were a people that sought to control the world through magic. Control the world through magic? Are you of the Cabell, Cabell line? Never mind. I must be mistaken. Yeah, she is actually, so... That's a yikes. The Cabell believed they were chosen. They even called themselves the Chosen Ones. And what they craved was power. With each new power they acquired, they lost a bit of their humanity. By that time they controlled nature, even life and death itself, they believed themselves all-powerful. If the Cabell were destroyed... How? The Cabell were destroyed by humans. Their arrogance proved to be their downfall. The Cabell were overconfident in their powers. They started to believe that they were not human, but gods. At least that was their claim. The rest of humanity feared their control. They wanted to save the world and it compelled them to action. The ability, the ability to survive, enjoyed by all humanity, had been weakened in the Cabell due to their dependence on magic. So when the wars began, the Cabell were indeed powerful, but were lacking something. Humanity prevailed in the end. When the fighting was over, the world was a little bit more than a wasteland. It was ages before the world returned to normal. Our one tribal law is as old as the leg as that legend. We can have nothing to do with the outside world. That is our law. From our perspective, the outside world is full of heathens. Getting involved would make us impure as well. These tablets were created by our ancestors so that we could communicate with the spirits, but I am the only one left that is able to communicate now. Nature speakers, the spirit told me that you would come here and why. If the legends of my ancestors are true, you are searching for the altar of fire on the volcanic isle. However, you will never reach it unless you go through the earth crest. What's this? This is the blue sky shard. With this, the earth crest should lead you to the altar of fire. There is one more thing. I would like you to take Silent Eagle with you. Chief Westwind, but why? The end is quickly approaching. We can no longer sit by idle and idly and watch. The time has come to act. Our tribe lives on this world too. We are part of this world, Silent Eagle. You, the most noble and strongest of our warriors, are the only one fit to complete this task. Nature Speakers, what you say. Let's take him on. We'd be happy to have him. Are you willing to fight with us? I cannot. I will follow the orders of Chief Westwind, but I will not follow you. 
You must help each other, Silent Eagle. You are hereby exempt from the law until your task is complete. But listen to me, Silent Eagle. The law applies only to the living. If the world is destroyed, there will be no living and the law will be useless. Um, Silent, I do not wish for you to call me by that name. You may call me... Let's call him Aim. Aim is fine. I like that name. Yeah. Why don't I just call you Aim, okay? Fine. Nature Speakers, we have many valuable items that can only be found here. Some may prove to be useful in your journey. However, we have no use for money from the outside. If you have something of equal value, you may be able to trade it. Ain has joined the party. Okay, so we can't use money here. That's new. Okay, so we took we got Silent Eagle. Um. Um. Yeah. Okay. Something about nicknames. Okay, so we got Ain. Like I said, new character. Um, we're not going to use him. Um, let's see. How, what's his level? Level 46. That's actually, that kind of shows you how overleveled we really are. Because basically, whenever you get a new character, they're supposed to be a lot stronger than your other characters. Just to make up for, like, um, the spike in the next dungeon. But all of our characters are almost equal to his level. So that just shows how like over leveled we are, which is nice. So let's quickly check out the rest of this town. Um, this place is so stupidly big that I kind of don't really know how to traverse this place, but um, we'll figure it out. Okay, so this is a dead end over here, and I do want to check out this entire place in this episode. So. I'm guessing this is probably another dead end, but I'm going to check every single. Okay, so it's not it's a dead end, but at least it's a chest. Restore Blossom. It's a good healing item, but once again, I mean really useless. This place is huge, man. Alright, so this is the center that leads to the main temple, so on the two wings, there should be the um, Donald Eagle is the strongest member of our tribe, who will be proved to be an invaluable asset. I'm sure he will, although I will not use him, so that sucks. Okay, so I guess let's check out this area first. So, the only place on the left here is up here, but there are two, so two ways. Let's check out this way first, and then I know there's a building up there, so what is this? There are giant... Okay. So I'm guessing that's just the lookout spot. So let's, let's check out what is over here. Oh, didn't we already check out? There's... Okay, so there's nothing over here. It's kind of dead end. Let's go check out our first shop slash uh, building. I don't know what this is. I'm guessing it's a shop, but... Yeah, it looks like a shop because there's like stuff here. Heal bottle. Let's see if we can steal anything else. Those are very big beds. Okay, let's see what you have to sell. Uh, so that when the black sun swells the world, the nature speakers will come. You'll be the one with whom he speaks. I have rocks and leather gathered by ancestors. Would you like to trade? Okay, so we can trade. Let's go ahead and trade. Um, let's trade two. And we don't really have any of these. Okay, let's trade for five of those. Trade for seven of those. Okay. Let's see what we can trade with this guy. Okay, so we can't trade any, any of this. Okay, so that's... Here we can only trade. Now, I was hoping we could trade maybe materials for weapons. But it looks like they only take weapons for other weapons, which is kind of... Um... Literally just last episode we Jeez, we're getting lost. Just last episode we basically sold all of our extra weapons. I mean those weapons were very, very weak, so I don't think they would even take them here. But still. 
Okay, let's check out. Okay, there's nothing over here. There's nothing on that side. Let's check out this building. I'm guessing these people probably trade for healing items. Alright, so we have... Oh, this one's for food. Okay, we have we have a bit of every food, so we don't need anything from here. Okay. So here we can trade for healing items. Restore leaf. Um, let's get out of here. Okay, there's nothing over there. Let's make sure we didn't miss anything. Let's go all the way down here. All the way down. Anything over here. Okay, so there is another set of stairs. Anything over here? Doesn't look like it. it might be another chest. Nope. Okay, set up this these stairs. Yeah, this looks like another building. Probably nothing over here, right? Nope. Alright, let's see. I'm guessing this is just maybe a house. I don't think these guys sell anything. Maybe. Oh, so this is this is um, Ains. Must be okay. These are Ains. This is Ains' house. His parents. It doesn't look like there's anything special in there though. Alright everybody, so um, I think we finished up with what we have here. Now we can go back to the Volcanic Isle, but we're going to be doing that uh, after we get this chest. Silver Brom. After this next episode, not yet. Yeah, next episode guys, so um, yeah I think we did enough for today. We found, we went to Derek's Haunt. Uh, we went to the Volcanic Isle, and we got a new character, which is really, really nice. So guys, if you did enjoy watching, make sure to like the comments for the channel, and I'll see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye. Hey everybody, how's it going? Uh, today we're going to be continuing Legea 2, and going to the Volcanic Isle. So we last episode we picked up a new character, who can uh, help us get through here, because that's why, we, yeah, we got blocked, and blah blah blah. If you want to know the plotline, you can watch past episodes. Let's go ahead and go in here. It's like repeat like half an hour of stuff. So let's go ahead and save. And yeah, this is what we had to get a new character to get through. This, this is the Earth Crest. It had symbols on it that we couldn't read. The Earth Crest. It's glowing. And we went to the village chief or whatever, and he gave us a blue shard. Ooh, and that teleports us. Are we inside the volcanic isle? Ah, oh, looks like we are. Very nice. Okay, so yeah, we got that blue shard. Um, I'm guessing we gotta go this way. Oh, we gotta get up there. And there's new encounters, so let's take a look at the new encounters. No. Oh, we got first strike. Uh, Ab Abyss, Abyss, and Lava Drakes. Okay, let's see how strong these things are. Now, we did over a level ourselves before we came here. Sky Fang, that's a new ability. Okay, so that's a new ability. Let's go ahead and try that one out, and then let's go ahead and just do Battle Flash, and just do something like that. Let's go ahead and do that on the Abyss Gigas. No, let's do it again. The big. I don't know how strong this thing is. Okay, this thing is actually really strong. Man, but we do quite a bit of damage. It's actually surprising. The only thing that sucks is Lang is gonna do his hyper arm on an enemy that. Oh wait, no, no, we might kill it. We're probably gonna kill it actually. Yeah, we're gonna kill it. I see. It'd be a shame if he did his hyper arm on an enemy that's like one percent. Yeah, we literally one shot the thing, which is amazing. That. It truly means we're really over level right now, which is nice. Okay, Sky Fang. Pretty good. And we definitely kill him. Okay, guys, this is gonna be an easy time. Yeah, I didn't I didn't realize we were this over level. Like, these enemies are supposed to at least take two to three turns to kill. We're literally just just destroying this thing. Okay guys, so we finished off that battle. Once again, enemies not really that hard, which is very, very nice. Probably could have came here to grind, honestly, but it's fine. We're already so overleveled. So now, I don't really know how to get past. I'm guessing this has to do something with aim because he's super strong. Hmm, it looks like we can't go any further unless we can move this rock. You're joking, right? How are we going to move that? Okay, so obviously Lane can't do it. Uh, it won't budge. Yeah, it will do. Or I will do it, not it will do. So our boy Ains got it. He's a mystic too, so. No, he's, no, actually, he's not a mystic. He's not a mystic. He's just spirit. He's not a mystic, though. Whoa. Hey, you're pretty useful. Tab around. We should hurry. 
can do so serious? Wow. Okay, everybody, so it's a couple of hours later. I had to leave and do something real quick. So yeah, let's keep going. We push this rock over. Let's move forward. And see what is ahead of us. Uh, let's go down this path first, I guess. And let's see if we have any more new encounters. We probably will. You're just a big fish but Garb Supra. Huh. These are like the advanced... The other ones are like Kelv something. Let's keep going. I'm guessing it's literally a dead end. Okay. Thanks, game. Appreciate. Appreciate. Alright, let's continue. Let's see what is up here. So I guess let's take a left first. I'm guessing this is probably another dead end. No. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. It's like another puzzle. Let's push that rock. Ah, why does a puzzle room have encounters, man? So we have a lot of MP restoring items. Okay, so now do we... Oh, and then do we raise this with stone? Yeah. Oh, yeah, and then we push it that way. That makes sense. No, we didn't go the right path. Like, the... Uh, oh. Oh, okay, so this just takes us to a chest room. Okay. Mind bottle. Form bottle. Okay, cool, I guess. Alright, so this... Okay, so I was right. The right was, like, the way we were supposed to go. This is just kind of like the treasure path. So we'll go all the way back. Camping kit. Okay. Means we're getting close to the end. So let's quickly have a rest. Get all of our stuff back up. Let's go have a cook. Let's cook some stone curry. And then let's have a few chests to kind of see what's going on. Ain, you're so big, but you don't eat any more than we do. Is there something wrong with that? I thought you'd eat twice or three times as much. 
I couldn't eat that much. What kind of food do you like? What do you hate? I don't like hot food, and I don't like meat either. Really? That's a surprise. You look like you go wolf down a whole cow. Meat clouds your soul. A cloudy soul distorts your heart. A distorted heart leads to corruption. Oh my goodness, he's back to the way he was when we first met him. I've been eating your cooking, and now it's my turn to cook for you all. Let's do it. Hey, you can cook? Sure, sounds great. What do you cook? Tell me, what are you saying? Don't tell me. What's the matter, Sharon? Well, just look at him. Who knows what kind of things he eats? Get real. You make Ain sound like some kind of monster. He's our friend, isn't he? I'm only thinking of you. Would I give you bad advice? Now I'm telling you, you've got to dip this in the bud. What is it, Sharon? Can't wait to try the cooking, huh? Yes, I wasn't saying anything. Don't worry, I'll make plenty so you can have second helpings. Aqua, so you're uh, I don't care really about this dialogue. Um, anything else? Yeah, went on like see, see, blah blah blah. Okay, did he give us a new recipe by chance? Probably down here if it is. Okay, yeah, this is his stuff. Okay. Um, let's make wild wild beef. I don't know if this like overrides the other one. Um. But let's eat this for now, I guess. Okay, let's quickly save, and we can get on and see. We might be at the end of the volcanic. I don't. I mean, I don't even want to call this a dungeon, but it is a dungeon. Let's see. Let's continue. All right, this might be it, guys. Made it to another one of these. Let's see if this takes us to the final. Uh, looks like it did. To the final. Oh, this place is. Oh man, the graphics here are trippy. Like the dimensions are I weird. Won't lose. Okay, do we get new? No, so we don't get new enemies here. Ah. It is this one. Easy. Y'all thought you were playing around us. Uh. Alright, I guess let's take this way first. Can we punch this in? Can we do anything with this? No? Okay, we can't do anything with that. Okay, let's go this way, I guess. Okay, so there's a teleportation. See what's inside here. Okay. Puzzle. Okay, easy enough. Uh, push this one. Push it. Then push this one. Then push this one. If you do it in the other order, you won't have room to push this one. So, yeah, just like that. Now, I don't know what's on the other way, but let's just take this and see where we go. Oh, we go down. Okay. Alright, you know what we're gonna do? Let's just drop um, a Heaven's Path. And let's go back up. I wanna see what the other way. Oh, of course, you drop a Heaven's Path and I still get encounters. out of me. So that was literally it, just that little, oh my god, it's so annoying. I had to walk all the way back and forth just for that stupid item. Whatever. At least we got it. We can say we're trying to 100% this game, so that's fine. Let's walk and see what's over here, but first the encounter. Okay, another puzzle.
you. Oh, we got new enemies. Blaze wheels, huh? I'm guessing this is final puzzle. Alright, there we go. Easy peasy. No problem. Better give us some good loot. Warlock symbol. Life syringe. Okay. Don't know if any of those are any good. Can I actually let's go look at our items? No, because I don't really care that much, honestly. Oh, I forgot, so we're gonna go next. Oh, definitely. Okay, probably. I'm just gonna take a wide guess and say that probably coming up next is a boss fight. So, we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna go ahead and rest. We're gonna cook. And we are gonna do... We're definitely gonna go on the attack and defense. There we go. Let's just chat real quick. Uh, wasn't it? Yeah, no doubt cutting through the sea. Uh, that a boy like I've got how we start our own little pirate. No, I don't want to start my own pirate. You could be a captain, Aqua, and I could be the captain's girl. What do you say? Excuse me? What, what do you want? We're trying to get Source Forge back, remember? Okay, but can't a girl dream for a while? What do you think? Okay, just pirate talk. Let's go ahead and save real quick. Because I'm almost 99% sure that there's a boss fight coming up. So, let's go ahead and save. Why these encounters are so annoying sometimes? Come on, man, I'm trying to get the boss. Leave me alone. Better make sense or not. Not none. Uh, give me another encounter? Okay, good, good. Please don't. Okay, I was like, please give me the encounter. Hey, there's Elliot and Marianne. Very nice. How you doing? We found you. We've been looking for you everywhere. I worked up quite an appetite. We've heard rumors about you in every town we pass through. First, you steal the sacred azure stone from Bishop Doblin. Now you're after the sacred burning stone. Your greed will be the death of you. I don't think I can for you. I don't think I can forgive you now. It's time to put a lot of you in your place once and for all. Ready or not, it's time to pay the piper. I really hoped that we would become friends, you and I. It's such a shame. Give it up, big brother. People of our status shouldn't be friends scum like him. He might have been a subordinate. No, a slave. No, more like a pet. Or a toy for our amusement. Why? Why do you want to fight us? We don't, we don't want to hurt anyone. Why do you want to fight us? We don't want to hurt anyone. Can you believe this crap? That was a brilliant performance, Marianne. You should be an actress. Gee, thanks, Elliot. If you think I should, then maybe I should think about it. Sigh, I'm through playing. Give us back the Sacred Azure Stone. Forget it. 
I knew you'd say that. The rock belongs to Dapo and you can't just go around stealing. Don't you know anything? What do you think you'll be able to do with it anyway? You've seen the Black Sun. The Black Sun is going to erase the filthy past and everything we don't like. Won't it be wonderful? It'll only be a short time before our perfect world is born. Why don't you just hand over the secret of your stone? I'll tell you what, we'll even let you live. For the short amount of time you'll have left on this miserable world. No, we're not gonna hand that crap over, dude. Fight me. I can't give it back. The future depends on it. The future? You don't have a future. We're here now, in the present, and you have to deal with us. So, what I get for trying to show them mercy, my brother. I know, Mary Yang. You gave them one last chance. They were just too stupid to take it. I grow tired of this chatter, my brother. Let's kill them. I agree. Alright. Let's go. The least you can do is die a horrible but memorable death for us. Alright, bro. Go ahead and uh, flaming fist them. Uh, let's go ahead and big bang and aqua spear. Let's do Marianne. And let's go ahead and lightning arrow. There we go. Eliminate. This should hopefully do quite a bit. Of It's not even that much damage. That wasn't really a lot of damage, honestly. Now, what is a lot of damage? My origins. My origins are better. I mean, not gonna lie, Elliot's a good but... Yeah, he's not exactly. Much damage. 600 damage for a hyper art? Bro, get that crap out of my face. Got a flaming fist. Go ahead and life blessing. And do another lightning arrow. Let's get it. People are on low health. This might hurt. Is anyone dead? Beautiful. Crap. I don't know if Sharon's dead or not. I, I couldn't see. I'm hoping she's not. She might be though. Yeah, Sharon's dead. That's fine. I'm just gonna go ahead and do another flaming fist, and then do. Yeah, it's gonna go ahead and uh, revive Sharon. <laughs> I 
wonder why Maya went first this time. Her speed is a lot lower. Fear. Persecuted because we are mystics. Yes. Everything was hateful back then. Well, doesn't it make and sense Dr. that took us under his people wing. hated you? We, who you were don't like it? By even so all of a sudden parents. being pretentious? Elliot, I don't know, man. Those people were not our parents. Seems like really weird thinking, Only honestly. Dolphin. Only Dolphin has shown us real love. That's exactly right, Marianne. Dolphin is our one and only father. So what are you gonna do about For him? his sake as well. No, you're gonna die for his sake then. We must get rid of this filth! Alright, well clearly. Enough of this! Clearly you're losing, so who's getting rid of who you feel me? We will burn all of you alive while you beg for mercy! It's not gonna happen. She's <laughs> literally doing no damage. She's doing like 400 damage, it's not even like... This is so stupid. I guess we're just gonna have to, uh, you know, beat the crap out of them a little bit. Go ahead and get rid of Marianne. Marianne's the really annoying one, so we're gonna... I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of her first. Let's do Blood Spark and then Riot Flag, that, and then that. I'm the stupid little girl. Oh, she's short. Crap, so my attack's nice. That's a little bit more. Ready? 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 At least only a few attacks, but it's not really This is a really cool move, but um, yeah, the damage just stopped. 
that we get in a heal before they attack. Easy, 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 easy. Flaming Fist. Go ahead and, um... Hmm. You know what, we're gonna, uh, give MP. What is it? Where's the MP? 200 MP. We're gonna give that to Sharon, and Sharon is gonna go ahead and use, um... Yeah, a silver broom. Yeah. Break up. And since she's fast and goes first, um, there's basically no way they can kill us. Like, we just healed out of what they did to us. So, are you afraid of the dark? Unless they did, did that not heal? Am I losing my brain? Did that not heal? That might be an issue. If that didn't heal. That might be an issue. Um. Beautiful. Okay. How come no one's healed? That doesn't make any sense. No one's healed. Is that because they're spellbound? Is that a thing? Yo, I guess we just have to use Maya's origin. Unless Marianne dies right now. If Marianne dies, I think uh, we can we can maybe attack first and resurrect. If not, we might be dead. We're probably dead, honestly. We're probably dead. We survived it! Crap, two That is a lot of XP. That is pretty annoying that two characters didn't get that amount of XP. Dang it. Whatever, we survived. Elliot. Where? I can't see you. Yeah, you're dead. Marianne. Oh, my dear brother, thank goodness you're right, but I think I'm... Marianne, don't die on me. It's, it's almost here. Our perfect little world is almost... My dearest brother, I don't want to leave your side. Marianne, Marianne, don't... don't Leave me alone. I want. I was proud to be. Yeah, maybe you shouldn't have been an idiot. Marianne, yeah, nobody cares because you're both dead. Because you're both stupid. Like honestly, I would feel. Don't worry, little sister. You won't be alone for long. I would feel a little bit bad if like. How do I say this? If they weren't jerks. 
I'll be joining you soon. Wait for me. Right? Like, again, if they were maybe nice, like, hey, can you just hand it over? If you don't hand it over, yeah, we'll have to fight you because, like, Lord Doplin is kind of our dad. But, like, instead they went the route of, let's just destroy this filthy scum, blah, blah, blah. Like, broke it out of here. They left us no choice. We had to fight. I, I didn't think they'd fight to the death. We could have reached an agreement. We could have all lived together. No, but they're too stupid to do that. What are you talking about? These two are fighting for something they thought was important enough to die for. Their own family, a place to live, it might have been pride, I don't know, but they had something. They fought for it with their lives, the same as you. You're fighting for something that you're willing to die for. It's not your fault they're dead. Two sides, both willing to die for their cause. Somebody had to win. What? Why are you looking at me like that? Am I wrong? No, I was just surprised to hear such a philosophical, philosophical interpretation. I wasn't trying to be phil philosophical. It's just how I see it, nothing more. fighting to protect something important. That's right, we're protecting something that's even more important than our own lives, right? Absolutely, we can't stop here, we can't quit. If we do, it'll bring sadness to a lot more people than us. This is something, something that only we can do. Come on, everyone, let's go. Alright, guys, so, real quick, I am actually gonna... Stinky... You know, I'm just gonna do this just in case we face an encounter. I don't think we will. We're gonna go back and try to save. So guys, we're gonna continue on with this next episode. So guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as it supports my channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.